Hello, gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Mwah. Mm -hmm. Mwah. How are we doing, lovely? All right, how are you? We have, uh, genuinely, we have actually only just kind of so sat, sat down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sat Ooh. down to actually have a... Hello, how are Hello. you? I know, it's, always, it's been busy, busy. It is, that's because it's going to be an amazing <gasps> show. Tell me about it. Have you seen my kids for this morning? Oh, your jewelry. <gasps> They're as well. gorgeous. Yeah, and and polar opposite, which is what I. Oh yeah, yeah, totally different. Very, very different in terms of their techniques. Twelve o'clock is going to be riveting. I'm I'm not just saying that. It is really going to be not just riveting, riveting as in fun. <laughs> riveting as in literal as in riveting. Literal riv riveting. Oh, it's going to be both, isn't it? It is. So what is riveting, Alison? So it's, cold, it's all about know. cold connections. So if you don't want to solder or you haven't got the facilities to solder, mm -hmm. you don't want the fire risk, um, this is the way to join metal together. There you go. Riveting, With cold connections. Rivet. With a rivet. With a rivet. Now, if you've never done that before, then Alison's your girl. She's yeah. going to walk you, talk you through it. And we've got the tools uh, um, and components to do it. We certainly have. Amazing. Well, let's talk about your nine o'clock kits because they're beautiful. Oh, they're stunning, aren't they? Talk about high-end jewellery. I mean, I love that triple necklace. Look at this necklace. It's unbelievable. I love it. Uh, it, I mean, it's uber high end. And yeah. also, can I just say, the more petite pearls... Yes. Most, you know, sometimes people think, OK, they're smaller pearls, they must be more affordable. Well, you know they always are here at Jewelry Maker, but normally, actually, your smaller pearls can command yeah. as high a price point as the extra large. Well, they've got... A, they've got much higher overhead for mm -hmm. size. Yep. They don't take as long, but the overhead, because if you think about it, all the setup and, and preparation Absolutely. goes for a lot shorter time than if you're doing it for a bigger pearl. And then you've got the, the higher risk when you actually yeah. drill them. Yes. So um, now these are meter long length strands in your nine o'clock kits. Um, also, and you might be thinking, oh, I spot some lovely colored gemstones yeah. in there. Yes, we have got the big four. So you have your sapphire, your emeralds, your tanzanite, and your ruby also coming up in your nine o'clock kit. So they That's are stunning. dreamy, absolutely dreamy kits. Um, at 10 o'clock today, fresh from his holidays, oh. we have got Master Troth hey. stepping into the studio and he's going to be looking all suntanned and everything, isn't he? <laughs> Just back Keep him over there. Yeah, I'm paling him. Uh, yeah, I, put, I slapped on the false tan this morning <laughs> so I don't look too feisty next to him. Um, yeah, coming from Turkey, we have got the wonderful Dave Gorgeous. bringing you some brand new jade. Yeah, unbelievable strands, but it is, oh. <coughs> excuse me, all about these new carvings. Aren't they sensational? Uh, in terms of bangles, we know that the bangle is creme de la creme, don't yeah. we? Um, but a bangle with a carving on top. Yeah. It's um, amazing. Yeah. And I think they're the deepest carvings. Yeah. Yeah, they that, are. That yeah. I've, I've, um, <clears throat> I've seen. Yeah. They're gorgeous. It's it, just so stunning. Absolutely amazing. I mean, look at the depth and the profile of that carving. It's unbelievable, isn't it? It's amazing. Absolutely unbelievable. We've got them in the two different colours. So let me just show you that one as well. So that's got the green and oh, the lavender. Beautiful. Oh, unbelievable. And they are the larger bangles as well, Ooh. for those of you that are, um, you know, you know uh, hand obvious. challenged. Well, 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 well aware of <laughs> like sizes, me. effectively. So, um, yeah, they slipped on. They slipped on very easily. So look at that lavender. That's got that's to be amazing. the most lavender bangle I've ever seen. I'm just going to ask the gallery to just talk to me a second. Ah, oh, there you go, there you go. Oh, have you found I them thought again? I thought I'd lost them for a second. Um, because we also do have a little treat as well, stepping in at the last minute as well. Yeah. Um, no baby yet, by the way, can oh. I just say? No baby yet, but Ross um, is at home looking after his uh, heavily pregnant fiance. And stepping in at the very last minute, we've got lovely Neary New. Hey. Hello, Neary. Ah, oh, well... Do you know? <laughs> uh, 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 yeah, Wayne texts me, or rather I text Wayne. I was like, oh, who's, who's producing tomorrow? And he was like, you've got Neary. I was like, yeah, it's going to be fun then. So we'll look after you, Neary, honest. Yeah. We're not so bad, you know. We're not as bad as they all make out. No, I hope they don't. <laughs> they no, don't actually you make couldn't us possibly out. be. Um, so, yes, Neary's producing. We've got the lovely, the gorgeous Adam as well directing. Woo! Hello, Adam. <laughs> the smoothest director in yeah. the premises. Ooh, Do you like that? Smooth. He is smooth. It's the wheel. It's it's not the wheel spin. Sorry, the chair spin. I think <laughs> that yeah. title. Um, sporting his fresh 
Very crisp, dapper USA t-shirt. Gorgeous Dan is Yay! in the building. Love it. We call him Cowboy Dan. Um, who is this? So, uh, who, who? Is, I went to New York, the USA national team. USA national team. The Women's World Cup shirt. I didn't even realise. Oh, there we go. Oh. Men's shirt, but for the women's Men's shirt, but for the women's team uh, as well. Well done. Supporting the women. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Looking very dapper, isn't he? Um, and he told me the price of that. I was like, oh, that's me. Oh, <laughs> Sportswear though, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Always very expensive. That's why they keep changing it as well. Yeah, it's every season. for the club, yeah. Oh, of course it is, yeah, of course. Saying that, that's like go, sending your kids back to school. Oh, yeah. Goodness New me. uniform. Goodness me. I'm back <laughs> on that one, Adam. <laughs> to be fair, they keep growing. They yeah, that, yeah, kids. yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, by the time, like, I remember the days when I was in school. Sorry, I will let go of this one, Adam, because we were talking about it earlier on. I remember the days when I was in school, you could sew on the badges, couldn't you? Or iron them on. Can't yeah, you yeah, yeah. You're not. No, you have to buy the actual... Mind you, mind you, when I was in school, they had proper school outfitters. So you couldn't get it from the supermarkets and stuff. You had to go to the shop that sold the school well, outfit. this is what Willow's school's like. Oh, so is it? So we've you buy, buy the cardigans that you can't just get the ones yeah. from the supermarket. Um, anyway, it costs, I, I wouldn't mind, but it'll be lost within a week. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it is going to be an absolute incredible Sunday. It truly is. Those bangles are breathtakingly yeah. beautiful. Um, yeah, in terms of to get a bangle, we know that is the pinnacle. We know that is like the optimum in the jade mm. world. Um, but to have one that is also master carved like this. Okay. Unbelievable. So that's at 10 o'clock, lovely people. This hour, I've got a tea bar of dreams. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Before I get into this hour, actually, I want to show you these that are coming up round about 11 o'clock. Oh, I love They're these. They're amazing, aren't they? These are... You I'll know what? Because I, I think most people would say, oh, right, you know, Marlers, tassels, earrings, Definitely man. Definitely earrings. earrings. Definitely earrings. And you've got two different designs in them as well. Fabulous. They're coming up separately. And, ooh, oh. I like that. That's bold, says Tom. Um, do you know what? We haven't got a lounge hour this hour. So he says, I could, Elle, put them on pre-order. Oh, that might be a bit dangerous. It, it's risky, but I reckon Neary walks on the wild side. Oh, uh, yeah. D dangerous <laughs> is middle name. Is that right, Neary? <laughs> <laughs> Why, why did I just have a picture of Danger Mouse in my mind? Sorry, but I, I, I love Danger Mouse. Yeah, yeah. Does, Danger. That, does that make Adam Penfold? Ah, uh, <laughs> what do you reckon, Adam? Penfold, <laughs> Penfold was was actually my favourite character. <laughs> I liked Penfold. Was he a hamster? I think he was a hamster. I think he was a hamster. <laughs> Shall we put them on, on pre-order? Yeah. Yeah. Now these are nine two five sterling silver. Really? Yeah. Hang on, let me just double check that. Yeah. Solid 925 sterling silver, and I can tell oh, you they're wow. weighty as well. Look at how beautiful. Oh. Lots of items going on pre-order, says Neary News. So keep an eye um, on the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Um, so you can shop ahead, yeah. 8.6 grams of silver in these tassels. Wow. How amazing. They're separate as well. Yeah. But you're going <clears> to <you're throat> expect that, aren't you? You, you? You've got to with that amount of, of tasselage. They're going to look amazing. Tasselage. Tossage. They are really going to look amazing. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Lovely, aren't they? <gasps> Coming up a little bit later on in the show, so you can shop ahead on these. If I oh, get amazing. those, I'm going to have to get somewhere to go out. <laughs> That's it. You, you book the occasion after. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Amazing. So, um, and as always, lovely jewellery makers, we want a thoroughly interactive show. Text yeah. in. Come and say hi. Tell us what you're up to this Sunday. Hopefully you're with us for the foreseeable, um, because it is going to be an absolute cracker of a Sunday. What are you up to? The sun's out now, isn't it? It is. It's going to be a nice, be a nice week. week. Yeah. yeah. I'm off to see my mum after work, oh, so I'm nice. excited about that. Nice drive. Yeah, drive down to Wales, go see mum, take her out for a coffee or something oh. like that. Oh, lovely. Um, okay, shall we get cracking? Yes. Because it is going to be incredible. The tea bar of dreams. What's that? Sorry? Yes. I have got an amazing strand of Iolite. Yeah. Are we wow. going to start with that? That's a good place to start. Wow. And I tell you what, the strand that it's alongside looks amazing too. Uh, doesn't it just? Well, both sides. <gasps> I'm, I'm into both sides of it. I'm just going to scoochy, scoochy, scoochy yeah. that there. Oh, <gasps> isn't that stunning? Let me just put these two alongside it as well because... Oh, well, there you go. I'll have that kit. There you go. Alison, oh. have this kit. Yes, please. 
That's lovely, isn't it? <laughs> How amazing. Natural iolite, beautiful pleochroic gemstone, which means it gives mm. you flashes of colours from different angles. Um, and yeah, I've got to say, you can't bring iolite to air without mentioning the fact that this was a gemstone that the Vikings used to navigate to, across the vast open oceans with. I know, it's, it's like amazing. A, it's like a, a beautiful sundial. Yeah. Effectively. Um, I right. I've seen iolite for ages. A long time, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're right. We rarely ever see it. It's a really unique blue, isn't yeah. it? It's like an indigo blue. Let's start this show as we mean to go on. 42 oh. carats of this beautiful indigo. It's like a purpley deep blue. £12.99. Wow. Totally and utterly natural. Have we got quantity then? I wonder how many times I'm going to call Tom Ross. <laughs> That's fine. You'll probably call me Carol. It's all good. I don't mind. I don't mind. Um, how many got then? Neary new? 40 chances. Hang on. Uh, uh, he also said in my ear, I'm still in clearance mode. Sorry, Elle. I'm still in clearance mode. I shouldn't be because technically speaking, it's not a clearance day. <laughs> However, that's a clearance price if ever I've seen one. Six. Oh, he's been undecisive right now. Oh. Okay, Five you are definitely days. still in clearance mode. Look at the quality of the iolite. It's nice to see people up early, bright and early this morning. Absolutely, early bird and all Dragging that. Dragging the bass. <sighs> <laughs> oh, he's singing, he's so happy this he, morning. I know. You thought you were going to have a nice lie in this Sunday, didn't you? But yeah. no, no, Neary, get get your little bottom into the into the gallery. We need you. We need you. <laughs> Drops everything. <laughs> yeah. Cancel cancel your trip to B&Q. That's where he was off to. I think really it's actually, by, judging by the, how, how uh, Tom was actually talking about going to B&Q, I reckon it's actually a preference. That yeah. I, I like a trip to B&Q. I don't think he's going to have got out of it, though. No, I think this afternoon <laughs> you're still going to B&Q. You know yeah. that, don't you? Um, amazing. <laughs> I like it. I get quite excited wandering around the brush aisle. <laughs> the paint tile. The paint tile. Yeah. I, oh, I like it. the tools. Oh, I like a gadget tools, tool. Yeah. Plants. Love it. Oh, I like the garden section. Yeah. Tom's like always lagging section. behind. Like, oh, are you done yet? No. <laughs> need to go look at the road. Grab a mooch. Yeah. Have a little wander. Uh, Four ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe I should go with your lovely wife. We don't. We don't. We'd spend hours in B and Q. You do know that it's a bit low when people are buying twos, threes. <laughs> <laughs> this time of the morning. Amazing. Anna, oh. well done to you. Congratulations, Jane, Miss Janet, Sarah. Lots of threes and twos. Una, Vera. Got a message coming through. Hi, Jane. Hi, Good Jane. morning, Alison, Ellen, crew. Thanks for the spreadsheet, Alison. Looking oh. forward to today's goodies and demos. You're welcome. Don't forget, fill them in as soon as you get them. What? So we did a pricing spreadsheet. And, and I've, I've got a few more to send out. Because I've had some recently. Yeah, we did it on the last show. A pricing spreadsheet. Yeah, so basically I broke down how I price stuff. Oh, okay. And I okay. Sent, sent it out to them because I had a bundle of 16 strands of... of yeah. Profit per Take bead. everything down per bead ah, and then... What was see. it? Something we, we got up to about £600 from the £47 kit. Oh, there kit. we go. That's pretty good, isn't it? Hello, yeah. Vera, saying I like goes amazing with sunstone. Ooh, Absolutely, nice. yeah. Because sunstone's got an internal performance as well, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, morning, Al, Alison and crew. Looking forward to today's show. Oh, oh. Vera, it's going to be an absolute cracker. Thank you for your it message. Is. It's lovely to hear from you. Um, amazing, amazing. Let's do... Oh, serpentine, Love this. but not not as we know it. See, when you think no. serpentine, normally I think rounds. I don't think I've ever seen it in in. We call them hearts or or, or big drops. Um, so, um, um, I'm gonna say drops. I'd I'd say drops, but sometimes they get a heart, don't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, it could be. I suppose a little bit of wire work. Beautiful iolite. You've got this lovely deep forest green. Oh, you were right, as a yeah, Sometimes they're a heart, aren't sometimes they? Sometimes they are a little heart. Yeah, I can see that though too. Uh, beautifully checkerboard, faceted front Stunning. and reverse. Rarely ever see serpentine. Rarely no. ever. It's a really beautiful deep green colour. Seventeen ninety nine. Seventeen ninety nine. This will be lovely with the pearls that are coming up. Oh with. yes. I tell you what, what, let's do another clearance deal, shall we? Technically, we are not in a clearance show, <laughs> but then again, it is eight o'clock, so. I'd I'd strand it on with those those clear quartz. Yeah, they'd be lovely. Be lovely. Or with the pink. Oh yeah. 
pink with that green is lo oh You're making kits again aren't yeah you? yeah amazing oh, making kits for you well <sighs> The old days, that is, I was ah. back in the old days ah. when we used to build kits and whatnot. R round about now, you were giving me an interview and naming Humphrey. I was. I'll never forget that. <laughs> never forget that phone call. To get you in, please. Yeah. You need to come in and see us because you need to be one of the jewellery maker team. And the, the rest is history. <laughs> no, we can't get rid of me. We wouldn't <laughs> want to get rid of you, Murray, darling. Definitely not. Uh, $6.99. Oh Goodness me. Um, oh and if you God. are thinking, okay, uh, how would you incorporate into a necklace? You could also use these maybe as your cabochons because it has that yes. level of opacity to oh, it. Make a nice ring. Yeah, gorgeous. Wow. Have we got many of these then, Nirinu? About 25, he says. Una, David, well done to you. Derbyshire, Carol, Jane, five new customers. Well done. <gasps> We've got some lovely soda light. Yeah, amazing soda light. Um, and again, I always say this. Historically, I was never a massive fan of soda light. Oh, really? But. 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 It, then, it wasn't soda light like this. Ah, uh, yeah. You know, do you know I what I mean? This. Where it has that almost lapis blue. Really <coughs> yeah. deep, deep, deep blue. Um, but it's a pretty strand. This again it with is. your pearls, Alison, would be absolutely amazing, wouldn't it? Perfect with the pearls. Do you know I was never a fan of pearls till I started working here. Really? Yeah. We soon changed that. Oh then, yeah. Look how That's beautifully beautiful together. Yeah. Amazing. Alongside your soda light. Um, he's the man with the deals. Near he knew. Absolutely. <gasps> yeah. You've stepped, you've slotted wow. into an amazing Sunday show. Yeah. Tell you what, I bet you Wayne didn't have to ask you too hard, did he? Nah, <laughs> didn't think so. Because it is going to be an amazing Sunday. £4.99, love so delight. Absolutely love it. Like I said, it used to be a lot paler, a lot more wishy-washy yeah. back in the day. Still nice, don't get me wrong, but... This is dramatic. I, yeah, I prefer that deeper colour. I mean, I love so delight. Jeans and a T-shirt. Yeah. Perfect. Dress it up. Dress it down. It's a great gem, a great gemstone. Yeah. Pair of, hang on, I've gone into American mode. Pair of sneakers. Oh, sneakers. Or plimp soles. <laughs> plimp soles. Plimp soles. There we go. Wear them with your plimp soles, or as we used to call them back in Wales, pumps. Yeah, pumps. Pumps. <laughs> pumps. I remember calling um, a pair of like or daps, you know. Uh, and Tom's like, what? What daps? Yeah, pumps. You know, pumps. <laughs> daps. So what on earth are you talking about? Pumps, daps, <laughs> pumps, black ones with the elastic yeah. on the sides that you stuff for bit PE, yeah. Aren't they? Do you call them that? Daps? <laughs> no, they're not pumps. They're daps. Those are the black ones with the elastic. Are daps? <laughs> pumps. <laughs> Ooh, let's do. Oh, the clovers. Yeah, very, 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 very Ashley Clark. Now we have yeah. the Versa Jade version yesterday, and they absolutely flew out. Um, an amazing amount of sterling silver. Um, so basically, a little bit of arrangement inspired by the likes of your Alhambra. I know these were only launched quite recently, weren't they? Um, with last week um, with Carol. Um, these have got oh, your lovely. malachite, beautiful quality malachite. Yeah. So if I, yeah, very Alhambra inspired without the Alhambra um, price tag. Alison, was it you that had these? I feel like um, it was. no Debbie Kershaw. Debbie Kershaw. No, I, I haven't had these with the with the surround. I've had them without the surround, mm -hmm. but I think that just frames them perfectly. How doesn't gorgeous! It? Now, if you if Stunning. you take a little mooch in Alhambra, uh, in sorry, in Van Cleef and Arpels, let's just say you're not going to get much change from a few thousand pounds, um, and it is certainly one of their most iconic designs. All that sterling silver, and by the way, the sterling work, silver work on the reverse is equally as beautiful. It is, isn't it? And you do get all five of them. Um, so, yeah, you, there's your malachite one. So you get three of the malachite, and then you get two, which include a zircon Lovely. inside. Um, there's only a handful of these left. They were only launched three. There you go. Um, they were only oh. launched last week. They have been incredibly popular. All you need to do is basically attach them with your jump rings yeah. or wrap loops, whatever you wish. Um, 39.99 is a big gram weight of sterling silver in these as well, and top premium quality malachite. Hello, sorry. Meant oh. to have a hospital point appointment today but can't move oh bless you keep me uh please keep fingers crossed and um, they can do it over the phone so i don't have to cancel oh, oh bless got your everything heart crossed for you bless you yes yeah, sending you lots and lots yeah. and lots of love lots of love you take um care. yeah look after yourself my darling yeah and keep keep on them they can sort it for you yeah. as well um barry's looking forward to chain mail the chain oh, mail demo we're doing the cross are we that's amazing we're doing that 
There you go, Barry. Well, that's coming up. Can you I'm just oh, about to see on. it peeking over? Oh, there you go. Oh, that's lovely. It's Celtic like a cross key as well, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, key Celtic cross. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Um, sorry, what was that, Leary? <gasps> yes, I have. This Ooh. is incredible quality. Amazing, full of labradescence. Look at those flashes. Yeah. Oh, like the Aurora Borealis trapped within a gemstone, Labradorite, yeah, just fascinating. We're like moths to a flame with this gem. Um, it has dark moodiness to it and then tiny microscopic platelets that form naturally within this gemstone capture the light and give you this what we call phenomena. Um, the more of the phenomena, the more desirable the Labradorite is, and this is premium grade. Um, I love the irregular cuts. Whoa. Yeah, that, that's so low, isn't it? You've got blue sheen. Gold in that one. Yeah. Um, entire blue sheen um, and when and when it's in these kind of free forms you know the lapidaris has basically been able to they're not being dictated to like yeah. that's got to be an oval that's got to be a, a round that's got to be this shape that calibration um, you could actually cut the stones for their own individual beauty so yeah. um, which is really ideal when it comes to gemstones like labyrinth or opal for example 19 pounds and 99 pence only not today though um, shall we remove a digit wow and we don't mean, <laughs> we don't mean the pennies. Wow. We mean pants. This is great. One, one of those in a ring, you've got your money back. Absolutely. Beautiful with your pearls. Oh, I love labradorite and pearls. Yeah, pearls. amazing. Absolutely. They look great with those pearls. Shall I hold it? Yeah. Shall I put it to the back of the hand then? Oh, lovely. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah, they j j a metre long length. Yeah. Strand of pearls alongside Labradorite. Yeah, just beautiful as a combination. Um, very golden, those pearls, aren't they? They are lovely. 9 99 Have we got quantity? Um, 23 Ooh. so not so much, especially when we consider Sunday's a busy show for us here at Jewelry Jeez. Maker. Um, there'll be lots of eyes snapping up these amazing deals hello five fellow to you maker maker amanda jennifer mary jill anna hello to you all hiya jane today i finish uh crochet um <gasps> crochet in the, oh, dragon the dragon body watch jewelry maker and buy some goodies for my stash then this afternoon plant some tulips oh, oh is it time to plant okay. tulips i need a picture of the dragon she told me she was crocheting the dragon oh, amazing I need pictures amazing is that out of wire or a no, she's knitting it, wow. uh, crocheting it. Oh, amazing. Yeah. My cousin does a bit of crochet. Um, so you need to tell me as well, because I asked Mark this yesterday and I actually forgot, forgot to continue the conversation. What should I be planting in my garden now? What? Onions? Really? Late, late potatoes? No, I, I've got flower beds, so I can't really do... Oh. Yeah, what, 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 what should I be planting? Tulips, so I should be... Tulips? What, won't they be coming next Daffodils? year? Daffodils? Oh, ready for next year. Um, but you can plant your tulips and then put your plants on top yeah, of it, Yeah, put some winter you? pansies on or something. I love yeah. winter pansy. Yeah, OK. Right, text in. Because I forgot to have that conversation with Mark yesterday because my garden's looking a little bit drab. Oh, is it? Yeah, I'm not a gardener, that's the thing. I'm not a gardener. Stick it in and hope for the best. I love gardens, but I'm not a gardener. And I've got three dogs, so <laughs> it just doesn't exactly. happen. <laughs> exactly, my dogs as well. Mine's gravel likewise. with pots. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I've got a bit of grass. It's not very well kept, though. <laughs> No, I gave up on the grass when it just became mud bath. <laughs> it's, it's not big enough for three dogs and, and, and grass. I go around my father-in-law's house who's got the most well-maintained yeah. lawn. It's like carpet. And then there's mine, which has got like mud patches and yeah. weeds and all sorts. Yeah. Um, anyway, it's lived in. Sorry, what was that? Peruvian, this is Ooh. one of my favourite strands that we have in our vault at the moment. I love this. Um, and I had the pleasure um, of relaunching Peruvian turquoise. If the, is this that strand? Um, we launched it, absolutely flew. And the reason why I think it's so desirable um, is because um, with Peruvian turquoise, it's a very distinctive colour. Yeah. It's very different to that that you find in USA or Mexican or Tibetan turquoise. Much more of a celeste blue. Yeah. Um, now, for those of you that celeste translate to heaven so it's one of the most heavenly colors totally natural um it's a bit more pastel i'm gonna say um there yeah. are many other uh, other other locations of turquoise i love it i think it's so beautiful I equally i think it would look amazing absolutely. with azataz's pearls absolutely oh 
We're at 14.99. Oh, how how beautiful. Amazing. Size and colour. They look amazing together, don't yeah. they? Just restrand them. Um, £14.99. Genuine natural turquoise, which is a rarity, actually, to get natural turquoise. Um, I've only got 17 now, I think I heard. Down to 15 already. Oh, no. Nope. Yeah, Going. flying. Yeah, I remember I remember launching or rather relaunching it because we don't see Peruvian turquoise very often. And we spoke very much about Celeste, you know, the colour. If you were to go into the, uh, onto the Pantone, I've got a book of Pantone colours, haven't I, Adam? You have. Yes, that you bought for me at Secret Santa. <laughs> and Not I, so Secret Santa. I knew it was Adam. <laughs> uh, I knew it was Adam. Yeah. Um, yeah. And you see this beautiful colour. It's like it's, it, it's described Peruvian turquoise. Could you put the flower topped tassel with it? I certainly can. The tulip I, one. You yeah, know. yeah, yeah. I think that would look lovely dropping from that. Oh, stunning. Wouldn't it? Absolutely stunning. Yeah, what at the bottom? Yeah, yeah. Just turn that a into necklace. a necklace. Yeah, yeah. amazing. Absolutely I think that would amazing. Look gorgeous with it. Eight grams of sterling silver in those tassels, yeah. don't you know? Crazy. Um, amazing. Make sure you check it out, everybody, and keep those lovely messages coming through. Um, stay where you are on those phone lines. Fabulous. Now, we've got some very high end pearls um, coming your way. Oh, there you go. Um, so, if you think about pearls, you get lots of different varieties, but the big three really are your South Sea, your Tahitian, and your Akoya. Yeah. Imagine ticking a multitude of those boxes with one strand. Uh, amazing. The, the whole concept of this strand, I just thought, was genius, and I'd never seen it done before. And you think about location, you know, you've got from, you've gone from uh, the shores of Australia um, to uh, um, Tahiti, effectively, mm. or the French Polynesia. Um, these are exceptional quality and they're totally and utterly natural big that's the thing about south sea and tahitian pills they do form in larger sizes um so the black lip oyster produces your tahitian pills where they are quite literally sung to um Aww. yeah literally sung to in their um during their harvesting process you know each and every single one of those mollusks which grow at significant sizes you know you, you, they can be almost dinner plate sizes wow um, you know, have all the barnacles chipped off the surface. They do that. They look after them. They're well and truly pampered. Um, and that's so that they can filter and feed. Happy mollusks produce beautiful pearls like this. Um, amazing quality. And yeah, this is this is heirloom. This is, you know, yeah. you, you can get, as with all Jemsons, I can bring you a diamond for a pound. I can bring you a diamond for a million. I always say that. Um, these are heirloom pearls. Tahitian South Sea. It doesn't get much better than that, to be truthful. And our start price, well, frankly, that's amazing. I'm not going to sit here and say that £747 isn't a considered amount of money. Of course it is. But um, it's, it's, it's not when we're talking about South Sea and Tahitian pearls. We're going straight down. 299 Now, look, I mean, to use, to use... You've got another crash. So I remember... In fact, hold that thought. Do you remember when Tahitian pearls were launched here at Jewelry Maker? Gosh, yeah amazing hold that thought right yeah and we sold them in packs of three yeah we didn't have south sea pearls until nope. charlie baron did we no nope. so hold that thought everybody look at your we didn't have split payment then either no not percent interest split payment we are not stopping at 299 pounds if you purchase gemstones not just because they're beautiful but also because you know you want uh sort of the, the, the legacy if you like and you want heirloom jewelry then look no further than what's on your screens right now we are going lower have i got many Six. I, I didn't think that I, I was Damn. never expecting there to be a massive quantity. Yeah, for what we're holding here, that's a that's an amazing quantity. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow. Now I was what I was hold that thought. Remember I said that. So when we launched Tahitian pearls, you got three in a pot. Do you remember? Yeah. There was three. Yeah, of them, yeah, yeah. Three Tahitian pearls, and they were I'm sure more than that price tag. I think. Or you're right. or there or thereabouts. I, I, I feel right. like they were two four nine. There, and then they went down to about 150, I think, because we started buying bigger quantity. But that was three. That was three. You can go online, purchase one South Sea Pearl on a bale, 380 pounds. Wow. And you think about it, I've got, I've got four South Seas yeah. and I've got five Tahitian Pearls on this strand. That's amazing. You do the maths. And they're just stunningly ombre. They're just gorgeous. 
Amazing. Now, we've only got oh, how man. many left? Four left. Oh, lovely oh, Anne. Morning, oh, lovely. Anne. Um, I'm not surprised you've got these lovely. It's an incredible deal, isn't it? Absolutely incredible deal. I've only got three of them left. Look at the split payment. It's madness, really. It's the creme de la creme, isn't yeah. it? When you're talking about South Seas, when you're talking about Tahitian pearls, which are both natural, by the way. South Seas, you can get the pristine white like these, um, or you can get the golden colour. Tahitian pearls, you can get sort of soft, more muted silver right the way up to the very deep almost aubergine like colors um absolutely beautiful quality um they are both absolute divas in terms oh, of yeah. the pearl, uh, pearl world they take a lot of uh, a lot of care and nurture um to actually produce these fine pearls um well done i've got alan there i've got maker there and i, and I do need to say look this is this is this is heirloom. This is absolute heirloom jewellery. And like I said, I can remember, definitely recall 150 for three of your Tahitian pearls. Yeah. Three of them. Yes. £50 each. That yeah. rings a bell. It was, That rings it? a big bell, yeah. And they were just, they, they weren't, I think they were half drilled or, yeah, half drilled Tahitian pearls. Yes. We've got three of them. And I remember the first one. Yeah. Well, wow. they're massively over-allocated. We've no. got to do a clock to close. Um, in 15 seconds, who's going to grab those uh, final two? There's a lot of you there. There's Catriona there. There's County Armagh. There's Annette. Uh, sorry, Antoinette, I beg your pardon. I've got Maker there and Alan, and I've got people on the phone lines. Um, we're not going any lower. That's your th price point. That's an That's absolute steal. Price. Yeah, it's an absolute steal when it comes to South Sea. That's the thing. You know, the wow. reality is I could say, right, see those four there? South Sea Pearls, 199 Yeah, That's absolutely. Unbelievable if it was just those. Likewise, if I was to say, see those, they're beautiful steel, natural colours, that's 199. But the fact that you are getting all of them, unbelievable, unbelievable deal. Um, congratulations. Shall we do some more Labradorite? Yes. I've been, Ooh, I've been starved too. of Labradorite. Yeah, you I love craving, my Labradorite. It, I do. Like chocolate. I miss my Labradorite. Yeah. Especially the quality. Mm, Labradorite. Mm, <laughs> chocolate. chocolate. Mm. Yeah, I agree. It is one of those. Do you know? I would actually take the Labradorite over the chocolate. Yeah. Wow, don't, don't make, please don't make me make. Have, don't make me make that decision. No, I'd get I'd go Labradorite all the way. I can't choose between chocolate and a gemstone. I do love my chocolate. Put the Peruvian with it. Okay. That would be amazing. And oh yes. Hi. And wait, wait, wait. Oh oh oh. Oh, snuck those. Oh, are you making me a kit again? I'm making Alison a kit. Oh, L. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Oh, look You'd at like that. You'd like a bit of that. Yeah, I'll have a bit of that. That's what I used to do when I started here at Jewelry Maker. Yeah. Oh. Look at the labradorescence. It does go perfectly alongside the Peruvian turquoise. Love those lovely palettes. Oh, my goodness me. Um, we've brought you the four mil Peruvian turquoise. We've still got the smaller size to bring you. Faceted Labradorite rounds as well. Which are gorgeous. Which are rare to see. It is. Um, because, again, it's complex to actually cut it. You still want to maintain and hold on to that Labradorescence. $19.99. Wow. A strand like this, again, yeah. Yeah, $19.99 for genuine Labradorite. That's amazing. The quality of it. I love, I love the smooth. But the faceted gives you a different facet because every one of those facets gives you a different plane of light on that labradorite. Yeah, it does, yeah. And it softens I everything. I love that. <gasps> a £10 oh, note for crazy. labradorite. You know, if you've walked past, they're flying, well done. Everybody that's on the phone lines, do stay where you are. Lots of you with it in your, in your baskets. Wow. Make sure you check it out. You know, if you walk past, like, I love those kind of markets where you occasionally see, like, free forms of gemstones. Yeah, and yeah, like yeah. That. Um, and you, 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 your peripheral vision will pick up Labradorite, won't oh, it? And you're just absolutely. moths to a flame. Same applies in your jewellery. Yeah. I've only got 15 left, so make sure you're checking out. Hello, Daniel. Hello to you, June. Carol, Christine, Sally Ann. Hello to you, Beverly, Carolyn, uh, Gloucestershire. Nice to see you all this morning. I hope you're well. Um, we're going to have a super Sunday together. We really we are. are. Tell us what you're up to. I know. Planting tulips. You need to help me out as well. If you're good at gardening, please can you help me out? What should I be planting? I want something to plant for the spring and right. also something that will flower in the later autumn months. So help me out because it's looking a bit drab at the moment. <laughs> bit drab. Bit drab. Aww. Yeah. So I need a little bit of guidance. So can you text in? Bit of winter colour. A bit of winter colour. Um, besides onions, potato and carrots. So that's near his <laughs> suggestion. <laughs> Um, I would like, see, Adam's got an allotment. I would like an allotment. 
Yeah. I'm still waiting on the vegetables that you keep promising. <laughs> and the pumpkin soup. Was it pumpkin or squash soup? Yeah, you keep promising. Have you? Oh, well, oh, he's had that's loads nice. of meals. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I'd love some. Well, he is doing the work with it, to be fair. So, I mean, to be fair, I'd just like to sample a bit of Adam's... Uh, <laughs> you almost said something then. Adam, <laughs> Adam, yeah, that sentence almost sounded very, very, very peculiar. I was like, I'd just like to sample some of Adam's vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing, well done, everybody. Happy Sunday. <laughs> Happy Sunday, everybody. You can't be proper veg, can you? Oh, fresh from the veg. garden. From no, the garden. It's like, like uh, I always drove past a farm shop and it's really nice. Mm. The veg tastes different. It, so it does different. different. Mm. It is different. Um, okay, where should we go now? Should we do some natural Ooh, pearls? Yes. Peach and purple. You know what I'm going to say. Yeah. Alongside your kits. Absolutely. These would be amazing with your kits. Um, natural colours, so they're Beautiful. not dyed, they're not enhanced in any way, shape or form, um, which is a rarity because, yeah, normally to get pinks and purples like this, the pearl will be bleached and dyed. Nothing wrong with that, of course, but far rarer when it's acquired that colour from uh, during its formation. It's basically the positioning of the pearl within the mollusk that will achieve that colour. Um, so this might have navigated itself ever so slightly out to the lip of the oyster or mollusk whatever it was um, and that's why you've got these beautiful deep colors it's rare though and you pay a premium for natural pearls um, I love how these are just alternating yeah. you could just knock that couldn't you you could absolutely absolutely no. and, I, and I would knot it yeah I love pearls knotted they give you a different feel they do they do give you a They're different softer feel. aren't they yeah. much softer uh, we're straight under a hundred pounds for natural for natural purple and papaya pearls. I know, and look at them—they're just stunning, aren't they? It, it does amaze me that they come out that colour. Yeah, you know, because if you think about, you know, I don't know any mollusk, whatever it is, yeah. and you think about the inside of the shell, that's their mother of pearl, isn't it? So yeah. that's where we get that from. But it's that which is, that's made up of nacre, and that's how your pearl gets the colour. But it's rare, 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 rare to get such an intense purple and, yeah. and peach. Um, and, and Neri has just said something in my ear. is like, we make this the norm. It, the thing is, it's not normal to get pearls at this price tag. Why is there a 30 second clock on our screen? No, really? Oh, this is an app. Look, I was over the moon at double figures. Yeah. That's incredible. Absolutely incredible. Please understand, this is not normal for natural pearls. Oh. Firstly, I think you'd struggle to walk down your local high street and find natural pearls. And, and no disrespect intended, I was one of these people once upon a time, but um, I don't think many of your uh, jewellery stores would know if they're natural pearls. I oh. wasn't told that oh. when I used to sell the, them for thousands of pounds. These are totally natural and they command a high premium. I can't believe we're going even lower. Have we got quantity then? Okay, we had 30. We're already... Oh. You see, <clears throat> you knot this, and that's a three-figure necklace. Knot it, put a, 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 a precious metal clasp on it, yeah. and that's a three-figure necklace. Well, yesterday we had those amazing bullet clasps, didn't we? Yes, one of those, saw those. My goodness me. They look great, Can I they? just say you need a... Here at Jewellery Maker, never mind what goes on outside yeah. these four walls, put a one in front of that. That's the price yeah. of this strand. And that's here at Jewellery Maker. I genuinely would have... If you'd have asked me, guess the price, I'd have said one, two, nine. De genuinely, here at Jewellery Maker, they are natural pearls. They flew on the launch... I think we've made a massive error there, to be honest. I think I during think so. the booking in process, someone's missed Shh. a digit. Shh. Yeah, absolutely. Let's but there are only it. nine of them left. Well done, Fife, Carolyn, Janet, June, Elaine, Vivian, Samantha, Lynn. Amazing. We are over allocated. To be expected, yeah, was something. That's madness. I can't it's believe madness. we're anywhere near £29, £99. Two of those on a pair of drops, and then the necklace would look stunning. Well, that's more. We're, we're, we're a sweet. Yeah, just put two. Yeah. In sterling silver, yeah. I'd still expect to pay more than what's on your screen. 
Uh, absolutely, for the earrings. The culture totally, pearl, yeah. Natural pink or purple yeah. uh, culture pearls. They've flown out the door. Apparently, uh, yeah, oh my we gosh. sold a big quantity on the launch. Well, <laughs> no surprise there. That's because our viewers know their pearls. They know the ra rarity. They know the inherent value of a strand like this. They know it's not twenty nine ninety nine. Well done. Um, amazing. Congratulations, everybody. Um, oh, is there one left? One. I'll have it. One, two. I'll have that last one. I love it. Um, wow. Wish list it. If, you, if you've missed out there, wish list it. Definitely. Definitely. Where should we go? I love wish list. Pull through earrings. Oh. Oh, these are fabulous. Have I got the right? Yes. Yeah. <gasps> no way. If you've got I think that strand with, that, well. with um, Zena. Oh, my goodness. If you got that strand earlier on, you need this. Literally, the strand we've just done. Yeah. You need these. Oh, yeah. Perfect with it. Because you've got the perfect coloured pearls to go alongside. Look how many you get. They're half drilled, are they? Are yeah. They half drilled? Uh, yeah. Yes, I think so. Or through drilled. Let's have a look. Through drilled. Okay. Plus, oh, my goodness. You get... Oh, that's right, because they make a little, um, a little chandelier. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. And you've got the little mini head pins. Look at those. Are they not the most adorable thing yeah. you've ever seen? Uh. <laughs> little head pins. <laughs> but they're perfect size. They're perfect they are. Size so you don't waste any. And then even if you do nothing with these pull-through earrings, look how lovely these are. Yeah. Obviously, you get two. I mean, both Zina and I were saying these are the best earring findings ever. So comfortable. So comfortable. I struggle with earrings because my hair always knocks them out. Yeah. You can't knock these pull-through ones out. And whether you pull it almost to the top so that becomes almost a stud and have the long chain behind, yeah. Yeah. or whether you have it half and half or whether you have it lower, however you want to wear it, they're just fabulous. Yeah. I, I hope we start getting more and more of the Absolutely. Pull and you don't even have to use them together if you don't want to. So you no. can wrap loop on to the little uh, butterfly Yeah. Um, if you wanted to. Um, or you could use them separately. It's yeah. entirely up to you. I mean, they're an amazing pair of earrings as is. £29.99. They're 925 sterling silver. Um, obviously, there's, there's the other pull-through earring. Um, and you get natural pearls. And you get the little mini sterling silver head pins which i think of it's hard i'm sorry i've got the i've got the dud tweezers here they don't there you go um there we <laughs> go <laughs> what do they say a bad craftsman blames their tools, blames their tools yeah yeah sorry but look at the way they've done that um clover with the with with the texture on it, it's just Stunning. beautiful. It looks like a mosaic, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, beautiful. Loving these. £14.99 only. Love a pull-through earring. Like, yeah. like you just said there, Alison, they are so easy to wear. Yeah. Um, and you, I'm going to say less likely to actually lose them because you have got... Um, well, friction effectively yeah. um, within the actual chain itself. They're very comfortable. So, look, I've just kind of quickly slipped those in for you to see. Just How lovely they are. Amazing, aren't they? Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, if you want to add the pills, you can do. Um, or leave it as is and use them in an alternative project. Uh, well done. Four chances left. Five's got two. Well done to you, Chris. New customers on the phone lines. Down to three. Make sure you're checking them out, everybody. And don't be shy. Come and say hello to Azza yeah. Tazza and I would like to say. See what you're up to. You see, we were saying, if you, if you just had those as the earrings, you've got enough pearls to do another three pairs of earrings. You've got four pairs of earrings for fourteen ninety nine. I know. How amazing is that? It's crazy. You do the maths. Yeah. It's absolutely crazy. Uh, it is busy, oh, busy, busy cool. today. Yeah, oh, there's a lag on our call screen as a yes. teaser. That's what it is. But it is busy, busy, busy. Um, okay, shall we do some more clovers? Oh. They would go perfect with all your Alhambra inspirations. Oh, yeah, these are lovely. Amazing colour of jade, these. Um, so a strand of... And it has become one of our most popular cuts, if not the, to be true. Yeah. Um, for obvious reasons, I suppose. Now, if you do look at Van Cleef and Arpels, firstly, they don't have jade because it's too rare, effectively. You might be thinking, it was a silly owl. This is Van Cleef and Arpels. I've, you know, yeah. and I don't doubt they could buy jade. However, Alhambra has been one of their longest standing collections um, and they need to purchase gemstones that are um, 
have got a continuous supply effectively and aren't going to run out. Well, this mine is closed. Um, this comes from the Burmese location. Um, yeah, we've spoken about we've spoken about the uh, Van Cleef and Arpels before. I've got a PowerPoint actually um, uh, near here yeah, um, that talks about the whole idea. It was Jack Arpel. I think it was the nephew who was obsessed with clovers. Used yeah. to go out into yeah. the back garden and actually pick them and then gift them to the employees of the jewelers um, with the little poem "Don't Quit." Yes, yes. Um, so that's where it sort of originated from. But if you look, there's lots of iconic celebrities who've been pictured wearing the Al, uh, the Alhambra straight away. Do you know what? Do you know what? I, I, nearly immediately, and I know what Dan's reaction straight to. We were talking about him yesterday as well, weren't we? Jack, what's his name? What's his name? Grealish. Why not, Dan? He's a nice chap. Jack Bellingham. Ja <laughs> um, I take it he's a footballer. He is a footballer. Grealish, there you go. Should we go through the other Hollywood icons? Because I know the, is, we, I seem and to have spoken. Yeah, and royalty, absolutely. Because I seem to have spoken about uh, Mr. Grealish <laughs> at length recently. And it's not just him that wears them. There's lots no. of different, uh, like you said, royalty celebrities that wear the, um, the Alhambra inspiration. So if you go right to the top, Neary. He's um, too busy talking he football. Is, isn't he is, <laughs> Go to the top of the celebrities. Um, because, oh, okay, here we go. Yeah, just to the celebrities, here we go. So you've got, there we are, uh, Romy oh, Schneider, absolutely beautiful. Stunning. In 1973, wearing her long line Alhambra, you can see the four-leaf clover. Uh, moving on, you've got uh, Francois oh. Hardy wearing two Alhambra necklaces there in 1973 also. Um, you have got, of Great. course, Her, Her Royal Highness Princess Grace of Monaco wearing lots, lots of Alhambras. Yeah. I think that's an... Um, um, a granddaughter, I think that's Princess Grace's granddaughter here, um, oh, really? wearing hers. You've, of course, got Her Royal Highness, the Princess yeah. of Wales, um, who always looks amazing. This Mother is, uh, of Pearl, yeah. yeah. Mother of Pearl. Lovely. Beautiful. There she is again. Um, you have uh, the Queen, of course. Now. Queen Camilla, yeah. Queen Camilla wearing hers in Malachi, absolutely beautiful. And there she is wearing her agate ones. Uh, fabulous. She's a big fan. Now you see, you've got enough pearls to make that necklace. You have in the up. kit. In the kit. Yeah, and then you have got, um, some people say, another queen, Queen of Pop, Mariah Carey, Queen of Christmas, that's it. Um, Mariah Carey, of course she's going to have Alhambra, yeah. of course she is. You have Naomi Watts wearing hers. I think she's so beautiful, Naomi Watts. Stunning, isn't she? Um, amazing. You've got Adele. Adele. She needs a cap. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Reese ah. Witherspoon wearing hers. Amazing. Uh, oh, the whole Card family. Cardi B's entire family <laughs> rocking the Van Cleef and Arpels there. Even the baby. Even the baby. <laughs> um, I know. A different. It's, 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 it's another world, isn't it? It is. Um, anyway, to take inspiration from that beautiful collection, um, we have cut our amazing jade. Um, jade also into, <laughs> also into the four leaf clover design. But instead of paying the, paying the tens of thousands of pounds that it would cost from Van Cleef mm. and our bells, of course, you can make it in a fraction. You've got to realise, though, that this is far rarer than the, than the other gemstones that we saw at Van Cleef and Arpels. You know, it's far rarer than the Mother of Pearl. So is this ours, ours? What do you mean? Have we had commissioned this? Yes. Ah. Yes. This is an exclusive E. Yes. We do it with a few gemstones. It's yeah. very difficult to cut a four-leaf clover because you've got four risk points, effectively. We're under £100. Like I said, you know, Queen Camilla, she had malachite, she had agate. Yeah. Much more abundant gemstones. Um, Princess of Wales, a mother of pearl. Yeah. I'm not running out of mother of pearl. This mine is closed. It is completely closed. It's totally natural, type A grade. Um, we are under £100. Wow. I love the fact that you've got the graduation. So, again, you can really take inspiration from the, uh, the house, the maison, that is at uh, Van Cleef and Arpels. Um, okay, going even lower. Good luck. Do we have quantity then, Neary? 12, oh. not so much. And you've got your 0% interest split payment as yeah. well. £69.99. and pence. We shouldn't be able to buy one of those for that price tag. In all honesty, we know that the Burmese mine um, has closed after decades uh, of historic mining from that location. Um, so now we're having to source it from different locations around the world. Um, today, should we do a brand new low? Yes. 
Um, Neary says he's feeling a bit Van Cleefy. <laughs> I like that. Is uh, is, is wow? Is, are you going to treat Sam to some Van Cleef and our pals then? You treated it to the kit. Perfect. That's even better. That's even better. This would go great with the kit, actually. Because yeah, if you intersperse them to make a longer line necklace, then I would, I would intersperse these with the malachite. They'd go lovely with it. Ah, stunning together. Yeah. yeah. Here we go. They'd yeah, lovely, perfect alongside those kits. Yeah. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Well wow. done. Um, has that sold out, did you say? Sold out, well done. Um, it's time for oh. your early bird, which I haven't spoken about as of yet. And I, I will say that's quite deliberate. Um, because otherwise, I think it would have sold out before we even do the uh, uh, the early bird. Now, we all know that in the in the world of jewellery, there's always a need for your chains, mm -hmm. isn't there? And you can get lots of different... You can get a standard trace chain, you can get your belt chains, your curb chains, your Figaro's, you can get your Prince of Wales, I mean, we could go on, your belchers, all of those. Um, there's lots of different design inspirations. Now, again, I know I sound like a broken record here, but genuinely, I think we can all today, if you want, walk to a, high, uh, to a jeweller's, local to us, um, Go into that establishment, say, I'm interested in a silver chain or a gold-plated chain. Can you show me what you've got? And I can pretty much guarantee that gram for gram, quality for quality, they're not going to be able to beat this price. It's your early bird that's up next. So, yeah, uh, let's read this, actually, because um, I, I've read it to you in the past, but we'll just skirt over it. And it's the jewellery editor actually talking about chains. It's, they don't just talk about gemstones. They don't just talk about particularly uh, in particular design houses. They talk about trends as well. And I think it's all fair to say uh, that chains are one of the hottest trends in mm. the jewellery world at the moment. And I love the wording of this. It just makes me smile. So um, let's have a little read. Now, this was uh, published in 2015, but that, and you might be thinking, hang on a second. Second, that's that's like three years ago, Al. Uh, sorry, eight years ago, Al. But it's still very much the case. It's still yeah. very, very much on on trend. Um, and it says, back in the chain gang, <laughs> the trend for gold chains is in full swing. Think less, Mr. T, a more refined, tasteful elegance of the Georgian uh, through Art Nouveau eras. So yes, do you remember that, Mr. T? With I all remember of his Mr. T. Um, and it's true, isn't it? You know, it's not just one simple chain. It's actually about layering as well. Yeah. It's all the rage. But flicking forward, um, the Financial Times also wrote an article about chains saying how chain jewellery is linking us together. Um, this was written in 2020. So chains are being used as a symbol of connection, uh, uniting masculine and feminine, romance and rebellion, old and new. My mum's birthday. Oh, uh, genuinely, the two articles I <laughs> just read, um, the one previously, Neary's like, oh, it's my birthday. It was written on my birthday. And this was written on it's your mum's, mum's birthday. birthday. Morning, mum. The day after my mum's. Is it? Um, let's see who else's birthday we can get. Oh, okay. No date on it. Um, Houdini himself would have struggled, struggled to escape the chains that have lured fashion recently. Um, they've been appearing all over the catwalk as jewels and body adornments, geek chic glasses, chains, and medieval inspired, how do you pronounce that? Chatelaines? Um, yeah. A shoulder trailing earrings um, at Brandon Maxwell and chunky gold necklaces at, at Batiga. Um, in Jill's first fashion jewellery collection for Louis Vuitton menswear, he put a new spin on the urban classic Cuban link chain with an exuberant multicoloured neon links infusing Parisian chic with skater boy energy. Then came normal people's uh, Canel Waldron um, with his boyish alluring silver neck chain and everyone got hot under the Ooh. collar. There we go. All right, Walden. You yeah. know what the Chatelaines are, don't you? They're where they used to hang chick keys or of where they, they used to have the the little jewellery, the little um, scissors and sewing of stuff. Of course, of course. That's of what course. the Chatelaine is. Um, big or small, simple or gem smothered, chains mm. powerfully link the masculine and feminine, the past and the present, the intimate and the industrial. Uh, in fact, with influences ranging from Renaissance's splendour, 60s jet set, 
Tech Glam and 70s Industrial Chic to Punk, 90s Street Style to Hip Hop. Uh, the chain ironically offers today's designers the ultimate freedom of expression. It's true. Uh, chain Ooh. stacking is having a moment, agrees Sophie Key, uh, commercial director for the personal styling services uh, service threads. Chains are being worn in various ways from everyday minimal, um, a single flat link chain um, or snap lock transformable link motif earrings by era uh, through big chunky chains stacked in multiples, perhaps with diamond tennis necklaces, um, all the way to the major bejeweled statements of Boucheron, uh, a modern playful take on the heritage class. I mean, those earrings, by the way, are Tiffany's and Co. They're one of their newest designs, um, and they are thousands of pounds, as you can imagine. Yeah. Earrings have become an unexpected focal point for chains as well. Uh, Anna Kuri connects her earpieces with articulated miniature chains in gold or parve set with diamonds or rainbow shaded gemstone. The perfect balance of tradition and rebellion. Um, so we're talking about, you know, lots of big names, uh, influential names within the jewellery industry. And I'll just flick through some of these. Um, lo lovely. There's the bejeweled that we were just talking about. Thomas Sabo using your paperclip paper chain. Monica yeah. Veneda. Um, you can see there. Wolf and Badger, you can see there, £207. Um, just a single pearl that you can maybe uh, uh, sort of, well, have Bellish. floating wrap yeah. loop on if you wanted to. Uh, Liberties of London. These are all different designs um, that you can get in different designers. The classic Tiffany's and Co. This is really like the heartbeat of their sterling silver collections, aren't they? Um, more Tiffany's and Co. You know, chains are everywhere. And it's not just, this is the thing, and I've always, I've always mentioned these few words, but um, it's what, look at, look at Roberto Coin, for example. You know, we, here at Jewelry Maker and I think across Gemporia, we've so focused on the gemstones a lot of the yeah. time, we forget that actually the precious metal is, is as rare as well. You know, this is mined in the same way. And Roberto Coin, it's pretty much, I'm not saying they don't include gemstones, because they do, but it's more about the precious metal than it is actually about the gemstones, I've always thought. You know, just a classic, a classic chain from Monica Veneda. Tw All right, that's 20 inches, um, but you're talking 180 pounds for that. Yeah. If you go into someone, I don't know if this is on the same presentation, but if you go into somewhere like Samuel's and look at a classic curb chain, you are talking about 35 pounds for just the classic 18 inch curve yeah. chain. When you start introducing designer aspects like these beautiful bar details, so lovely. the price point is gonna go upwards. Now, I, I, I love this look. I just think it gives you those wonderful kind of flashes of luster, gives you, a, 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 I don't know, a shape, I guess, to yep. the chain itself, um, because there's no fluidity in those kind of sections of precious metal. Now, we've got them in the two colours. We've got them in the 18 karat gold, which is on your screens right now. So 18 karat gold plated, sterling silver. And then we've also got it in the 925. So straight away, 56.99, that's an amazing deal, isn't it? It's brilliant. Would we all agree? Yep. And I genuinely, Desire. going back to what we first said, if we walked into any of our local jewellers, I think you'd be struggling to find something like for like mm. at what's on your screens right now. But we're jewellery maker. And you know we're not stopping there. Wow. 29.99. Let's hold it up to the neckline for you as well. You know, earlier on in that article when they were saying, you know, Simple minimalist. Look how beautiful that is. That's just gorgeous, isn't it? On its own. Look how lovely that is. You don't need a pendant, do you? No, no. But it is the sort of chain you could wear without. In fact, I wouldn't put a chain pendant on it. If I wanted to wear a pendant with it, I'd add another chain. Yeah, absolutely. And layer them. This is the, for me. This is that kind of jewelry. I might. I might have to buy this. I love this. Mm, it's lovely. This is that piece of jewelry. I think that you would just put on exclusively on its own. Yeah. I would. Look, I'm not telling you what to do. It's entirely up to you. But like I said, I, I think this absolutely carries itself. At twenty nine ninety nine. We are not stopping there. Now, how many have we got of these available? 50 chances. 24 pounds and 99 oh. pence is a big investment of your sterling silver. Those beautiful kind of flat bar details um, are 360 all the way around. Um, so you're going to get that lovely luster on every single angle. The clock is ticking, lovely jewelry makers. So designer. 
so 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 designer in its inspiration i love it it's simplistic you. you can go for the big bold tiffany's inspired chunky links the monica venadas the thomas sabos the liberties of london um but they will all do a version of this as well a more delicate design yes and, it, and it's beautiful i love the inclusion of those bars that solid bit of yeah, precious lovely, metal that you it? get in there it gives shape it, it definitely gives shape it draws interest it draws your eye yeah it's stunning. The chain itself is beautiful. It's it's a lovely, delicate, yet solid chain. If it's that a makes heavy, sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 yeah, absolutely. It's stunning. a heavyweight chain, but it maintains that beautiful delicacy. In 13 seconds, lovely jewelry makers, we are going even lower. That's the Gosh. kind of piece that I think I would put on and not want to take off. Yeah. You know, if I, yes. I have to take jewellery off to come here, um, to come to to work, basically. I can't be, I can't wear everything. Yes. I need to show you pieces, but this is the kind, it would become one of my staples. £17.99 pence only. Beautiful oh. buttery yellow gold. Would you layer it up with the silver? Would you mix your no. colours, your precious metals? Would you connect them together to make a, a longer line necklace? I think that would look lovely too. Um, I think definitely a welcome addition alongside Alison's nine o'clock kits mm. um I do, i'm not surprised that people already have chosen to multi-buy like fife like david like debbie charmaine london carolyn hello to you on again there's a lag on our call screens i know you're all there um i've got less than 50 of these available <gasps> less than 50 um with an auction like this we have to stagger it we don't want to crash the website we don't want to do that before it was on the brink of what is going to be an absolutely amazing sunday we're not stopping here when you, when you see that over 50% of the people who've bought it have, have, have multi-bought yeah. it already. That's amazing. So I love pretty, it. isn't it? It's such a pretty chair. And it's, and it's ageless, isn't it? I can, imagine, yeah, I, I can imagine it going on your daughter yeah. as well as you, and I can imagine you taking one for your mum. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely. It doesn't need any further embellishments. No. That's what I like no. about this. It's a design of its own, absolutely. I mean, you can, we all add pendants to certain chains, don't we? But this, I think it doesn't need it. I think this is the kind of design that you could absolutely wear as one of your signature pieces. £14.99 pence only. It's a heavyweight chain whilst maintaining that delicacy. Look at how beautiful, beautiful. that is. I mean, if you just if you were to walk past a luxury jeweler's, or not even luxury, if you were to walk past a jeweler's local to you, I mean, yeah. all, you could argue all jewelers are luxury, aren't they? Because they are. Well, yes. Yeah. You know. Um, however, you're not going to see fourteen ninety nine for a chain like this. <laughs> Certainly not. Not when you not when your Samuels bring you a a fairly generic curb chain of twenty inches for thirty five yeah. pounds. I was going to say thirty five to forty pounds would be my guess if you were lucky. If you, if you were yeah. lucky, absolutely. You've got about 15 of wow. those left. I'm going to be joining you on that one because I want to get hold of it as well. I love that. I think it's so you beautiful. Might be lucky. Yeah. Uh, if not, I'll wish list it. Stray into the silver. Now, heads up, you all know this, but silver is our most popular colour of precious metal here at Jewelry Maker and at Gemporia and, to be honest, internationally. Um, and that's because silver will go with your silver jewellery, your 18 yeah. karat golds and also your platinum. Um, yeah, join the phone lines nice and quickly to avoid any disappointment. Now, we do have a bigger quantity, am I right in saying that? Um, we had 143 Ooh. when we opened this auction, but they're already getting uh, getting snapped up. I don't blame you for that. Um, no, I agree. I agree. I agree. Yeah, Neary's just saying, look, we started with 143. He's dubious about that quantity. So I don't think for one second Wayne has said, I'm going <laughs> to buy 143 because it's just an odd number, is it? He's probably bought 150. And Unless that's all they had. True. Said I want 150, and they said we've only got 143, and he's gone. Oh, we'll have, I'll have of all those. of those. I think he's done. But I reckon, Christmas I reckon someone's been Christmas. Yeah, shopping definitely. Beforehand. Prior to the show, which we're not meant to do. Yeah, we're just calling, uh, calling Wayne now. <laughs> Money, Wayne. <laughs> look at where we are starting. Oh, oh <laughs> look at the multi buying already. Starting. Wow. Yeah, the true buying power of Jewellery Maker. The difference here, look, we won't just sell one or two in any given no. week. And genuinely, that used to be the case when I was in the jewellers. They didn't sell chains every single day, no. every single hour. Definitely not. We're lucky to sell one in a week, to be truthful. Um, maybe in the lead up to Christmas, you did. Yeah. Um, but 19 
It wouldn't have been Fabulous. anywhere near that price tag. The power of jewellery maker, though, we bring you, well, I, and I always say, I think these are wholesale prices. But normally, if you're purchasing chains of this level of luxury um, and you want to get benefit from the wholesale prices, you have to buy a minimum quantity. Yeah. In 60 seconds, we are going to drop that price. I had quantity, had. Again, oh my God. probably 60% of you have chosen to multi-buy on this one. Um, you know, I'm going to say it. Sorry, I've been holding myself back and I can't hold it in any longer. Put it in your present drawer. This is a perfect yeah. Christmas present. Do you, know, do you know what? Secret Santa was going through my mind. Yes, absolutely. I was talking with Zena the other day. Um, they do the Christmas card, Christmas crackers you can make yeah. on Hobby Maker. Mm -hmm. And I was saying, because we, we had some things on the show and I'm like, that would be brilliant in a Christmas cracker. That would be great. Could you imagine having these? Oh, you can spend me. a fortune on Christmas crackers. The, the um, luxury ones. Oh yeah, that give you a tape measure. That give you a slightly less tacky, tacky present. Yeah. Or you could put something like this in and, and it's like an extra surprise present. There's less present. plastic in the, in the locker yeah. isn't there? I, I mean, I so want to do that. I don't know how many how many crackers. You probably have to go somewhere like Fortnum Mason or Harrods to get, get jewellery yeah. in a cracker. My goodness it's me. it's affordable, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it, it definitely, definitely is. But again, put this in a it's nice, amazing. you know, one of our Sienna boxes. Yes. You know, put that under the Christmas tree for a special Lovely. present. Oh, my goodness me. £12.99. Wow. This is a heavier weight chain um, than your standard sort of your generic curb chain or, yep. or belcher chain. Um, it has got a real investment of your 925 sterling silver within this. They are going super fast on the web and on the phone lines. Lots of you choosing to multi-buy. I'm looking at twos, threes. Well done. And just, you know, if, if you have a business, which lots of our jewelry maker audience do, not all granted. I mean, I, I don't have a business but I, I I make or purchase to gift effectively yes. um, but if you have got a business also being able to give that choice absolutely absolutely to say to your customers well, I've got this chain and that say uh, uh, X amount yeah or if you want to take it up another notch then we've got this design which features these beautiful beautiful flat bar details yeah um, there is a bigger gram weight. I need to emphasize that. This is a bigger gram weight in your sterling silver. Okay, a little bit unprecedented, a bit unplanned, but you know we are reactive. And I'm going to steal Roscoe's words in his absence. He says, look, you know, it's not going as fast as we would, li we would like. They're going, don't get me wrong, but we are on time restraints, aren't we, in a live TV show? We're seven minutes into the nine o'clock hour. We've got lovely kits to bring you, an amazing demo. So how do we speed things up? <gasps> Whose button's fallen off? Oh, the clock button. Oh, did you fix it? Did you fix it? Yeah, yeah, let's fix we're going to drop that price. That's how we pick up the pace, everybody. Yeah. Completely unplanned, though. We are working on minuscule margins <sighs> here. Perfect for your Christmas present draw, because who's Beautiful. not going to love that? Oh, absolutely. Everybody's going to love that. Do you imagine opening that? Get yourself a nice, like you say, a nice box for it. Yeah, exactly. If you've got if you've got a pen or a tassel pendant that you want. Oh, oh, as a tassel. It just so happens. I've got a tassel for that. <laughs> what on earth? Oh, look. We are at £10 completely impromptu price wow. drop. <laughs> gone mad now. Look at that for a piece of jewellery. Talking of tulips. Oh, Stunning. my goodness me. Both 925 sterling silver. This is how we pick up the pace on a live TV shopping channel. Um, we'll, we're reactive. That's what we mean by when we say we're reactive. We kind of, we'll read the room, won't we? Ooh. Always get it right. I'm not saying we always get it right. But for the investment of sterling silver that you're getting within this yeah. chain, that's the difference. You know, to get anything over, um, over I'm going to say over a gram and a quarter in a chain is fairly significant. You know, um, a trace chain, you know, the ones that kind of stick to you. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's not enough precious metal in it for it to actually hang. Yeah. Not ideal. You've got over two grams of sterling silver yes. within this. So it's got a lovely drape, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah, exactly. Nine ninety nine. well done. Hello, Pamela, getting two. Linda, Mirtha, Tidfield, Barry, Wiltshire, getting three. Hello to Elizabeth, Dorothy, Charmaine. Lots of you on the phone lines. I tell you what you're going to do, because like I say, time is against us. We're going to dip into a break, stay on those phone lines, keep checking out your baskets, and I'll review the quantity um, after the uh, after the break. Yeah, Alison's kits. You're going to love Alison's kits at nine o'clock. They are absolutely They're beautiful. Stunning. Your jewellery is absolutely beautiful. I had so much fun with oh, this. Those bracelets easy. and necklaces. Yeah. You know, it's classic, but it's iconic, isn't it? It is. It's such easy jewellery to make. Oh, members it. of your big five as well and genuine pearls. Keep checking out on your beautiful chains and join Alison and I after this. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. I absolutely adore these kits. Oh, I love these kits. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah have you yeah, yeah. Sorry, Neera's like, hang on a minute. That's a metre. Yeah. I know. I know. I know. They and it's not just a stunning. metre. You get all that sterling silver as well. Yeah. These kits are so high end. You know, you they think are. about your Elizabeth Taylor and her pearls yeah. and, uh, uh, and, and rubies and emeralds and sapphire. The late queen. Yeah, absolutely. But then you look at you look at Lady Gaga. Absolutely. Everybody look and and what's his name from Harry Styles? Yeah, that's absolutely. The one. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> what's his name? Can we just take a second to admire Alison's beautiful jewelry? Oh, Alison, these are you. stunning and so wearable. So wearable, so easy to make. It was absolutely really, really easy jewellery to make. And I'm not disrespecting it. It's classic jewellery. It, it classic really is. Jewelry. You, know, you, you don't need to overcomplicate no. it. Now, what we've done, you've... Oh, that. rubies, sapphires and emeralds and tanzanite in that. No, there's only the... No, so there's only the ruby and, sapphire. and sapphire in that one. And then I've put emeralds those bracelets on their own. Amazing. I know, aren't they? Wow. <laughs> I love those. Emerald, emerald bracelet, emerald and pearls. They just look so gorgeous, don't they? Um, and then I've used the tanzanite in that one. So I've kind of, and then I've done some on their own because I had an extra, I had an extra one of the multi yeah. um, of the four. Oh my so goodness! So spread mate. it around. So you could go without, you or you could go the whole. So well, these kits we've got the pearls and the and the precious metal. Yes. And then we've got a kit with your big four. Yeah. Um. So with your rubies, sapphires, emeralds, and tanzanite. Oh my goodness me, these are stunning. Now yeah. I'm going to show you the two kits alongside one another. So basically, the decision between these two kits is going to be all based on your yeah. precious metal preference. Um, so if you prefer the rose gold, then that's the kit that I'm starting with. If you prefer the yellow gold, exactly the same component but just different colours. But yeah, near is like, hold on a minute. That's a metre strand yes. of cultured pearls. I know what this kit is going to, and I can tell you it's a, it's a steal if it was just those pearls. Yeah. Well, I don't know what it's going for. Oh, it's a steal if, you know, if it was just yeah. those pearls. It, yeah. Honestly, amazing. Because I know in the past we'd have, we've done metre long lengths of pearls, and they haven't been this price. These... You've got the most amazing crisp luster, something that we spoke about on Friday morning, didn't we? Luster being the most important of the five virtues. You know, is it sharp? Is it, is it really reflective? Um, because okay. they're smaller pearls, don't automatically assume that they're going to, that, you know, that they command a smaller price tag. Not always the case. Actually, smaller pearls can be even more expensive. And that's because you've still got to go through that culturing process. And you've basically got to cut it short, haven't you? Mm -hmm. um, so that you can get the smaller size. You, but your risk in terms of the drilling process is that much yeah. higher. So you lose more. <laughs> Have you ever wondered where we get, how we get pearlescent makeup? How we get pearlescent paint? Oh, so it's, it's the broken ones, it's as the it broken were. ones, absolutely. They grind it up. Exactly, they re they grind oh, it down yeah. or put them into shell pearls. Now, our start price is completely wow. wrong for a meter of pearls of this grade. Now, that's not going to change what we're going to do in terms of price point. But it yeah. could. If what about if I any other day of the week if I was to say okay, starting at I don't know 150, amazing. Yeah, you try and find culture pearl in a necklace for 150 pounds, standard 18 inch, and then we might crash down. This being our final price, yeah. none of us will be surprised. No, no, absolutely not. Can I ask a quick question? Mm -hmm. Have we got? Um, in the 11 o'clock hour, did I see we've got some multi-strand multi connectors? Uh, or was that, was that me not reading it? Everyone's looking a bit blank. Not sure. No, okay. Not sure, but we have but got these. That, oh, that would go amazing with these pearls. We have got these lovely tassels. Okay. They'd go amazing with it. But we've had multi-strand connectors yeah, recently, yeah. haven't we? Um, oh, the, the clasps I was thinking of, sorry. Yesterday the... we had those bullet Did clasps. You? Yes. Did they have... they would be perfect for, of yeah. which you got four. Um, so, yeah, if you got yesterday's deal of the day, absolutely perfect. Because whenever I see a metre of pearls, I always want to do a multi-stranded piece. I was watching The Crown last night. 
Oh, were you? Yeah. And, um, of course, admiring all the jewellery. Yes. Um, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah. And, of course, she wears her very iconic multi-strand pearls. You don't just get the pearls within this, though. You've also got your closed jump rings, of which they are closed, aren't they? Yes. You've got um, how many of the oval... Ten of each. Ten of each. Ten of the oval closed jump rings, rose gold plated, 925 sterling silver. And then you also get ten of that lovely twisted closed jump rings. So, I mean, they're like gold dust. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. They're great. When you're adding thread, so so because I because I attach with a jump ring mm -hmm. um, to the multi-strand one, I'll tell you why closed jump rings are so important, right? I'd, I'd stranded all three, I'd connected it to it, I'd accidentally done one too tight. It, it slipped into the slot. Yeah. I couldn't get it out, I had to restrand uh, one of them. See, closed jump rings, they are... Doesn't do that. No, yeah, it's so important, mm. especially if you are doing your beading and threading, because the thread isn't going to work its way out. In 18 seconds, I don't think anybody's fully prepared just how good this deal is going to be. Um, for a metre, I'm kicking my... Did I bring my phone over? Yes. Um, for a metre of the beautiful, fine seed pearls, basically, and yeah. they are very, very, very expensive ordinarily because of their more delicate size. Crisp luster. How many have we got then, Neary, now? Down to the oh, final 29 oh of them. Okay, they've flown on pre-order. I'm not surprised. £24.99. pence. Now you understand why I was saying, I've brought me to long length strands of pearls at more than that on our screens without the additions of the 20 yeah. jump rings, um, which are closed jump rings. Look That's how they frame. Price. It is, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And whether you want to do them just the pearls or whether you want to, to add in the precious, um, the the. the Famous five, famous four. Yeah. Um, they'll work both ways. Absolutely. I mean, the recording of them just draped like that in the uh, in the um, breakfast at Tiffany's where she has it going down her back. Yes, yeah, and, yeah. And, and sort of like Holly a Holly Go Lightly. Yeah. Hello, Mandy. Oh, Good Mandy. morning, gorgeous ladies and fabulous crew. Housework is done. What have I missed? Oh, oh well, just in time, I'm going to say. Just in time. Have a little look on the website, though, because it wasn't a lounge hour, Mandy, this hour, so you can see Mandy, what brought you. Mandy, I'm surprised you're still with us after after what you've been through at Comic-Con at the weekend. You what have you been through? Oh, she had an amazing time. Oh. An amazing time. Recovered. I am so jealous. I'm impressed by the fact you've got all your housework done by 20 past nine. Yeah. Goodness me, I'm still doing what's, house what's housework. housework? Yeah, I know, I know. Uh, hello, Elizabeth. Say, morning, everybody. Wow, Alison, stunning designs. Oh, Love you. them all. And that's from Liz. Um, in Tyne and Ware, good morning, oh, my lovely. You, Down to the final eight of these. Stunning. Kit. Oh, my goodness me. These, again, alongside um, the sterling silver tassels that are coming up at 10 o'clock. They'll be fabulous with those Peruvian turquoise. We've reached for them a few times. We're going to move on because they have uh, they are looking very limited now. If you do miss out, you can wish list it, but also... Don't worry, I've got the same kit, but this time with gold, all down to personal preference. And can I say, so I did the, the three strand one out of one kit, all the other pearl pieces are out of one kit. So it goes a long, long so way. So it can go a long way, you know, it can go really heavy or the rest of it. So two necklaces, two bracelets, two pairs of earrings. Those bracelets are so pretty. I know, those bracelets are gorgeous, aren't they? So pretty. Bit of me they are, as it has. I might be stealing your inspiration there. Uh, hiya, June. Hi, Alan, Alison. Brilliant start to the show. Love your jewellery, Alison. You. Gorgeous as always. Thank you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, if you're a yellow gold yeah. uh, person, then dial quickly. Also, can I just say... Closed jump rings, we sell those by the pack, don't we, sometimes? Yes. How much are the jump rings by the pack? Oh, gosh, because they're, they're, because they're soldered, yeah. they're more expensive than yeah, the normal ones. Got I've got a feeling, were they 10 I think they were. I think they were. And you're getting two packs, yeah? Yeah. Plus, yeah. you've got the metre of your freshwater pearls. So you're getting a metre of pearls for a five. Basically. Is it just me that's doing that maths? <laughs> In my head, those wow. the, the two packs of jump rings, I reckon, yeah. let's just, let's just make it easy, £10. Yeah, I'm sure yeah? it was. And that means you are basically getting your metre-long length per, strand of pearls. Yeah. No, well, I agree. Neary's saying to, uh, saying to my ear, look, the metre-long length pearls at £24.99 is mad. Yeah. No, never mind the precious metal jump rings. Or vice versa, though, to be honest. For me, you're buying one with discount. Yeah. 
and then you're getting all your all your precious metals for free absolutely absolutely if these absolutely. don't sell out i would be no. stunned you know a triple bracelet cuff a cuff oh, bracelet yeah. would look amazing or even a five strand cuff bracelet I want or, or the four you've got there if you slid that of your stunning absolutely stunning jewelry i want Classic. this kick. i want this kick. it's just you know four jump ring four pearls on each on each head pin pair of earrings stunning oh, amazing. amazing amazing i want this kit these are flying yeah. if you want the the big four they are coming up as well in a separate kit if you're after the sea pearls and the sterling silver right now, it's a metre long. Let's be honest, a 38 centimetre strand of pearls, at the seed pearls at 24.99. I know, amazing. it's crazy. But it's that, it's that times two and a half. I mean, basically you're saying 24.99 for that necklace. No Not way. Happening. That's no three way. figures. Even at my prices, that's three figures. Absolutely. There's 17 left. There's a queue on wow. the phone lines. Best way to shop with us today, if you haven't already done so, tap the app or the website because there's never any queues there. Remember, we've got, what, just over half an hour until wonderful Dave Troth steps into the studio hey. to launch those brand new Jade Bangles. They're wow. unbelievable. Hello, Mandy. My excitement is still in full <laughs> bloom as yesterday was just wow. So I haven't really slept. Uh, made use of my time um, so Aww. I can join you lovely ladies. Oh, bless you. She didn't Mandy. sleep the night before either. Did you not? <laughs> she was so excited. Well, you can have a good old nap this afternoon, yeah. though, can't you? Um, hiya, oh. Tracy. Morning, Ellen oh, Allison. Feeling you. rough this morning. I've got COVID. Oh, bless oh. you. Um, love all your jewellery, Alison. Oh, well, thank listen, you, Tracy. Get well soon, yeah. my lovely. Get well soon. We're with you. Give yeah. you a virtual cuddle as well, my darling. I've only got two of the kits left, so I'll leave that one Gosh. with you. Amazing, amazing, amazing. If you missed out, then you can absolutely wish list it. Um, I like, oh yeah, I like the name of the kit. The Precious Quad. <laughs> Is it just me that thinks about muscles when you yeah, say quad? Yeah, yeah. Or a quad Not, bike. <laughs> or a quad bike, yeah, absolutely. Gem encrusted quad bike rolling through the mud. Wow, the Precious Quad. I mean, they, I mean look at those and rubies. They've got... They're just so lush amazing oh what i did with the ovals on one of them and, and i know we're going back to the pearls can i just show you that so the the these are a, uh no not that one that one sorry the ones with the drops so i've put those on the ovals so, so you had like bales on yeah yeah so you can use them as a bale as that's well that's a good idea sorry i forgot no, to say that before. no it's a perfect idea because you've got that oval yeah, yeah. They, they, they they give yeah they give the bale like design now you are getting those precious metal uh closed jump rings i need to emphasize that they are closed yeah. you get 10 of the oval and you get 10 of the twisted rounds um again i don't know what this kit's going to as of yet but i'm thinking even if we said jewelry maker price 10 pound for, for you know a pound each that seems fair doesn't yeah it? Um, for both of those, you don't just get that though. You've got your precious quad, oh, which is all about high quality ruby, natural ruby. You've got tanzanite, you have sapphire, and you have got the most amazing emerald. I, Can you pass emerald. those emerald bracelets over? Because they are stunning. They are just so, I mean, that one's got the emerald all the way around it. Yeah. That emerald, I agree. We've all, we, we're all talking about the emerald. Look at the yeah. colour of it. And you, it's gorgeous. Because it's, it's, it's vivid. Yeah. And it doesn't matter about internal inclusions with, like, with, well, three of these four, actually. It's all about the colour saturation. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this kit's going to, but for four of your big five and the sterling silver, I mean, how much would we expect to pay for this bracelet? Oh, that's got to be... That, uh, I would say they're three-figure bracelets. Definitely. They're precious metal... They're just gorgeous. I think, it, you know, it's going to depend where, where you sell it, but, but I would say definitely 300. Definitely. Definitely three figures. I think so. So, oh my goodness me. When have you ever oh. seen Tanzanite, if I just said 10 pounds? When have you seen quality ruby like that, 10 pounds? Sapphire like that, 10 pounds? ruby like that 10 pounds and then 10 pounds for both of your sterling silver closed jump rings 49 pounds and 99 pence only um i'm wondering if we got quantity of this kit 
Oh, we have. How on earth? What? That? <gasps> no, no. That that uh, price for that emerald strand on its own, that price for that ruby. I can't get the ruby. Okay. It's like um, what they call it, pigeon blood, don't they? Yeah, 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 it, yeah, it, yeah. It's so and it's natural, yeah. so it's five percent gold, five percent rarest. Okay, now hands up. If, 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 firstly, did any of us ever imagine that we'd own, all, uh, own four of the big no. five? Because I didn't. Not, not pre jewelry maker. And Definitely not when I started not. jewelry maker. We didn't have them did, when I started. <laughs> it's a good point. Did, you, did we ever imagine buying four of them in one day? No. If you're a brand new customer, you must be thinking, what on earth is going on? They yeah. surely cannot be talking about genuine emerald, tanzanite, ruby, and sapphire. Oh, we are, and we're going even lower. But as you can tell, I'm getting a bit excited about this because I know what it's going to, and it's unbelievable. Alison's totally right. What we take these two is a ridiculous, ludicrous, in the best possible way price point for one of those strands. We've got quantity, but, but we're going to use this 60 seconds. This is your call to action. If you oh, join, God. if enough of you join us on the web and on the phone lines, we will take it to one of the most unfathomable best deals that we've ever done on your big five. I, I, I'm, I'm sticking to my guns and saying the forty nine ninety nine for the for, for any one of those strands on yeah, their own. Whichever. For that emerald is out of this world. And I'm just saying, that's it. And mine was exactly the same. Look at the, look at the colour. Where, do we know where it's from? Uh, yeah, we could tell you that. The locations. It's Brazilian. I would have guessed, I would have guessed Zambian, because it's that yeah. big, but it's not. It's Brazil. Um, Ruby and the Sapphire Madagascan. Yeah. That explains the glow. And then your Tanzanite, obviously, from Tanzania. Tanzania. Uh, amazing. Is there enough, how many people on the phone lines are on the web? Not nearly enough, is it? No, not nearly enough. Oh, I knew you saying, but they don't know the level of the deal yet. I need to see you trust there. Though, yeah, trust, trust the process. Trust the process. Oh, he's doing it. Because if you haven't yet, reach for the phone <gasps> lines, add it to your basket. Like, can we just do the maths on this for a second? That's six components, would we all agree? Two sterling silver, yep. four strands, 29.99 divided by six. Five sixes. Five pounds. Five. Five pounds. Five pounds. You did when it. <laughs> have we ever done Tanzanite for a fiver? I, I love the fact he's like, no way you're not paying five pounds for that. You've just done it, Mary. Yeah. Or the sterling silver for yeah. five pounds. Yeah. We always say, though, with our kits and with our bundles, um, we always say, look, you get not only the inspiration and the talents from our fabulous designers, Aww. you know, you also get some of the best savings. I couldn't sit here and bring you each individual strand at a fiver. No. And the reason for that is it takes more broadcast time. That makes face. It's yeah. logical. Makes yeah. it, whereas we can put them all in one amazing kit. We can squeeze those margins down to the bare minimum effectively. And we can honor it. A fiver per strand. We had a hundred of these, but I know <laughs> that they're not going to be hanging around. We'd be foolish not to, wouldn't we? Do you, do you ever think to yourself like every so often and go, ah, oh, do you remember the time? Imagine, imagine, imagine yeah. like decades from now. Yeah. Imagine we go, ah, oh, do you remember we could buy, we bought Tanzanite for a fiver? <laughs> do, you remember, do you remember when we bought Back in the day. natural Madagascan ruby and natural Madagascan sapphire for a fiver? Do you know, it's, it's madness. It's absolute madness. And also, some, you know, if I had the time, I would have done, but we could have talked about Cartier using rondelles. We yeah. could have talked about all your big high-end jewellery houses using this shape of bead with your big five. But you know what? I don't want to talk about them because look how amazing Alison's jewellery is. And if, how many pieces have you made out of this kit? One, two? Uh, six. I oh, know you've added the pearls. So with the pearls, oh, no, with that, I did one. With the big four? One, two, three, four... Is it four pieces or five pieces? So one, Which two. Which has just got the gemstones in without pearls. One, two, three, four. Four without the pearls. But, but I've, you've dotted but I've them also, in amongst yeah. the pearls as well. But you think how far these kits are going to go, though. Yeah, yeah. If you've got one of the pearl kits and the big four, um, you know, you're probably talking, what, let's, 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 let's say 
Oh, hang on a minute. Hold that thought. What? <laughs> what? Earlier on, Nia was like, listen, the way I see it, I'm not meant to be here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not meant to be producing today's show. Oh, my. He's a stand-in. <laughs> so how about if I said you could make all of this jewellery? In fact, we'll, we'll do the maths. So can we count all your amazing big four pieces of jewellery with the pearls as well? Oh, with the pearls? Yeah, so I've got two here. I did have separate, so it wasn't all from the one kit. Okay. So just uh, one, two, three, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten 11. pieces. Okay. Eleven. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. Oh, twelve. Yes, I forgot those two. Twelve, 12 pieces of jewellery. Four, five, six, seven, nine. Here's 11. 11, okay. Well, in nine seconds, I'll tell you what, we can do the mask, can't we? Even if you add one of the pill kits to the, the precious quad kit that's on your screens right now, we can do the maths and work out approximately how much it's cost Alison to create each of those amazing pieces. We are already at a mad price point. When have we ever brought you any of the big four um, anywhere near a fiver? And the reason why I'm saying that is because basically, look... Those sterling silver closed jump rings, sterling silver closed jump rings of which you get 10, four strands of your big five, 24 pounds and 99 pence. Crazy. So what's that now? Four quid? Yeah. Four pound per component. Yeah. This, is, this is the maddest deal I've ever seen. How much were the pearl kits? 24.99. So you can so get they're... both for 50. So both for 50 and we made 11 pieces of jewellery from uh -huh. it. No, even 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 I wouldn't dream of selling the earrings. That's for four that. pound fifty four per piece of big four and genuine pearl pieces. That's, That's what crazy it, madness, absolute. And some of them are very gem heavy as well, oh, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah. Um, it's gone crazy on the phone lines, on the website. Amazing. We had good job. We had quantity of this yeah. kit, isn't it? Um, again, you never mind what happens outside these four walls. Just compare with ourselves here. When yeah. do I bring you Tans Night at four pound something? Oh. At four pound even. Yeah. When do I bring you Madagascar? and ruby or uh um or sapphire for four pounds when do i ever bring you a uh, emerald of that quality for four pounds ah oh my goodness me well done joan heather tina wow. gainer sorry helen buckinghamshire hello to kathy maker in yorkshire pamela i tell you what i'm going to let you make your confirmations there's loads of well you done. there um and i'll keep you updated as and when um alison what are you going to demo the cross let's, right, show, let's show that piece i'm going to demo the amazing. cross because they'd asked me to do some chain mail but i got carried away with doing <laughs> <laughs> well, that intermingling them, and they were just so. So I've done a, I've done a chain mail. Now I have used normal jump rings. Normal jump rings to do to do this motif on it, and I think, I think um, Tom, who's not listening to me, has got has got some jump rings he's going to put up on the bo bottom, haven't you? Yeah, so, he was listening. Yeah. He's always listening. So that's. I mean, the main thing with the kits was the closed jump rings, but I've I've put some um, open ones in just to make this cross. Mm -hmm. So. I'm going to, I'm going it, it, to, it's nice and easy. Mm -hmm. It's based on, on um, Byzantine-ish. It's lovely. It looks like a key as well. You could have a key. You could put more on. You could extend because I've gone quite round. So it, it's, it's, you know, Celtic, but you, you kind of lose the cross bit. You could use different colours. Um, you, could, you can miss bits off. So I'm starting, it, it's unusual because when you, when you use, chain meal it's all about the aspect ratio which dictates how you can do different pieces so um if we just did this um with singles so i've got three three b three jump rings here if that was single or two this would be even more floppy than it is now so i've bulked it out which has made it this really substantial piece and i love it like that yeah it's amazing so i'm starting I'd with that yeah each, each that each on one of, of the chains that we had earlier on would look amazing yeah. on one of those chains as well. So as you can see, they, they don't hold their shape or anything in their individual components. So we're going to start off with three jump rings. I'm using these. These are um, five um, mil in a diameter jump rings. If you've got a thicker gauge um, jump ring, then you can come down on the number. 
So just be aware if you've got a thicker gauge jump ring at home, you, instead of putting the three, you might only put the two. Um, obviously, these, these, are, um, these would have to be about this thick. Um, so this is going to be a bit floppy in, in this size. So start with the three, pop your next two jump rings in. So I'm doing it in different colors. I'm going to put those in different colors. So I've put two in, then I'm going to put another two in. One, whoops, two. Okay, then you're going to flip those down. So I've got three, two and two. I'm holding that middle two and I'm going to flip these two over. And then you push them up through the middle. So you split that open and you can see those two silver ones coming up through the middle. We're then going to pick those up with our next gold jump rings. I've done them different colours because it's just easier for you to see. Now it gets quite tight in there when you're doing um, the, the proper size jump rings. Okay, so we've got, where's that last one? So that gives you, there we go, there's three and three. Where's that other one? There. That gives you your, your three arms. Now, obviously, this is, this is a lot um, looser than the real one is. To do the longer one, I carry on, I repeat that bit. So I have another six, uh, two, two, flip them over, add three, two, two, flip them over, add three. That gives us the, the long um, leg of the arm of a, a, a cross. cross. Um, so that then goes, those then all go on a slightly bigger jump ring. Um, this is a, a nine mil jump ring. You get away with a seven. So I'm going to open that, slide the three onto there and shut it. So now we've got our basic of our cross. This, this is purely there for me to start off. So when you're doing the real size, just get a little bit of wire, um, add your three jump rings on and it gives you something to hold. So we've now got the shape of a cross, but obviously it's, if I pick that up, it's, it's, you know, it's not going to hold its shape at all. And I want it to hold its shape. So we're now going to sort of turn this into a Celtic. You could do an extra one of these. Again, they would be a little bit more floppy. Um, so I've kept, it, I've kept it nice and tight. So I've got some more. So each of these little ones has 10 in, and that one has 10, 20, 30. So you've got 60 jump rings there. We're going to add three in to each gap. So I'm going to pick them up. Now you'll see on the side, you've got the ones that we flip down. This is what we're going to attach to. So we're going to take a jump ring in. I can't do it on the big ones because they are just, they won't hold their shape. They are too floppy. So if I pull that out, can you see how you've, you've picked up those two there? Yeah. So I'm then going to close that up. Now you'll see as soon as I start doing this, I'll put one in each and you'll see it starts holding its shape. But then when you add the other two in each section, there we go. One, two. You just go around. You can already see now that you're starting to get that shape. So if you just left fewer in, you get that more Celtic cross vibe. I filled it in. I packed it in. Um, because I like the, the rigidity of it. Uh, pick up that next one. There we go. And then our last one in. Obviously, I'm doing this for speed, so use your other set of pliers. I'm terrible for doing chain mail and closing them with my finger. I end up with wrecked fingers. OK, so we've got our basic shape now. However, um, if I pick this up, from the top, it, it doesn't hold its shape. So when you wear it, it will be fine. So if you want that slightly finer um, style, so you can definitely see the cross a bit more in that one, then, then you can go with that because when you wear it, it does actually hold its shape. Okay, so I'm gonna go down again. But what I've done to get, to get the more rigidity that I wanted, I've added in. So you could add two or three to your own choice. 
so it starts getting a bit tighter because you're putting more jump rings in and I will have to go I will have to um, add the other pair of uh, pliers there we go so if you wanted to make these they'd make great earrings they'd make lovely little tree decorations um, you know, you could have you could have little tree decorations. Oh, that's nice. You could just have it on a chain. It's a great motif. Come on, get in there. Thank you. Don't want that one. Just we're just using what I call the flipped over jump rings. That's all we're catching to. You can see it's already starting to stiffen that design up, mm. but you still get. As soon as you put the third one in, it really bulks it up. So I'm going to pop a third one in just so you can see. But the choice is yours. You can go um, two, three, or one, two, or three, and it just gives you that different rigidity. Let's just pop that in there. So I'll leave it there so you can see the difference. So that then fills it up quite. You could use a smaller jump ring if you wanted it in there. Um, but that's your choice. Um, but whichever way you do it, you end up with this beautiful cross motif that you can use all over the place. So have fun making it, whether you're going to put it on the chain as earrings. If you were having it as earrings, I'd definitely go for the extra oh, because be it will hold the shape. Earrings. Yeah, it would make amazing earrings. Yeah. But as a, as a pendant, you could, have, you could have just the two and keep that more Celtic vibe oh. without filling it in. Alison, so. you're awesome. I love it. Absolutely love incredible. There are 19 oh. left of your precious quad. Okay. Um, wow. Genuinely, I think that's one of the maddest deals I've seen on your I, week five. I agree. It's crazy. It's I'm four pound per strand. Wow. Four pound per strand and four pound for the sterling silver. Yeah. Which is bonkers. Crazy. It is bonkers. Crazy. That's base metal and, and you know, glass. Agate or, yeah. A glass yeah. or a plastic bead. These aren't those, though. They're genuine gemstones and four of the big five. And high, and, and high quality ones. Yeah, exactly. You know, we've all gone, oh, my gosh, that emerald is out of this world. The glow you're getting from the, the emerald. The tanzanite is stunning, and the 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 colour match is beautiful in it. They're, they're all amazing. The, the ruby sapphire, is that the ruby. pigeon blood. I yeah. love it. Amazing. Down to the, the final sapphire. sixteen. Wow. The clock is on your screens to close this auction. I've got four rows of names. Um, if you are any of these people, Janice, Maker, Elaine, Debs, Jule, uh, Julie, uh, Hilda, Janice Catherine, Jay, Caroline, Barbara, John, Lorraine, and those are the names that I can see. Um, you need to check out your baskets. Janice, you've just checked out. Well, well done. done. So if you see your name on this side of the list, you need to check it out. And if you see, look, Catherine wants two. Jay wants yeah. two. Um, and I've got people joining in. Elaine's just crossed out. Yeah, well done. well done. Elaine's just got her too. Amazing. I've only got a limited quantity of them now. Incredible, beautiful jewellery. Thank you. It, they were such a pleasure to work with and so easy to work with. Oh, love it. Love and there's it. more amazing jewellery from our lovely Riveting. Alison as well <laughs> in the 12 o'clock hour. But I tell you what, what a star buy have you got coming up, you know. We are so lucky to be able to bring you gemstones like this. Yeah. So, so, so lucky. This strand is on, a, on another level. On another level. Prepare yourself for some of the finest blue sapphire, mm. Burmese blue sapphire that you have ever seen. When we think about fine quality sapphire, yeah. you know, I, I, I don't know, I immediately think of people like, obviously, the, uh, the Royal Engagement Ring. I think about, um, I've just gone back, Elizabeth Taylor. You know, you think about that really deep blue. Yeah. Now, and it's all down to personal preference, whether you go for the deep blue, whether you go for the more cornflower blue. My mum preferred the cornflower blue colour, but 
actually the darker colour is more popular globally and generally speaking commands a higher price point. Now when it comes to sapphire, now here's a gemstone that is favoured for engagement rings etc because it's incredibly durable, just nine on the most scale, um, so one below your diamonds. Um, it's celebrated, well, known to have or carry one of the highest price points as well. Um, and it can have inclusions. I think that's fair to say. As with all your gemstones, we kind of expect those internal characteristics. First, it's so important that I mention that if you see internal characteristics in ruby, sapphire, emerald in particular, as long as that doesn't hinder the saturation and yeah. the glow of the gemstone, it's not necessarily a negative because we actually talk about silks in ruby that can enhance the value. Like I said a few moments ago, prepare yourself for one of the most incredible strands of sapphire that I've seen. Do you know, like, and we are just little old jewellery maker in the middle of UK, you know, that... When we first started, it was all about beads, wasn't it? It was lovely gemstones, but they were kind of beads. We'd have never in a million years have dreamt of bringing quality like this no. back in the day. Oh, gosh, the first ones we had were nowhere near like this. No way near. The, and it's so important, I think, that I mention, this is gem quality yeah. sapphire. Uh, and we've I've shown you before presentations, pieces of jewellery that have been commissioned by the likes of Cartier, Bulgari, Boucheron, you know, uh, um, uh, I've got um, something in Nevada, I can't remember. But anyway, all working with not your round brilliant cuts, your oval cuts, your trillion cuts. Yeah. They're working with beaded shapes like this. Yeah, absolutely. Do you think that looks amazing? Uh, I, I've seen it in real life. It's Look just... at it in real life. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> it's idyllic. It's, it's stunning. When we think about blue sapphire, it's this colour that we mm. imagine, isn't it? Totally. In your briolette drop, so one of the more challenging cuts because obviously you've got very dramatic angles. You've got top drills so you could create fabulous cascades. Imagine this. Here you go. Hang on. It's a cascade with that. With oh. Alison's pearls yeah. from the last hour, or this hour rather. Waterfall earrings, yeah, just mm. a few, just a few dotted in between. They'd look amazing. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that this is going to be the most affordable strand that you've ever seen in Sapphire. It's not going to be because of the quality. And, and it, is, it is textbook. It is textbook. If I was to bring this to air and um, I'd been instructed by the powers that be, L. 299 is your price. You've got nine carats of fine quality, natural Burmese. There it is. I would not be surprised. In fact, oh. I'd be over the moon because let's be honest, it's nine carats of Burmese sapphire. Nine carats. That moment of realization where I'm being entirely complacent. It's nine carats of Burmese sapphire. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm not going to sit here and tell you this is going to be the most affordable parcel. It isn't because of the quality. But we will bring you the best possible deal that we can on the finest grade. You know, l let me just, uh, terrible analogy, but bear with me on this one. If you want to get a really affordable handbag, you can go to somewhere like Primark, can't you? you go to Primark, amazing, handbag, does exactly the same job as if uh, uh, you go to somewhere like Louis Vuitton. But there's a difference in the quality, I suppose. Yes. This is your Louis Vuitton of Sapphire. Does that make yeah, sense? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It, yeah, it, it's, the, it's the grade that we are looking at. And £149 is an absolute steal. I'm dreadful at maths. 149 divided by nine. Uh, divided by nine. Divided by nine. That's wow. £16.55 per carat of Burmese That's Sapphire. That's crazy for it that It is quality. crazy. Should we make that mass a bit easier? <laughs> yeah, let's, 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 let's cross a milestone, shall we? Really? Yeah. I thought we'd crossed the milestone. We definitely have. Two nine, that's half what I would yeah, expect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's nine carats. It's just stunning. Nine carats of genuine Burmese root, sapphire. Well, the jewelers that I worked at had Burmese sapphire. And they were never anything less than four figures. No. Never. 
I agree. It's a blue sapphire that's got clarity. Yes. It's a blue sapphire that's got the perfect textbook colour. Yes. It's a blue sapphire that is in, in one of the most complex cut. And they are ramo jammoed on that strand, aren't they? Oh, oh, they certainly are. I mean, I, the pearls we had earlier, I think, are the perfect size to go with these. Yeah, I'd I have, I'd have a tassel coming down from a simple pearl necklace because I just want it simple. Yeah, I agree. And then all your eye is drawn to those and the pearls are just going to enhance it because they'll bounce that blue off the, off the nacre. Nacre. <gasps> Nine carats of, wow. of, of this quality of Burmese sapphire. Listen, I will bring you sapphire. Wow. We can do sapphire at some of the most amazing yeah. deals. Gemstones, we can because we buy very differently to other places. But it's really important that I emphasise just the grade of this. Hello, Lisa. Hello to you. I have a salon sapphire ring that's cornflower blue that my husband bought me years ago. And this would go lovely with that. Oh, oh absolutely. That's lovely, isn't absolutely. It? Um, so beautiful. Mm. So, so beautiful. And I don't think it really matters if it's different locations. It's all about the colours, isn't yes. it, Lisa? Yeah. Oh, you need to treat yourself, my lovely. Um, incredible. £99.99. and pence. The reality is, look, I've got um, a, 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 an Alex Munro bluebell pendant that my husband bought me for one Mother's Day years ago. And it's got a briolette cut. It's, one, it's like a small briolette cut. Mm -hmm. It's not a sapphire. It's a kyanite. Yeah. And it costs more than what's on your screens. I know. It's more, crazy. And that's one individual stone. Yeah. yeah. One individual stone. Make sure you're checking out everybody. There's a 30 second clock appearing on your screens. I think that's a third of what I'd have expected this strand to be. In 25 seconds, we are taking it. Uh, in 25 seconds, we are closing this auction. Um, get it home. Use your 30 day money back guarantee. Yeah, the quality is premium. Funny. It's premium grade. Janice Elaine, Gloucestershire Fife. Incredible. I think it's, uh, yeah, if, if your budget allows, that's an absolute steal. Um, and it would look incredible with those pearls zero interest on your split payments as well so it's up to you if you Gosh, use that of course split. yeah wow 25 pounds we used to have to get it home you, yeah I mean, it's mad, isn't it? That's we crazy. used to have, um, I could pay in, like the saving scheme at the gym yeah, that I yeah. worked at. So you pay into it and you keep adding to it as and when. And then eventually when you've saved up for whatever, whatever it is that you want to buy, then you can take it. Yeah. Home. No, 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 25 pounds and you can have this home and then pay us. Pay, pay wow. In the future. Amazing, isn't well it? done. That's um, gorgeous. Incredible. Well done to every single one of you. Now, not long to wait until Dave steps into the studio launching <clears throat> some of the finest jade bangles. And you can see I've popped them on there. Um, so selfless. I oh, love the noise. I know. They talk about the music that jade yeah. makes. And How amazing. There. How amazing are these? We all know that a jade bangle is regarded as the pinnacle, but to have a jade bangle with master carving, that's mm -hmm. on another level. Um, so these are launching in a few moments' time with Dave. Uh, <coughs> he'll be stepping into the studio fresh off his holidays. Um, but first, now, here's a gemstone that I seldom ever get the opportunity to talk about. Widely considered to be the rarest of all your sapphires. Made even more popular on the engagement of a certain princess. Mm -hmm. Yes, you guessed it. It is Paparaccia Sapphire. The jewellery editor showed a photograph of Eugene, Princess Eugenie there, um, or announcing her marriage to Jack uh, Brooksbank. And the first sighting of her Paparaccia Sapphire engagement ring, the world will be asking just what is Paparaccia Sapphire? I yeah, there'll be people it. watching who've never heard of it before. It's a very distinctive colour, and like I said, very uh, much considered to be one of the rarest colours of your sapphire. Um, moving on. <laughs> They say, there's the photograph, a paparaccia is the rarest of all sapphires and arguably the most beautiful um, and instantly recognisable for its pinkish orange colour. While paparaccias range from pink to orange hues, often described um, as spanning from sunrise to sunset tones, the finest display a fiery sunset colour reminiscent of a tropical dusk. Oh, I agree totally. It's I 
It's just one of my favourite gemstones. It's stunning, absolutely stunning. And it's it's such an unusual fusion of colour. Yeah. Um, but they go on to say, prices of non-heated, uh, non-heat treated stones um, of a good quality can soar to more than $50,000 per carat, easily rivaling rubies and emeralds of the same size. Um, at a guess, Princess Eugene's ring is around five carats. So Mr. Brooks Bank will likely have paid over a hundred thousand pounds for the rarest of all sapphires. Yeah. I'm sure Mr. Brooks Bank has <coughs> could afford it for it. it. And you want to see sunset? Oh, look at that. There Isn't it is. Isn't that just amazing? Adam, you know your unbelievable directing skills. I don't know if you could put our strand next to that ring, could you? Look at it. <laughs> the most valuable Papadatra sapphire that we have seen to date is David Morris's ring shown at Paris's Couture in 2016, pictured below, with a price tag of just over one million euros. Uh, this is not Princess Eugene's ring, but serves to demonstrate just how valuable these Papadatra sapphires are, particularly in the most des desirable orangey pink tone um, and if they are unheated. So, um, look... I'm, I'm, I'm not sitting here saying that, look, look, let's make a direct comparison. However, let's make a direct comparison. Seriously, well, you've got pretty much the same orangey pink colour. Uh, yeah, exactly. I don't, I, you look, I don't know if ours is heat treated or not. Whichever it might be, it's still Papadatra Sapphire regardless. And it's still considered to be one of the most valuable. Absolutely. Absolutely. Who wants a parcel? 15 carats oh, of Papadatra Sapphire. 15 carats? 15. <gasps> yeah, 15 carats. Um... Oh, my goodness oh me. My Again, can you gosh. imagine it with those pearls? Papa yes. after sapphire and pearls. Beautiful. Hang on. I'm just going to do this. Sorry, Adam. And then I'm going to do this. <gasps> Look at that. How high end. Can you imagine high end. owning a piece of jewellery with these two? No. I was after some Padparaccia sapphire for many, many years. I never thought we'd get it on jewellery making, no. ever. Say that about the big four, five. Never thought we'd get Padparaccia Sapphire. No, because it's one of the world's rarest and gemstones. I, and I, I, we had some a few years ago. That's why I was shocked at how much. And I think it was a two inch strand. Yeah. It was in the little gold box. Yeah. And that was it. Yeah. That's huge. Nine carats. That I love that with the pearl. Well. You won't believe 15 the price. Fifteen carats. Yeah, fifteen carats. You, can I just say, you will not believe the price tag. If oh, you've no. loved Paparazzi Sapphire and never even entertained Always. the idea of owning it, today we're going to change that. It's a moment in history. I don't own Paparazzi Sapphire. No. I'd love to say I do. I'd love more. Today, I think we're going to be welcoming the rarest, considered globally, internationally, the rarest <sighs> colour of, uh, of sapphire in the world to multiple peoples. Stop permitting, of course. Wow. Collection. You know, when we think about sapphire, we immediately think blue. I know that with the wealth of knowledge that so many of you have got in terms of gemstones, you know that sapphire comes in a different array, um, in, in almost like a rainbow of colours. Papadatra is the rarest of all of them. And to get it anywhere near a double-figure price tag is, is just crazy. I would never have even entertained that. Why is there a 30-second clock on our screen? That okay, is... how many have you got? <gasps> 30. Wait, 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 wait. Ads. Can we stop the clock? Okay. That's crazy. Yeah, let's, but before we do what? that though, yeah, you heard that right. I knew he was going to do something crazy. We've got 30. I want to see 30 people on the web, on the phone lines, because if you love it, you need to be there. You won't, we go, I can't believe we're even entertaining this. It's going lower. Yeah, yeah, go on, go on. It's got cramp, everyone. Nothing to see here. Alison knows where it's going to, so I'm just giving you all a heads up. If you've always longed, aspired to own Paparaccia Sapphire, today's the day. What is it, 3rd of September? Yeah, 3rd of September, 2023, the day that you acquired amazing quality sunset Paparaccia Sapphire, 15 carats of. And you didn't even pay £69.99. pence. Let's get that. Let's put, I tell you what, let's put another 30 seconds. <clears throat> oh. 
Let's look. There's a, how many people are on the phone lines? Hang on, hang on. Okay. Clock's ticking. You're going to need to be quick. Oh, there's about no. 40 people there. Oh my We're God. going even lower. Today's the day, Rose, a moment Rose. in history. Do you consider yourself a collector of gemstones, but in particular the fine quality gemstones? Did you even entertain the idea that you would be able to say that you own, even if it was one carat or 25 points of Pat Pratcha Sapphire, let alone... Oh, no. Come on. Let alone 15 carats, and it's that sunset. I didn't even hesitate putting the strand alongside that piece, that David Morris piece. Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence only. I don't. I don't know anywhere else in the world that will be able to do this. I can't see my name yet. I don't know anywhere else oh, in the world oh. that can do this. Hiya, Sharon. Hello, oh. lovely Kafili. Saying um, I have six. Wow. That production sapphire uh, rings, two pairs of studs, a pair of chandelier earrings, and a strand. And loose stones, my number one gemstone. What an amazing yeah. collection, Sharon. It's what incredible. an incredible, incredible collection. You have the rarest colour. And it is breathtakingly beautiful, isn't it? It is those wonderful sunset colours. We had only 30, but look, let's not be complacent here. That's 30 parcels of 15 yeah. carats of Papadacha Sapphire. Unbelievable. I remember when the Gemporia Partnership introduced Papadacha for the first so time. And they were, I think it's fair to say, melee size. Yeah. Tiny, tiny, tiny. You're getting a whole parcel. I've got three of them left. I'm so sorry to those of you that miss out. That's why I wanted to give you that little bit of a heads up. Join us on the web. Join us on the phone line. Um, so you're in exactly Gosh. the right place. I'd love to be able to say that we had 100 of those, but it's never going to happen. It's Paparazzi Sapphire. We're never going to have Incredible. 100 in terms of quantity. Amazing. Make sure you stay where you are on those phone lines. Wish list it if you've missed out. And don't go anywhere because fresh off his holiday we've got wonderful dave troth stepping into the studio to launch i mean look at the lavender from there look at the greens incredible. from there these absolutely incredible brand new bracelets we all know the bangle is the pinnacle in the jade world how do we elevate that well we master carve it these are absolutely exquisite um and i know there won't be many of them available dave is joining us in the studio after this <laughs> It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our friend 
Family and Knowledgeable Help Team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Welcome back, everybody. Fresh off the plane oh, yeah. and looking incredibly sunkissed. We've got the wonderful Dave in the studio. And Dave, oh my goodness, these are unbelievable. Yeah, okay. Did you have a nice holiday first? Oh, lovely, thank you. Very, very nice. Um, ate a bit too much, all inclusive. Yeah. Not a great idea. <laughs> and I went and saw my parents yesterday and I went in, I gave them their gifts from holiday. And they're brutal, like parents. They <laughs> just said, you've put on a lot of weight. Just to my face. Thanks and I was like, okay, no problem. But you need you that. You definitely uh, don't look oh, yeah. that. Black is slimming. That's why I've worn it. Okay, you can barely, there's a paper clip holding these trousers together right now. Okay, the button does not fit. Uh, but yeah, I had a lovely time. I could not miss this show at all. And you, you're going to be very well aware of what the reason is. Um, we've got uh, Tom producing and he was like, look, I had no idea we had this show because we didn't know if there was going to be flight delays. Mm -hmm. Once we realised we had the green light all clear, I said, right, we've got to do this incredible show. So you guys know that, uh, what? Two months ago, maybe a little bit less, six weeks ago, I was out in the Far East. Yeah. Um, and I bored you to death about that trip, but we was out in China. We did a tour. We did Shenzhen, Guangzhou, ended up in Hong Kong. Met some of the most influential kind of jadeite dealers in the world. Probably yeah. the single most influential uh, in Stanley Chu, um, who has his own boutique in Hong Kong called Ilya. Uh, Ilya stocks the world's most valuable jade. Okay, they're, they're, they've been in the industry for generations. Mm -hmm. And they used to just supply uh, the big jewelry houses. Okay, they yeah. were like a business to business wholesale. They mined the jade in Myanmar. They, they uh, you know, carved, cut it, and then they sold it to the, the big jewelry houses. When the mines were shut in 2020, the summer of 2020 in Myanmar, that part of their business was gone. They just had their jade. And Stanley Chu, the, the youngest of, the, of the, the family said, look, why are we selling it to the big wholesalers when we can't replace it? This is where we should set up our own boutique and mm -hmm. sell what little jade we have left remaining ourselves. Um, and that's exactly what they've done. They've, in 2021, they sold the world's fifth most expensive bangle. Okay, it was uh, 3.88 million US dollars. Um, and we have two bangles, the likes of which I don't think we've ever bought to before, both in terms of those key you know, value factors, in terms of uh, crystal, translucency, but on top of that, the carving. So these are carved bangles. A standard jadeite bangle takes 10 hours to produce from start to finish. And there's only literally about 5% that make it all the way through. Because wow. even in the polishing stage, if there's a fault line, if there's a crack, it will shatter. And then if they can, you know, if, if they're fortunate enough that it only breaks in two, which is very often not the case, but if that's the case, they'll create a hinge bangle. But the reality is these are the, the top 1%. So less than, wow, yeah. 1%. Yeah, this is the, the reality. I mean, we talk about how expensive they are. It's nothing to do with the carrot weight. It, it's not really to do with the actual artistry involved in carving a bangle. It's you need the most premium grade to make it all the way through. And if you wanted to know how um, Jade has kind of exploded on the world stage, mm. right now, you can go for free. 
um, in London, uh, Christie's are doing an exhibition of Wallace Chan's work. Okay. Who's the gentleman that is one of the, the world's most celebrated jadeite carvers. Yeah. It's uh, 50 years of his work on display in London right now. I urge anyone to go. We're talking about the guy that created the world's most expensive necklace, $200 million. Wow. Um, which featured mutton fat jade. He's carved jadeite cicadas for a million dollars. He's incredible. He's like a philosopher because that is how jade is treated. And whilst that's taking place right now, we have the opportunity to bring our collectors, and I'm gonna say this, of the hundreds of jadeite bangles that we've bought to you, that I've bought to you both next door on Jampori, our other channel, with finished jewelry, and here at Jewelry Maker, these are the finest jadeite bangles. The reason that we don't bring these, this, this level of, of bangle next door is because it's a much, much bigger uh, um, clientele. Mm -hmm. It's got a much bigger audience because there are more people that are interested in buying finished jewellery yeah. than learning how to create jewellery, right? So that's just the reality. Also, it's live like 24 hours or at yeah. least 20 hours a, a day. This is five hours. So it has a big, big uh, uh, audience in the United States as well. And so therefore, any, any jewellery that they want next door, they want big volumes. Mm -hmm. When you enter into the world of the finest grade, the top calibre, there is no quantity. Mm -hmm. Just to put that into perspective, we've never sold a brand new bangle next door with a quantity of less than 200. These are brand new bangles and our quantities are 19 and 26. Yeah, extremely that's as, big, that's as big as it gets. Yeah. We place the order before we even know how many are gonna be created. Because it's that divine, we saw the rough, we we're like, yeah, we'll, we'll place an order on this. You know, we, in, the, you know in, in the luckiest case scenario, we could end up with two, 300 of these. But realistically, we know that's not gonna be the case. And, what we end up with is these strange numbers, 19, 26, but we said and committed to take everything. You're about to get the opportunity right now to get a pinnacle bangle. Like a bangle for me that could walk into Christie's and Bonhams and Sotheby's in terms of everything. So the carving is elite, and you're gonna see that it's all done by hand. The color is elite, so it's not like a hint of color, it's a real strong saturation. And then there is a transparency to these bangles that I haven't witnessed in bangles here at the channel before. Um, you can show that bicolour one, Adam. It is absolutely... Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So the reason I'm saying it's bicolour is all of them will differ ever so slightly. They'll all have that apple green. Yeah. Uh, you have this moment of purple at the base here. Some of the others, there'll be slightly different patches. You'll see this floral carving. You know, I mean, we talk about how difficult it is to set a gemstone mm. on a curve. Imagine trying to carve a gemstone yeah. on a curve by hand with that translucency. This is the, as good as it gets, and I know many of you now have, you know, phenomenal jadeite collections, and you'll know just how important something like this is. You, we'll all be aware that we haven't really seen anything like this. The only thing I will stress to you today is not all of us will be able to own it. I know that too. I've already put my, my name down on both of these if there is one left. And I'm, you know, I'm, I've made peace of the fact there probably won't be. If one comes back, I'm on the wish list, that's fine. But there's, a lot, there's more than 26 people watching right now that would love to own these bangles. I get that. These aren't, I'm gonna say this now, the best bangles I've ever seen, and the reality is, when it comes to jadeite, each, each deal is different, okay? Um, and if we were working like any other jeweler, we'd look at the market value of each piece of jade, okay? Mm -hmm. So these would become the most expensive jadeite bangles jewelry makers ever sold. But you know how we work, El, and for those of you that are tuned in, you know how we work too. We, we don't do that, we take a tiny margin on everything, so it's all based on cost. Even if we get this, and I know, that should be the most expensive bangle we've ever sold. Yeah. If we paid less for the rough, then it's not gonna be the most expensive bangle we've ever sold. And it's hard for some people to get their heads around that, and I get that, because we're unlike any other jewelry house. Most jewelry houses, you'll go, well, if something's more expensive, then it has to be a better grade. Not necessarily the case here. It's a deal by deal basis. It's yeah. the best deal we can get each time. The reason I'm stressing that is because these are the most valuable bangles we will ever sell. So in the eyes of the market, these, these should be the most expensive, but these aren't gonna be the most expensive bangles we've ever sold at Jewelry Maker today. Really? And that's insane. And I, I'm saying it, so. They, they, they are, and I, I agree. That's my immediate thought, Dave, when I saw them this morning. I was like, we've never done anything like this before. No. Never. Nothing. Never, like and, and if, like, let's just say the most expensive bangle we've ever sold here is what, 799, maybe, something like that. Then the reality is these, by our own standards, these should be over a thousand pounds, okay? Yeah. Anywhere else, I'll just show you first dibs bangles right now. Look at these, there's not a single bangle outside of what, 
two and a half grand. 6,600, 3,600, two, two and a half grand. These are amazing prices, by the way, mm -hmm. amazing. I could show you the fifth world's most, fifth most expensive bangle ever sold yeah. at a public auction, Stanley Chu's bangles, $3.88 million. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna show you these, right? None of these are imperial green. None of these are carved. And yet they range in price from nearly 7,000 pounds to two and a half thousand pounds at the low end. Yeah. Okay? That's insane. That's amazing. I've got two bangles here that are going to be in three figures. Absolutely. Three figures. And I'm going to say something that's going to shock you, Neri. That's incredible. And probably shock you, Al. You get both of these in three figures. What? I'm telling you now. That's how incredible this is going to be. The craziest deal we're ever going to put on your screens. The, the easiest auction we'll ever have to do. And it's all based on what we always say. If we get a great deal, you get a great deal. It's never been truer than what you're about to see this morning. The two best bangles I've ever seen in the UK are here. Yeah. The two best bangles I'll ever sell are here. Yes, it's true. I've seen more expensive bangles in the Far East that are 30 grand, 100 grand, exactly. half a million pounds. I'll never get to sell them because I can't afford to buy them. But the reality is these will be probably go down in my history as being the most valuable bangles I've ever sold. And had you, you and me, Al, with your experience in the jewellery industry as well, had we set up our own boutique, our own physical store, and, uh, you know, hey, one day we might, and we had bangles like this, we'd look at this and we'd go, well, these are the best bangles we've ever had. So these have to be the most expensive. Yeah. We're going to be a lot cheaper than anywhere else. Absolutely. We, we wouldn't be governed by the, the kind of mechanics that we are governed by here. Yeah. There's not even a question. You know, our producers would sit there and go, God, these can go for a lot more. You know, I'm just being honest. You can't do it. Yeah. You can't go, but that's way better than any other bangle we've ever sold. So it's based on the cost. So in short, I'm going to say to you, it's the best bangle deal you'll ever get. And I'm going to offer you the chance. I think we should start with the bicolor, the one that is uh, behind L, behind me. The green with the patch of lavender, these the are crystal, amazing. the incredible floral carving. There are 19 of these, am I right? Uh, 19, I believe. Yes. Okay. Adam, please have a 30-second clock. I know there's more than 19 people watching. I've also promised you this won't be the most expensive bangle we've ever I can't sold. get my head around that, though, Dave. Like I said, uh, yeah, uh, and, and like I said, we all know the ethos of the company, yeah. but as long as I guess it's so important, look at the colours. Mm -hmm. uh, it's so important that we appreciate this as no reflection of the true value. You guys know that. Yeah. I'm 100% convinced you guys know. This is going to be, you know, of course we're going to come in at you know, 5,000, 20,000, whatever. This will be in three figures. Unbelievable. Well, the fact that you've said you can get both. Yeah, you can. For three figures. Yeah. There you go. 19,976. And I wouldn't argue with that. No. You know, Jade is, is very subjective. Mm -hmm. Jadeite is very subjective. We know the, the virtues to look for in Jadeite. This has them all. And if I was to pick this up in Shenzhen when I was there or Hong Kong, mm. and someone said to me, oh, that's a £20,000 bangle, I could see why. Yeah, absolutely. I can see why, I can see why someone would pay £20,000 to own a bangle like that. Absolutely. I... There are 19, or there were 19. Yeah, well, uh, Tom's just actually said that we definitely don't have that quantity anymore. The phone lines have lit up. I'm not surprised. Just so gemmy. Yeah, super gemmy. You can see that wet look finish on yeah. the surface, a testament to the crystallization of the jadeite. In Adam's wonderful kind of recording here, the shot, you can see the actual translucency, yeah, the ethereal amazing. quality of this jadeite when we're up close like this. And um, you can see the detail in the hand carving nature of this. Imagine how thick and dense this was yeah. before the carving was administered. Over the, I mean, 10 hours to make a normal bangle. Mm. This is far from normal. This is far from routine. It's, it's also one of the largest bangles we've done in terms of its uh, um, diameter. Yeah, yeah. I saw you easily slide two yeah. on. And they're moving around freely on the wrist. Yeah. You hear the, the, the pitch, the sound of jade. Look, I've already got multi buyers. Rosemary, you've got two of these. Oh, You're going to pay under a thousand pounds for two. They North are Yorkshire, absolutely North amazing. Yorkshire, Somerset, Merseyside, uh, Wales, Middlesex, Surrey, Hampshire, Hertfordshire. Let's um, let's go straight down to you know this is crazy. In fact, let's play a game. These are all going to sell out, no problem. But can we go back to this first dibs listing? Six bangles that were the, the I typed in JDAP bangles. They were the first six on the page. I just took a screenshot of the yeah. page. So let's go to these six. 
and you've got you know all the all the different types there, right? Most expensive one is uh, six thousand six hundred and eighty-six. Can we go there first, please? Let's go six thousand six hundred and eighty-six. Can I just say as well, these are in a different league, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, they are they? for sure. Whole other league. Yeah, they really are. This is night and day. And it's bigger. Yeah, much bigger. Oh wow. By the way, there's only seven chances. There, there is, there is. I mean, look, these probably sell out whilst we're playing this game, but yeah. you, I've promised you what you're going to get. So then I'm going to go to the lowest price now. Okay. And I'm just going to go to £2,579. £2,579. Imagine there's a seventh bangle on there and it looks like this. Which are you going to gravitate towards? Yeah. 100% this one. 100%. Yeah. Okay. It's not unrealistic. No. In fact, that's a great price because you've got the Oh, my God. Can, I mean, you know, we're, 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 our, our biggest problem is the fact that our prices are so good that we look at this and at this price, I get it. We all look at this and go, it's expensive. It's two and a half grand. Hmm. If we're in the real world, Jade I like this. We're not, though, are we? No. We're not in the real world. Um, I would give you a 30-second clock, but there's no point. There's four chances remaining. So I'm going to call the final price. I hope you're ready to pounce on this. If it's in your basket, you probably will lose the opportunity. Um, straight down nearly to 499. Wow. Four, yeah, 499 pounds on this bangle because of the deal that we managed through. The the longer we've been in the Jadeite industry in the Jadeite game, the the further into it we've got, where we get to the actual the the, the miners, we get to the people that are right at the source, yeah. and we get to get deals that probably we weren't privy to uh, three years ago. Well, I mean, as an establishment, Dave, and and, and I will like I said, you you play a huge part in this. You know, you've really been the driving force and. Um, the fact that you are there at the uh, at the master carvers within yeah. their studios, mm -hmm. you've built those amazing relationships, yeah. and that's the, why the likes of the Financial Times want to come and uh, do a story um, on us. Story because they just can't believe that we are crazy enough to be the things like this. this you know, this yeah. secret little society that we have here is yeah. actually happening. Yeah. You know, when you tell them, it sounds like a dream because they are from the real world. So they go, yeah. "There's no way. What are you doing? How is this happening? Is this real?" Yeah, and it is. Absolutely. You know, it's fascinating. It's amazing. And um, we are offering the, the best value on the best jade out right now. Yeah, unbelievable. Obviously, it does come box, as you would imagine, with something of, uh, um, of this luxury. But wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. With, I think there's one left. We're doing this on all on exclusively on confirmations, obviously. Yeah. Certified at Taipei payment. jade at £124.75 on interest-free split payments. Phenomenal. Unbelievable. Four nine nine. Mm -hmm. I think that's... Okay. Okay. We'll there might be one way. left. Stay holding. Speak to somebody. See if you can get it. How do we get better than that? I, when I went in... I, I take no pleasure in telling you this, but when I went into the gallery this morning, I'd seen the pictures of this, sent it on WhatsApp. When Adam showed me this picture, there should have been a bleeping machine in there because <laughs> ah. the words that came out of my mouth, uh, it took my breath away. When he showed me the recording of what you're about to see, oh. it's the holy grail for a JDAT bangle. And it just so happens, look at that. <gasps> it's as good as it gets. That's, I mean, how many times do we see lavender? And it's a tiny moment, a hint of lavender. Yeah, we're never this. Never. Never. That strength of colour is absolutely phenomenal. And we've got 26 opportunities. What? Yeah, wow. 26 of these. And you heard what I said earlier about the affordability of these opportunities. That's what we look for. That's what we dream about. That's what we hope for. Solid lavender oh. jade out bangle top crystallization. Go on. We had twenty six. Right. Well, we've Neary some, bought ten or something. We've 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 just learned that some very savvy shoppers yep. have called ahead. I do not blame you. Do not blame you. Okay. Okay. Thirty second clock. And we'll make this one available. I didn't know we could do that, but fair play. You find a way to win. Oh, oh absolutely. You know, um, if you really want something, you find a way. Sometimes. Unbelievable. I've never seen lavender like that before. Can I just say the colour from over here? Yeah. Is stunning. <laughs> exactly. Absolutely and, you know, stunning. Alison, how, how many times have you been in here and seen us offer lavender jade out? And, you know, you look at it and it's got a hint of colour. You would never, yeah. you'd never say, I can see it from, what, 20 feet away? Yeah. That yeah, strength absolutely. of colour. That's how impactful this lavender jade out is. It's just, just completely stunning. And yeah. the carving is so deep that you can see the yeah. carving from yeah, here. That's yeah, that's one thing as you clocked this morning. Yeah. I was saying it's that... You know, the, the depth of Yeah, the, the relief work of yeah. this incredible 
carving in a gemstone that is harder than steel, done by hand, with primitive tools that they, they've perfected over, what, 8,000 years? Yeah. You know, that is just, it is unbelievable. It really is the world's only gem-level art piece. You know, That's the reality. And I don't think for one second anybody would do this. Um, but, you know, if you got involved today, contacted First Dibs, mm. said, oh, look, I've got a Taipei certified gemological uh, um, hand-carved jade, jade eye, band. lavender yeah. colour, natural, mm. how much do you reckon? Who knows? It's not going to be anywhere near, like, those yep. prices. Because look, it's worlds apart. It is. It is. This is, like I said, this is the dream. Yeah. This is, I'd never, ever, I'll tell you the truth. If I was in China, and I was, about a month ago, whenever it was, and I'm in the bangle factory, which I was, and we see all grades, colors that we don't even bring you in terms of like, they're too washed out, they don't really have, uh, you, know, uh, some, you know, they're not even green, it's just jade, mm. it looks like a rock almost, but it's a bangle. Had I seen that, I wouldn't have even asked the price. <laughs> I genuinely no, wouldn't, so, you know. Yeah, we've been yeah. approached by someone here, and, and you know, it's fallen into our lap, but I know enough about jadeite to know that that is expensive. Yes. If that's natural, it's expensive. I may ask the question, I may say, is that type A? And if they say, yeah, I go, wow. Well. I'm not going to say, can we get 26 of those, please? <laughs> not a chance. Um, we have seven left. Yeah, good luck. Everybody. Seven chances yeah. remaining from 26. So 19 well, of you have already confirmed on But that. also people can do maths. Yeah, they know what they're paying. They know, you already they know. know what you're paying. And again, of the two bangles, I'm just being objective right now. This should be the most expensive of even the two you've yeah, seen. Yes, it's today. lavender. Right, so, but we don't do that. We're not looking at the market value of things. We're not going, what should this command? If we wanted to do that, we'd just put it in bottoms. Let the market decide. Right now, Dave, I've got like a, um, a, a little Roland Schlussel on my shoulder, I think, yeah. saying, you know, lavender jade. You know, lavender jade, yeah, absolutely. And we've seen it. It's climbed from, you know, fifth in the leaderboard, I guess, of the most valuable colors of jade eye to neck and yeah. neck with imperial jade eye. Yeah, and you can see why. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm just going to call the price, 499 <gasps> That's unbelievable. Wow. I said, I started this morning, I said, look, I had to explain to you how we do our jade art deals so you understand. This is not based on the value of this jade. It's based on the deal we managed to do. And it highlights exactly why we're so unique. We're not just unique because we're on your TV screens and we do the Wall of Fame. We're unique in the way that we price our goods, Absolutely, how we yeah. take a tiny margin. We're the busiest jewellery store in the world. You know, that's the reality. Um, yeah, uh, Tom's just said, Dave, any chance you could get another, um... yeah, No, no, Tom. Sorry, mate, I wish I could. Because people are missing out, that's Yeah, all. I wish I could. I really do. Look, we'll, we'll be, there might be an opportunity to bring you more carved bangles, but that colour is exceptional. Yeah. The two bangles you've seen this morning in terms of their colour, yeah. their crystal, everything Absolutely. about them. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't really even have to talk about them. Once you saw Adam's, you know, up close and personal shots of them, that's it. You know, it talks for itself. This is jade eye. It's as good as it gets as good as it gets it's incredible it's unbelievable i've never seen lavender like it no no never seen lavender like that oh my we've got a, i think we've got a, a chinese collector or a chinese heritage collector in greater london right now um with with well, it's a mandarin name so you know it this is the reality this is when you know that yeah. we are getting this incredible material you know to the people that understand it the best understand it the most i, I say often that we have collectors as far away as Hong Kong that you mm. need to jewellery maker to see these incredible deals. Absolutely. Um, do you know what would be the cherry on the pavilion? But you know the only right? thing more expensive than a bangle? Hmm. A matched strand. So the only, that's the reality. It's even more wasteful than a bangle. So there's only one thing that eclipses a bangle. It's matched strand. Doubly fortunate. When you see the pictures of Stanley Chu, he's holding an $11 million imperial green necklace. Not a bangle. Although we sold the fifth most expensive bangle of all time. And you saw that strength of colour in the lavender bangle. Can you imagine if I said to you this morning, this show is so important because you get to get the two pinnacle pieces. Wow. And you're probably thinking, no, there's no way. Just take a look at this. Oh, goodness. Taipei lavender jade. That, again, mm -hmm. I've never seen lavender like this. No, it's a very unique show today. Very unique show. Uh, one of the reasons, you know, we, I wanted to come straight in, pretty much off the plane. Yeah, you literally landed, what, landed yesterday? Landed yesterday evening, yeah. Straight <coughs> in. Straight in. Straight into work, not missing this opportunity. Could well, we're never very miss grateful this, for that day. Of course. Um, so we do have a bigger quantity than the bangle. Bangle we had 26 of. I've got 28 of these. Oh, my goodness. 28. Me. And it's more wasteful. 
way more wasteful. Way more, it's going to carve the rough down into those beads. Um, I'll give you a, th oh, it's already open. There's 105 carats here. Lavender, type A jade, 28 opportunities. So pretty. Very pretty. <gasps> I've just clocked from a distance, look at that. Mm. <laughs> yeah. So, we're going to do something special for you. Um, if I could, I'm going to ask for a 30 second clock. There's only 28 opportunities, guys. Yeah, extremely limited. Use this time wisely. Imagine today you tick off two boxes that none of us would have ever even entertained. To be able to have a whole yeah, the lavender matching. jane. Yeah. Beautifully matched. Yeah, you know, exactly. We've had beads strands with one or two beads of lavender in. Mm. Have we actually had a lavender strand Look before? Look at that. Uh, very few, yeah. and I don't think necessarily this intensity of no. colour. Unbelievable. Right, I'm going to do something crazy right now. We could come in at 10,000, 5,000, but I see Suzanne's bought three, I see Rosemary's bought two. Can we well, match the price of the bangle? I'm going to tell you I'm hundreds of pounds away from being done. Hundreds. I told you it's a special showcase. I told you it's not based on the market value of this material. It's based on the deals we were able to get. This is part of one epic deal with a cutting facility. Um, I would, when you see the final price, a lot of you will be looking to multi-buy, but I'd get that over the line early. You can always cancel your order if, if I'm, you know, if my deal's not as good as I'm saying it's going to be. Yeah. Amazing. Remember the lights in the studio do wash. Yeah, the absolutely. Out. That, is, that is the nature of being in a TV studio. Um, lights, not ideal. You know, you never walk into Bond Street and they've got floodlights <laughs> for their jewelry. Yeah. It's it's not the way. They have very subtle LED lights that make the jewelry twinkle. You know, do the do the best, replicate the sun, and that's why Adam's depiction of this, as you're on your screen right now, is accurate. Is a much much more accurate depiction of what this JDA looks like because we are trying to replicate the daylight environment here. We're at 499, which is absolutely epic. That's why we've got multi buys. But everyone also knows you pay the final low deal. I'm going to half the price right now, so I'm going to go to 249. And I'm nowhere near done. But you, um, cool. Wow. I yeah. mean, like you said, the only thing more valuable and expensive mm -hmm. than, a, than bangle a bangle is a strand. Is a strand. strand. Yeah. The only half that price. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, well done to the multi buyers. Well done to everyone there. Um, this is your last opportunity in the lavender series, yeah. especially with this strength of colour, this crystallisation, this translucency. Can I have a 30 second clock please Adam and we'll give everyone the final low deal. A lot of money coming off this price. A lot? A lot. Huge amount. No one's going to believe it. There is one but though, there's only, or rather there were only what, 23? 28. We had 28, 28. available at the start of this auction, okay. uh, which was two more than the bangle and we saw yep. a quick, you know, could have sold that over. I mean, you yeah. heard Neary saying, have you got any more? You know, there was way more people on the lines than we had available. Yeah. Margaret's multi-bought on this, Cumbria's multi-bought, Rosemary's multi-bought, Suzanne's got three. Three seconds and I'm going to shock, I believe I'm going to shock every single one of you. Do you know what? If you got the bangle, you got to. Well, I'm going to make it a possibility for you. Bangle's 499. Mm. This is 99. Pardon? This is 99 pounds for you today. If you want it, it's yours. If you miss out, you miss out. Rosemary's gone for three. Suzanne's gone for three. Maker and Cumbria's gone for two. Margaret's gone for two. Teresa, Janice, Maker, Karen, Anne, Catherine, Maker in Devon. Suji, you're there. Penny in Buckinghamshire, you've got it. Oh, um, yeah. sold out. Of course. This is, this is you know, we've heard of, of our collectors already right now who are just jumping the queue. Uh, before we even bring the products live, getting on the phone lines. I don't they blame trust. For that. Yeah. The, the trust is there. They know that Dave... You, also, so you, the you know, the, the beauty of what we have here is you can cancel your order. Yeah, you can cancel exactly. It. If our deal isn't as good as... It's better to, to have it secured ready than to miss out. Now we have... We've done oh, the, the wow. lavender series. Now we're going to do the green series. And it's a very different type of green. This is based on the original imperial colours of Nephrite. But it is jadeite. But it's the spinach green variety, which is exceedingly rare. Not as valuable as the Imperial Green, but rarer. It's the spinach green variety of type A jadeite. I don't believe we've ever bought you this opportunity before in jadeite. This is the colour that made the original jade the original jade, as in the nephrite. I love the spinach green. Yeah, and, and you know, imagine this, 800 years ago when they discovered jadeite, the, the more abundant colour was what we refer to today as Imperial. The reason yeah. we never find it now is it's pretty much been mined out. So they readjusted or realigned 
what they wanted. It used to be this color, because this used to be the more abundant color in the Nephrite. This used to be the imperial color seven, 6,000 years ago, 5,000, 2,000 years ago in the museums. And then when they found jadeite, it was a very different, it was an emerald green color. Fek Choi, or Fei Shui, that, that was the color they wanted, that incredible imperial green, that chrome green, that apple green. This is a rarer, or earlier version of the imperial green. We have one strand depicting these colors for you. And I'm going to show it you right now. Take a look at this color. Oh, it's, You've got it's a lot of the kind of ultra rare colors here. You know, the russet colors. Yeah. This is for the jade aficionado. You know, it's for that understated elegance, mm. the, the incredible canary colors, the yellows, the bi colors, the, the, the kind of imperial gray colors, mm. the omphacite. All natural. All, yeah, all natural. All those piebald, incredible colors that we're witnessing here and a strong thread of that spinach green running through it. How many of these do we have, Neri? Uh, 50. Okay, 50. 50 That's opportunities. Exciting. Yeah, on a color series we have never bought to your screens before. Understated elegance. You know the deals that we're about today. Very unique collector's <laughs> opportunity. Not the commercial colors of Jade Act. Mm -mm. Look at that. Uh huh. It's so beautiful. I gravitate towards the spinach green colors. Yeah. So you've got the spinach tones. green, you've got the, the, the yellows in there. Yeah, the I yellows. love it. You've got those russet tones which were favored in antiquity, mm -hmm. going back through the different uh, dynasties in China's rule. These are colors that we just don't even witness anymore. I've been to the jade markets, I've been to Jade Town in Guangzhou, mm -hmm. where you've got miles and miles of jadeite merchants. Miles. Yeah. Remember, they've got a 10 year supply in China, they're just very expensive. And you just don't see these colors. You very seldomly see them. Mm. You're going to see your lavenders. You're going to see the imperial greens. You're going to pay for them too. Yeah. But you'll see them. These colors are like the reds. Mm -hmm. You know, they're those really, really understated, exquisite opportunities. And we have 50 opportunities of a color series we have never bought to your screens before. It's going to be an amazing deal. I promise you that. <coughs> I'll give you a 30 second clock and we'll make this one available. Some of you aren't even waiting on being told again, and you know, congratulations yeah, savvy. to you. Yeah. Very savvy. That is the way to do it. Yeah. You know, if the opportunity exists, and you have an opportunity, a loophole to get in, then get involved. But in 18 seconds, this will be available to everyone. The original Jade, and I just think it's got that most, the most incredible luster. Oh yeah. I adore that about yeah, this Really variety. beautiful uh, um, luster, as you said, that, that crystallization that we yeah. can see where it appears to look wet, where the light is just bouncing off this high gloss finish. That's, down, that's testament to the, 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 the quality of this mm. jade eye. You've got nearly 100 carats here, and some of these you'll have over 100 carats, we know that. Multicolor, type A jade eye rounds. 38 okay. centimeter strand, 50 chances. It's a multi-buy opportunity for you. Do you know, I was half expecting, Dave, you to say that this was, uh, yeah, a nephrite, it's a jadeite. Oh yeah, no, I've this is jadeite. Yeah, jadeite. so these are the colors that we originally were the most highly valued. Yeah, right. And they had to re realign their way of thinking when they discovered jadeite 800 years ago because these colors were so rare. Mm -hmm. These colors are much more abundant in the original nephrite discoveries. You know, you think of the mutton fat with those yeah. yellow skin. You think about the, the spinach green. Well, this is going to be, we've seen what, multicolor jadeite strands. We've seen them at 10,000 pounds. Yeah. Right? We've seen Gumps. Let's go to, let's, let's beat that. Let's go to 7,000 pounds straight away. Okay. Obviously, Amazing. those of you that Marianne and Sheila are multi-buying in Bedfordshire, you know that we're going to be nowhere near that. You trust us, over 100 carats in some of these, 98 carats minimum. Well, it's a full 38 centimeter strand as well, <laughs> yeah. these rare colors. Yeah. I don't recall ever seeing the strand of these. No. Not in jadeite. Okay, so this is, you know, maybe elsewhere we see prices like this for multicolor type A jadeite. There's a reason you tune into jewelry maker. There's a reason that, you know, you take these apart and create other pieces of jewelry out of them to get a parcel of jadeite yeah. is what we're offering right now. So again, I'm going to give you a 30 second clock and we're going to take thousands and thousands and thousands of pounds off this price. I wouldn't hang around there. I wouldn't, you know, uh, wait on the phone lines. I would be multi buying if you can. Because uh, a lot of you early on are doing that. Mm. So 50 sounds like a lot, but if everyone multiplies, that's 25 off. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, and there is a response to each and every single one of these. Never seen that colour before. No. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's warm. It's a yeah. warm shade of green. Stroke yellow. 
Good luck, everybody. 50. Okay. Right, this is going to shock everyone. I'm going to go straight down from £7,000 to one nine nine, and tell you I'm still nowhere near being done. But I wanted to give you an idea because I see the interest. I see it within your baskets. And we've never seen this colour. It's hard to value it. You might be thinking, well, I don't know yet. Well, now you know. I'm going far lower than the 199 on your screen. Have you? you have your split pay uh, interest-free payments as well. We have multi-buyers across the board now, across the world. Um, and well done to, to those of you that were in early before the auction even opened. We are nowhere near being done here. You know, and it's so easy, Dave, for us to go to somewhere like Gump's, yeah, yeah. First Dibs, you know, any of the uh, those establishments, Sotheby's, Christie's. Yeah. I'll try and find, never mind the price point, try and find this colour. Absolutely. And, you know, you think about this morning, you know, what kind of show it is. Everything is selling out because we know we're doing the best deals this morning yep. on material we've never seen before. If you look to the website right now, the first three auctions we've bought to you, the two bangles, yep. the lavender strand, sold out, sold out, sold out. Yep. Guess what? This will also read sold out in a moment's time. One of those uh, lavender bangles has dropped back in. If you can get it, get it. I'm on the wish list, so yeah. it will be sold out at the end of this show. Yeah, I'm going to stick my name it's down Whether as well. it's yours or mine. Um, multi buyers already. 30 second clock, please, Adam. And we are going to do something phenomenal. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. That wonderful shade, that wonderful color. Yeah. Don't remember ever seeing it. I don't no. think I ever have. No. Wow. Oh, there you go. Um, yeah. you know, I'd love to see that done, yeah. yeah. To have the ombre. Would you to go have the dark to light or light to dark? Dark at the bottom going up to the light. Oh, You've got those amazing. spinach greens at the bottom focal. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. Good luck. 50 might seem like a big quantity. We are super busy today. Ready? Neary, 69.99. What? Straight down. Straight down, double figures, not stopping at 99.99. Brand new today, 50 opportunities. The um, rarest combination of colours, 69.99. Good luck, you got your split payments. I don't think anyone was ready for that. I tried no. to give you a heads up. I don't I did think producer Neary was ready. Oh, sorry, Neary. <laughs> well, look, I tried to give everyone at home the heads up. I said, look, I'm going to be nowhere near this. I want to give you the confidence. And then I also said to you, this is going to read sold out. And guess what? Of course it's going to. We're at 69.99. All great. the jade that we've bought to you over the last five years, three years, we've not had the opportunity to uh, you know, work with these colours. You know, Alison's dying to mm. ombre it. We, we've not had the opportunity to have in one continuous strand, those russet tones, the black colours, the spinach green, the, the, the bi colours, the yellows. This was like a gold, I think. Yeah. Because it's got those yellow tones, yeah, yeah, I think, yeah, with the yeah. gold would be absolutely mm -hmm. unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Amazing. I can't believe you did that, Dave. No, it's quite <laughs> ridiculous. I get it. I think I went too low, but I wanted you guys think? to trust us. I wanted you. I said 199. I said we're going to be nowhere near that. I could have halved it, gone to 99 pounds, but I thought, you know what, let's do 69.99 for anyone who wants to get involved today. Unbelievable. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Let's this, do a minute clock to yeah. close this one out. We don't want to oversell it. We had 50. Um, there's a lot of you there. A lot of it with, is still in your baskets. Um, 58 seconds now to check this one out. Unbelievable. Look at the split payment. It's £23 on split payment. Ridiculous. Crazy. It, it really is. But as long as every single person that is successful knows that's no reflection of the true value or worth. Yeah, nowhere near. Maker in London's got two. Deborah, you've got two. Mary in Cumbria, you've got two. Marion, Sheila yeah. in Bedfordshire, you've got two. Jennifer, Anne, Teresa, Dorothy, Margaret, uh, Cheryl, Anne, Cynthia, Maker, Valerie. Well done to you guys. Candy, Neil, Linda, Jackie, Susan, June, Anne, Lorraine, Laurel, Julie. Very busy. Less than half a minute now to check this one out. Unbelievable. Well done. Yeah, pointless leaving it in your basket. Something as rare as this. You wouldn't, yeah. you wouldn't, you wouldn't just go, oh, yeah, I'll get that. You stick, stick, you, what do they call them in southern <coughs> places like uh, that? Oh, the paddle. The paddle up and yeah. everything. Yeah, I'll be there in a minute. Yeah, you know, you no, don't wait, do you? You do not wait. You do not wait. You wait, someone... you miss out, especially yeah. when the deals are this good. Absolutely. Good luck, everybody. I think I'll be adding these to my wish list as well. It's such a beautiful, warm colour, especially this time of year. Yeah, mm. autumnal. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. Congratulations. Stay holding. Um, there is still a couple of those left. If you can try and get your hands on it, then go for it. The deals continue. Oh, you were saying, Alison, yeah, that you would very much like to ombre. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, we got. Yeah, they that do. that's just amazing. I did. 
Yeah, any there, I'm wishlisting. I'm, well, I'm this is the larger size. size, this is the eight mil. Wow. Bigger sizes. And you so can you see, you could graduate it and ombre it. it. That'd wow. be amazing. Wow, that would be amazing. How many of these, Niri? Limited. Okay. More limited. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, saying that, oh. sorry, 50. <gasps> okay, 50 opportunities. Colors. 50 up to 30 second clock oh. and we're going to bring this line. Wow. Look at this in the daylight. It's incredible. Ooh. They are like, you know, fresh garden peas, mm -hmm. aren't they? Yeah, that, in yeah. terms of colour. Yes, beautiful. And then you've got those real dove grey. Yeah. Jadeites there that are bordering on blue. Beautiful. I know you guys are going to be in quick on this one. Wow. With <laughs> you the saw how low we went well. on the other one. Of course, this is a, a bigger... Uh, mill size. Yeah, yeah. Which which you'd expect there to be to be no, less. The price available. goes up exponentially when you get yeah. the bigger mill size J yeah. rounds. Absolutely. That's Good why luck. I can't bring you thirty eight centimeters here. So wait, you took that six millimeters round to sixty nine ninety nine, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. Look, same carat weight, pretty much. Yeah. Bigger size. Yeah, because they're bigger sizes. So you uh, what? Double, triple, yeah. quadruple yeah. Mm. because of the bigger sizes. Absolutely. So we, we should be, again, if we're looking at the value of these as a proposition, this should be far more expensive. Mm -hmm. yeah. But you know what you're tuned into. You know how special this is going to be. There's a lot of you that probably want the opportunity to, to work with this with the strand you've just acquired. We're going to make that a possibility today. Oh, with one of your big We went to 69.99, didn't we, on the previous one? Yeah. This one should be, even by jewellery maker standards, we should be 149. So let's, yeah, go, let's that go straight makes sense. down. Let's go straight down to 149. What? And there's a reason I'm telling you that. We are going to be nowhere near done on this. But it makes sense. They're bigger. Yeah, much bigger. Same carrot weight. You know, you've got those unique colours as well, those consistent dove blue greys that you've got, as well as those kind of incredible kind of golden jadeites. I'm not necessarily looking for an answer to this question, but can you imagine that on first dibs and the price that it would actually be? Absolutely. Oh, well into the four figures. Yes, well, well, well into, into the four, four figures. I agree with you, Alison. Yeah, absolutely. Knotted, no class, no gold, nothing nope. yeah. else, just that. Yeah. Perfect. As it is. As it is. Uh -huh. It's going to be more than 149, isn't it? Oh, uh, right. yeah. Add, add a zero or two, you know. That, mm. That's the kind of reality. But let's do a 30 second clock. We had, we had 50 wow. of them. We don't now. Make a great London, you've just multi bought. We've got Maria, we've got Margaret, Catherine, in Bristol, Middlesex, Fife, Bedfordshire. Again, I would urge you to check your baskets out because I don't think anyone is going to see what's coming with this price. Mm. But these are your opportunities. This is what you want to capitalise on. This is what you want to pounce on. 17 seconds remaining. The, You've like, still got your three interest-free split payments. Yeah, well. I know. It's amazing. Absolutely incredible. We've got lavenders and that beautiful yep. green. Mm. All natural. Mm -hmm. I'm wow. holding okay, do you know what we're going to do? Just because of how many people were in on the previous auction, um, match the price. 69.99 should never do no. that. There's no other jeweler out there would do that. Uh -uh. Nowhere near. Bigger, bigger sizes <laughs> on the Jade. As I said, the price goes up exponentially. But if you're quick enough, you can make the most out of this opportunity. My mind goes back to that conversation that we had about the Financial Times, you know, where they say, imagine going into that luxury jeweler, mm -hmm. say you're shopping for diamonds, and say that because it's easy to, make, yeah, to, sure. to imagine that. Yeah, how, uh, there's that half carat diamond, and there's that one carat diamond, both exactly the same no, it, what, what I'll tell you what it is, it's, a, it's two one carat rings. One of them's made up of a cluster, one of them's a one carat yeah. diamond. And that's the price differential. You know, you're going to pay thousands of times more, more for a yeah. one carat pure diamond ring, yeah. even if the same grade parve cluster is a one carat ring. That's the reason we bring you clusters, to make the one carat affordable. Absolutely. But if you want it in one stone, the price goes up exponentially. It's the same with jadeite. You know, this is, you know, the same carat weight, but made up of a much shorter strand. You know what? Just, I'm going to call a price, I'm going to go lower, and then we're going to give you a minute to get it, if you're quick enough. Let's go 49.99. Let's just go crazy. Let's do something no other jeweler would do. Imagine that. You'd have oh, to settle already, for the one carat cluster, are. wouldn't you? Yeah, absolutely. We're going even crazier. Forty nine ninety nine. I don't think there's anyone else in ju in jewelry maker who'd do no, it. No, you're right. I think you're right. I think you're right. I think even by our own standards, usually we compare ourselves to everyone else. Yeah. I think even by our own standards, this is crazy. <laughs> um, there's a lot of you on the phone lines. <laughs> like a, look at producer Tom. He doesn't want to press that button, does he? <laughs> he doesn't want to press that. He's button. not going to be here. It's all right, Neary. Don't worry. He's, you know, he stepped in. Yeah. Last minute. Oh, what a shame. I apologise. <laughs>
Uh, he's just going to put Ross's name in there. Yeah, I would. I would. Um, put Ross's name in there. Oh, my goodness. Neary shopping wow. at B&Q. Mm -hmm. What the? Re Do you know what we had a conversation? You know, the, uh, Neary's at, at the minute he's like got a headache and he's got a special kind of lamp, right, mm -hmm. to, to try and. Uh, this isn't going to help that, <laughs> is it? I don't think it's your eyes and the screens, Neary. I think it's working with me. <laughs> I think that's what it might be. Yeah. He seemed so relaxed until I walked in today. <laughs> You know, like he, he said, oh, I didn't know we had this show. And now he's got this migraine from hell, hasn't he? <laughs> Where he's having to just go into all these crazy, he screams red. Oh, bless. <laughs> I apologise. Bless him. Unbelievable. I tell you what, Dave, it's good to have you back. That is madness. Look that at the split crazy. payment, £16.66. 16 pounds. Pence. For, look at the quality. I mean, you, not one of those should be that price. No way. No, no way. You know, I, I'm just thinking back to that conversation that you had with your with Stanley, your yeah. friend. Mm -hmm. And he's like, yeah, Dave, there's a cabochon. Yeah, point, 50, 40 56 points. points. Oh, 56. 56 points, £4,000. Wow. To a friend. Mate's That's straight. the reality. That's Jadine. This is a guy that controls the whole process, you know, mining, carving, cutting, retail. And he just pulled it out of his office and, he, and literally had it on his fingertip. I showed you the, the picture. And he said it's for 40,000 Hong Kong dollars, so about £4,000. Madness. And I didn't get it. <laughs> I didn't get it. Well, why uh, would you? you well, I can't afford it. <laughs> uh, even if you could, though, Dave. I didn't even pay that on my holiday, <laughs> where I've just been with my daughter, you know, all inclusive. Didn't even pay anywhere near that price. Yeah. And there's a 56 point. Imagine me saying to my daughter, Mila, we're not going on holiday <laughs> this year. Daddy, Daddy got this speck of jade. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> I hate yeah. you, Daddy. Sorry, darling. No Christmas presents. <laughs> I've been wrapping that up <laughs> with a postage stamp, would not it? There you go, darling. In a bigger box, in a yeah, bigger box, a in a bigger box. Yeah, yeah. Like... Tic Tac is bigger than that. <laughs> but that's the value of Jadeite. That is the value of Jadeite. Oh, um, my goodness. Congratulations. Gosh. Stay holding. There might be a couple of those still available. Oh. We have two other further opportunities to bring to you uh, oh, this wow. morning. Um, and, you know, wow. again, it's accelerating up the, the value chain, the value ladder, right? We started with our bangles. We said, what's the one thing more expensive than a bangle? You guys know a match strand. We've just brought you a series of strands. Um, and then we've just finished on these multicolored strands. We talked about, you know, the, the, the rising value of the different colors. I talked about how rare those multicolors are. Oh, what's the rarest color you're gonna get? I mean, you guys know it. What is the rarest color of jade? Forget price, forget value. It's red. That's the 18 million pound vein of red that Asprey has in their vault in Knightsbridge or in Mayfair right now in London. I've got a continuous strand of Taipei Red Jedi. Before we even bring this live, before we even show everyone this, Adam and the team, how many of these do we have? Um, 11. <laughs> okay, there's 11. But then that's, that's, that's fantastic we've got. 11. My God, yeah. Um, do you want to see it? This um, is going to blow your mind. You, you, you've seen red jade, but have you seen red jade eye like this? Think about everything you've seen this morning. The lavender's been better than ever. The bangles have been better than ever. This is Taipei red jade eye of the highest caliber one can, can get. So we've only got 11. Take a look at this. Wow. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> it's, uh, it's, it's like cherry tomato red, isn't it? Well, yeah, I mean, you know, Alison, earlier on, you, you could see the lavender from over there. Yeah. She's just put her sunglasses on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Love this strand. This is unbelievable. Mm -hmm. It's gorgeous. I mean, look at it against the black. Yeah, it's sensational. Stunning against the black. Mm -hmm. So uh, couture. Mm. And the reality is you'd literally just strand that, wouldn't you? Yeah, you, you, yeah. You don't need to do anything with it. No. Oh. 11 in the world. My goodness me, you're sourcing two different shapes mm. as well. Yeah, the round and the, the rice bead as well. But it works so well. It's got that linear, I that love kind of it. linear long length look to it, hasn't it? The way that it falls on Do you know what, Dave? Way. I'm casting my mind back because um, I've got your Pixu, by the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, amazing. I owe you for that. I owe no, don't that. worry. Uh, oh, and Because um, I gave it to Tommy. He was like, that's so cool. Yeah. Um, what did you say to him? Four grand. <laughs> yeah, for those of us. But um, can you imagine a little pixel suspended from there? Yeah, I can. <gasps> Lovely. I really can. Amazing, isn't it? It's stunning. 11 available, though. You'll Ten. need. To... Oh. Nine. Nine. This is the reality. You know, you see you already on the phone lines confirming on these. No one waits for Red Jade Eye mm -mm. because you'd be waiting a lifetime. 
I love the fact that you've got the two different shapes on yeah. the one strand. Well, yeah. that's that's what we would aspire to Stunning. do, create, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. You know, when we're to, when we're when we're imagining making jewellery, mm -hmm. normally we'd have to buy separate strands to get those different Absolutely. shapes. Absolutely. But widely considered as the rarest of all colours. Six left. Oh, it is the it is the rarest. It only exists in the skin. Whereas yeah. in a in a boulder, you can get plumes of lavender. That's why you might be able to make bangles. When it comes to the ultra rare colours like your yellows, well, it's basically the yellow to red series because it yeah. oxidises in the skin. You, you shouldn't ever get anything like this. And if you do, I mean, forget four figures. The, the price on something like this, if it's type A, should look like a phone number. Should look like a phone number. I'm going to start because this is going to be on and gone. I'm going to start at four nine nine. That's where I'm starting. Wow. I'm telling you right now, we should. I know we can do this because I know we got an incredible deal in the, in the sourcing of this, but I'm just saying we will kick ourselves. Yeah, Roland Schlusser, he, we even had that guidance, haven't we, saying, yeah. look... From, like, industry see... authorities. Yeah, you, know? you don't see exclusively red. Uh -uh. I paid more for my Jadeite book, genuinely. Mm. Hardback, OK. Um, then you're going to pay for this, and there's probably a one-page wow. mention on red Jadeite in it. One page. Really? Because it's, or maybe there's two pages, but in like a 500-page book, book or whatever it is, it's that rare. And at 4.99, that shouldn't be, a, it shouldn't be accessible. I didn't pay 4.99 for my book, but I said to you, my book's going to be more expensive than this. That's because we're not at the price. Unbelievable. So I'm going to call the price right now. I would give you a 30-second clock, but it is pointless. It's futile. It's, it's pretty much allocated. One deal. Can we just half the price? Two four nine. Unbelievable. The rarest of all colours. Mm -hmm. And it's not and just You could pay that for the book just to read about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Now you actually own it. Yeah. Now you actually own it. But this is the sort of strand, if you're selling, you could sell one or two beads from this and get your money back. Oh, you know. For sure. A pair of earrings. Yeah, a pair just of earrings. A round and a rice bead yeah. inside. Yeah. Beautiful. And, and you, you're going to get your money back. Let's give everyone a minute clock to close this one out. Um, Split payment? Wow. Um, uber, uber rare. And like, uh, yeah, it is that perfect, solid, natural type A cherry tomato red. You need to be quick on this one. It is. It's stunning because the, the red is never solely a red. It's, it's what's known as the red to yellow series. So to yeah. have both of the colours, the, the transition through the lighter tones in the rounds to the elongated, saturated Love reds rice in the beads. rice beads. That is the reality of it. And those rice beads are big, aren't they? So Huge. you would expect there to be, you know, yeah, the, the, uh, green, not, Yeah, absolutely. You wouldn't, you wouldn't expect to see a full body no. red jade out of that size, ever, ever. And you've got a multitude of them. You've got 150 carats of them. 25 seconds. I mean, I don't even know if we've got quantity remaining with uh, still holding. <coughs> mm, there's two. Okay. Two left. Unbelievable. We're massively over allocated, so I think yeah. we're just going to take the graphics out because, uh, yeah, I'm oh. hugely over allocated on that one. Oh my goodness. Well done. Me. Congratulations. Truly what a that. morning. Again, where do we go from here? I'm going to offer you right now the imperial of all Olmec strands. <gasps> this is Guatemalan. It's that imperial colour. I've this will become the new Imperial because it's the only active jadeite mining area in the world today. I've and never forgotten that sentence, Dave, that you said. We have no business owning. Yeah, we, we have no business owning Olmec of this, this quantity. I've, I've got less than 25 of Oh, my bit. goodness. That's the reality. But this is, a, again, the showcase. Whenever there's an, uh, a, a, a period of time that I haven't been with you guys, I always think, oh, I want to come back with something special, of course. Um, and I always, the way I always frame that is if I opened a boutique Jadeite gallery mm. tomorrow in Bond Street, in uh, Place Vendôme, wherever, what would I want to put in there? If I had the pick of everything we bought here, well, this is it. That's what this show, you know, just you know, five or six pieces in a big window display. This is the best of Olmec. We've done mm. the best of Burma. This is the best of Guatemala. There's less than 25 available. Take a look at this colour. In the rounds, matched, oh, epic. Oh, my goodness me. My goodness me. Six mils, natural. The future is Guatemala again. This is the thing. These are all the... I remember, I think it was Stanley Yu had that conversation with, uh, with Dave saying that. Because the Burmese mine is closed. Yeah. I think... 
It, it's tough, but I think Neil Mick is my favourite. That's a tough call. I can't. I, I, is, I love them all. I love them all. Yeah. <coughs> but the art. But Dave's just said that. You know, if I had to pick, then it's yeah. going to be. This is the quality. But this is the future. Um, yeah. Let's get those graphics in. 24, I believe, 23, 22 of these available, um, matched to perfection. And the reality is not all more Olmec looks like this. Mm -mm. Um, we've been spoilt with this, this particular Olmec strand. Olmec is usually, by its very nature, ornamental. It has a different geological conditions that it formed under. Mm -hmm. It's on the other side of the world. And usually it's very chalky, very sugary. To get this level of crystallization is a much easier, or was much easier from Manmar. But to get it from Guatemala is, is almost impossible. Now, we will see more of it uh, in the coming years because now the Chinese are investing in the area. They're out yep. there mining it Absolutely, because it's yeah. their only jadeite mine. And they know how to find it. They have 10,000 years experience of mining this material. This is my final deal with you. So it's going to be yeah. something special. <laughs> I know Alison has an amazing masterclass coming out. <coughs> Al has a wonderful show lined up. I came back just for this 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 one small showcase and i'm going to do something crazy to finish wow. where's that to go out of the bang best of burma this is the best of central america the best of guatemala yeah absolutely um this is your opportunity 125 carats so this is from that parcel which you physically exchanged some i of our traded booms. yeah a shed load yeah of burmese material for it that's the reality it wasn't like for lie no you know we had to trade a lot of our jade that we acquired in 2018 to get this quality of Olmec. Sure, I well, can get you Olmec, but I can't get you this grade. And we couldn't afford to do the deal with cash, so we traded. Because mm -hmm. the value of our Burmese material that we own has gone up exponentially in the time. We bought it in 2018, very expensive then, but it's gone stratospheric since the mine closed two years later. All the mines closed. So then we had something that the world wanted these people had something that we wanted, which was this very exquisite opportunity of top gem Olmec jadeite, that imperial color. Cynthia, well done, Marion, well done, Maker, well done. Okay, on any other given day, I'll do this for you for 149. Can we go there? But this is my final farewell deal with you for today. So I'm gonna okay. go even lower on this impressive, incredible jadeite That's opportunity. That's less than a pound day. per carat. Mm -hmm. 149 is your opportunity. For our imperial Olmec, effectively, isn't it? The best of the best, creme yep. de la creme. Four interest-free split payments, exceptional. Um, Adam, I'm going to ask for my last 30-second clock, if I, if I may. Uh, probably will sell up before then, but I'm going to go lower to finish off this incredible showcase with. You know, if, you, if you've joined us all morning, you've had the most impressive collection of jadeites, and, you know, the deals are going to continue throughout the afternoon, but throughout the, the latter part of the morning, too. Karen, Teresa, Maker, Alan, Margaret, Anne, Carol... Uh, Cynthia, Sheila, you're there. Fife, you're there. Good luck. You're very good luck. Beautiful. Look at that teal colour. Okay, I'm going to do and it. One, two, nine. What? One, two, nine. Wow. For anyone who wants it today. I remember the first ever introduction of Guatemalan jade. I, all absolutely beautiful. But uh, And I'm, th I'm thinking back through our PowerPoints, Dave, where there was that rainforest what, what, necklace, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. And it's really mottled. Yeah, for sure. Look. We were just fortunate to have Guatemalan. You know, the, it yeah. lost for 500 years, has this unbelievably romantic uh, story to it. It is, you know, for, for to many, the original jade. I think it predates the jade. In fact, it does. It predates the jade that has been discovered oh, in Myanmar. Oh, really? Yeah, you've got the Olmecs, the Mayans, the Aztecs, the Wars, yeah, then it wow. was lost for 500 years. Burmese jade has an 800 year history. This was lost for 500 of those Okay, years. yeah. So, so it, it is the original then. jade. Act that no oh, one knew existed other than the, the incredible civilizations in Central America. Unbelievable. What a story behind it. The final. Five chances. I can't believe we're anywhere near 129. Amazing. Dave, can I just say thank, thank you. you so much? Because oh, like no I say, you touched down last <coughs> night no and problem. you're in the studio. Thank so. you very much. I wouldn't thank have missed you. it for the world. Thank you, Al. Uh, thank you, Alison. I know That's your okay. masterclass can be incredible as always. Um, thank you to you guys as well. I'll see you, I'm sure, very, very soon. And um, yeah, don't. We'll let you anywhere. unpack. Yes. Well, yeah, God. I <laughs> Um, Let you unpack. Thank, um, you. thank you, Dave, as yeah, always. Yeah. What a pleasure thank to have him in the studio, bringing you such incredible delights, truly. Yeah. Make sure, um, like I said, if you keep an eye on the website, wish list anything that you've uh, potentially missed out on because our call centre will call you back. And huge heartfelt congratulations from the bangles to the strands. All absolutely.
absolutely amazing. Um, we have got, yes, an incredible masterclass coming up at 12 o'clock, all about riveting. Don't forget those amazing sterling silver tassels that are also available on pre-order right now. Plus, we've got so much more. Um, so don't go anywhere. Join Alice and I after this. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. 
You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. How amazing. Oh gosh. Incredible. I mean, still, congratulations if you got one of those bangles. I'm very jealous. Oh, amazing. Very, very jealous. Um, unbelievable. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to you all on the bangles, on the strands. Oh, they, they are on another level. And we're still not done. <sighs> oh. We've still got more luxury. I know. Amazing. Now, I don't know if we've done these before. I don't remember ever having sterling silver ones before. They've, they're going on pre-order oh. as well, by the way. They're very popular on pre-order and I can see why. Is it just me or does it feel like a birthday show? It does. Yes. It's just like bargain after bargain after bargain. It really new does. Stuff. Whose birthday is it? Anybody? Anybody's no. birthday? No? Mine's, mine's oh, next week. Oh, didn't someone phone up, message in to say it was their birthday earlier? I think, did they not? Oh, okay. Mine's next week. Oh, there is it? Oh, happy birthday go. next week. That's close there enough. There you go. That's close enough. It's, uh, that's Free what it feels birthday, like. Yeah. birthday. I'm of an age now. You don't bother celebrating it, though. Oh, you, you do. Oh, it's bad enough. Oh, mind you, I've gone back the other way, so I'm of an age just where start, you start celebrating start, again. Just start, start counting backwards. When do I start counting backwards? Well, it depends whether you're going for mental age or physical age. Oh, well, I've never had the mental age of my actual No, age. no, I haven't either. <laughs> and I never will. Just to get double figures. <laughs> <laughs> now, okay. And you know earlier on in the show, it seems like five minutes ago, that yeah. I spoke about the fact that if you go to places like Roberto Coin, Tiffany's, one of Tiffany's greatest success stories is their sterling silver collection because they all of a sudden introduced clientele that they never had before. Um, Tiffany's jewellery was all of a sudden accessible to, uh, and I'm not saying it's not inexpensive, it is expensive still. But if you go to Tiffany's, you can get a, st a solid sterling silver, one of their iconic, there we go, mm. perfect, that one of their iconic designs um, like this where they've got the logo on there. Um, I don't know, they're about £500, I think, something wow. like that. They're a lot. They are a lot. And it is 925 sterling silver. Um, anyway, but that's one of their greatest success stories. And there's no gemstones. It's all about the sterling silver. Gucci. Gucci have got, they've got your golds. They've got your platinums. They've got, you know, gem encrusted. But you can go, if you go to Gucci, you can pick up sterling silver, Gucci jewellery. Um, I remember from when I worked in that jewellers, they had a small kind of uh, display of Gucci jewellery. And there was one pendant. It was like a teardrop pendant on a long line chain. I'm going back 24 years now, folks. But it, I don't know. It was about £200, pounds, mm. probably even more than that, to be truthful. But it's expensive. It's expensive. And it's all about the precious metal. Yeah. Here we go. Tiffany's & Co. Perfect. Elsa Peretti, the mesh tassel pendant, features one little pearl. Yeah. £430. And that's just the pendant? Yeah. Is wow. that... Uh, uh, oh, no, it oh, does no, come on. It chain. comes with a 16-inch chain. Oh. Which is a little bit too short. Yeah. We do chains. We definitely don't command 400 quid for them, do we? No. Um, anyway, so... Uh, <laughs> and the reason why I'm saying all of this is because, like I said, Roberto Coin, Gucci, Tiffany's & Co., whichever place you look at... Um, they work with exclusively the precious metal. It's mm. not just about the gemstones. But like I said, £430, it's a huge amount of money for sterling silver, isn't it? You and are if, buying the brand now. Oh, you're, you're buying the brand. Because if you look at that, you've got the chain. I mean, it looks lovely, but you've just got the chain mm -hmm. that tapers up onto the pearl. Yep. So you could probably add the chain that's on there to make yep. our tassel because there's nowhere near as much tasselage. There's not as, nowhere near as much sterling silver no. either. Um, these tassels are heavyweight. Oh yeah, they're beautiful. I think I heard eight grams of sterling silver. So these are significant in their gram weight. Look at that. And the actual bale itself, I mean that alone, let me just show you this, quite unconventional I know, but you can see, sorry, Dan, I just realised you're over <laughs> here trying to help me out and I'm like making your life difficult. But, you can but look, look at the gram weight just yeah. in the bale. Yeah. Just in the bale on its own. Beautiful. 
You know, look at the, I mean, I'm holding one of the designs. This is the tulip. Look at the gram weight that's in that pendant. If that on its own was where we are intending on closing, mm. that would be a fantastic price. But you don't just get that, because if I just bring in my tweezers, you've also got Stunning. an amazing layered tassel with top quality chain, absolutely, Adam saying, look at the quality of that chain. Is it box chain? It's a box chain, yeah. <coughs> you can tell it, by the light moving on it, can't you? Yeah, that's why it looks like this mm. fabric. Oh, that's just beautiful. Unbelievable. Yeah, that's right. Actually, that article that we read earlier on, what was it, nine o'clock this morning, spoke about chain and earrings, didn't it? Mm. Being all the rage. Do you think this is what they're talking about? Well, if they're not, they should be, because that's stunning. You said earlier on, Alison, imagine those earrings. Yeah. I, I think they'd make absolutely sensational earrings. So imagine then, I had a, a duck egg blue or robin egg blue um, box. Yes. Tiffany's and Coast yeah, yeah. on the front of it. And there were these in earrings, <gasps> two of them. Here we go. Earrings have become an unexpected focal point for chain. Anna Koury connects her ear pieces with, ear pieces, sorry, with articulated miniature, miniature chains in gold or parve set with diamonds or rainbow shaded gemstones, a perfect balance of tradition and rebellion. Mm. I love that. Um, I can see people multi-buying getting 16 grams of 925 sterling silver in earrings. Can you imagine yeah. that? as earrings, they would be just the most incredible earrings ever. Um, this is a luxury, and, uh, and it's rare that we solely talk about the precious metal, yeah. but it is all about the craftsmanship of the sterling silver. You've got very Van Cleef beading yeah. around the tulip itself. You've got one of the finest chains, and that's how you get this amazing, look, look at that luster. That amazing Beautiful. movement. It, it, these are unbelievable. Remind me, Neri, how many do we have? <gasps> okay, we had 80, but already, I can tell you on pre-orders, 20 have gone. But you see, if people want earrings, that's drastically reducing mm, that number, exactly. isn't it? So if you've got 60 left, that's 30 people could get a pair of earrings. Three yeah, years ago now. They want the sweet. Joy. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised at you. all. So, yeah, we can all be romanticised by your beautiful gemstones, but also we're romanticised by your precious metals. Mm. These still come from the ground. It's rare. It's incredibly valuable. We all know the price of sterling silver has gone through the roof. To get eight grams in one piece. Right. Beautiful. Unbelievable. You know, earlier on when I showed you on the same, on the same presentation, when I showed you the, um, and I said, oh, they're Tiffany's. Those earrings yeah, are Tiffany's the, and they're in gold. The two links. The two links together. Yeah. They do do that design in silver, Tiffany's. You're still talking thousands. Yeah. It's thousands of pounds for those earrings in Tiffany's. No, not the flick forward. The, 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 there, those. They do those in silver at Tiffany's, yeah. but they're four figures. Yeah. There's not a single gemstone in sight. No, and they're just two links. Two links together. Because they had Beyonce, I think it was, on, a, on their marketing right. campaign. Um, eight and a half grams in, these, in this tassel. It's just stunning, isn't it? It's unbelievable. I don't think I know these are going to sell out. Oh, yeah, they're certainly good. Yeah. They're going to sell out. They're just sensational. We haven't even suggested a price point and half the stock has gone. Mm. But, but, but they're sterling silver. They're beautifully worked. Absolutely stunning. And yeah, you look, you look at that one and you're like, well, I actually prefer ours. Cause and me, I much prefer it. Yeah. Much prefer it. And let's, let's say it as it is. Just as a starting point, we're already under 25% yeah. of that price point. Already, I mean, if, if, you want, if you want to say, look, this is Tiffany's, I don't think it's obvious that that's Tiffany's. No, it's not. Um, you know, but, so not, no one's going to know, really, effectively. But if you want the prestige of owning Tiffany's in, in silver, they do an amazing collection, like I said, and it was one of their greatest success stories, and it welcomed a whole new mm. dynamic in terms of um, their clientele walking yep. through the door. However, you still need to invest and dig deep. Here we are working with exactly the same 925 sterling silver that they do. For me, these are, this is far more intricate. Yes. 
the movement you're going to get from it yeah. is, is way and above. It's sensational. I mean, if you wanted to, how hard would it be to put a pearl between that and the chain if you really wanted to? Even I to? could do that. But I don't think it needs it. And I like the way ours has got the cap on top because yeah. I think that gives it, a f you know, makes it whole. The other one looks... Sorry. Like it's stuck on. Like it's got a load of chain just pulled together and stuck on the bottom. Sorry, Tiffany's, but... No, I, I don't think it's your best. I I, I, I agree, and I love their designs, but yeah, yeah I'm not really. It doesn't look I'm not, finished. I'm not mad in love with that one, and the fact that it's also on a 16 inch. Yeah. 16 inches is not. It's very short, actually. Um, I can only use my build, but it would be very close to the nape of the neckline. Yeah. A 16. Look around me. Um, a 16 inch. Um, let's put a 60 second clock on your screens. Let's also. Look, you're you're you're. Oh, that, what two three meters away? Yeah. Look at that. Now, if those aren't red red carpet earrings, can you imagine you've got the slightest movement and, and because it's a box chain, the light hitting that chain yeah. is incredible. Wow. I love it. They're just going to be... If you can, get the three. Yeah. Well, we will do our best yeah. to bring it to you at the most unbelievable price point. You People always know that. Grand. We've got two different designs. So if I just show the two together, um, so you, if you need to make a decision, you might be thinking, oh, i tell you what then, Al. I'll get a couple of these and one or the other, whichever it might be. Um, we will do our best to bring it at the most affordable price tag. Um, this is more the tulip or a snowdrop. Or a fuchsia. Or a fuchsia. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. The little ballerina flowers. Um, we're at £99.99, £99, but not stopping there. Do you know what we're going to do? My only wish is that we didn't have, uh, we, that we haven't got more of them. Yes. We're going to, how about doing a karate chop? <gasps> that price in half. That there are so many. many of you with this um, already checked out. Loads of you with it still in their baskets. Do not wait. 80 is not enough to go around. Good luck, everyone. An amazing, amazing heavy gram weight piece. Uh, 49 pounds and 99 pence only. Um, incredible, they're flying out the door. There's lots of multi buyers. You're going to be making the most incredible earrings like Catherine and Renfusia oh, and Bernadette. Angela's got four amazing uh, Angela, well done to you, Brenda, Sarah, Gloria, Manchester, Sharon in Wiltshire. I've got lots of you with it on the, uh, uh, on the phone lines and also in your baskets. And we are not even stopping there. I wish yeah. I had more. Do you know what? If I, I reckon if we had I love it. 300, they'd probably still sell out. Yeah. This is deal of the day worthy, isn't it? If these, if these, and you think we had the chain earlier on today, and if you think, if you're thinking, oh, I missed out on that, I wasn't watching during the eight o'clock hour. We didn't do a lounge hour, so you can go back. It was about nine o'clock actually. Um, but yeah, if you want the chain, just add that to this. How incredible would that piece of jewellery? It's not four hundred and thirty pounds. Look at that detail. And also, can I just say, I don't think that Tiffany's and Co piece is anywhere near the gram weight that I have here anywhere near the clock is ticking um is ticking they are flying are we in terms of quantity are we over allocated or yes says neary but that don't let that put you off at the moment if everybody checks out 20 of you are going to miss out so don't let that put you off it'll be allocated first come first serve so it's pointless just lingering in your basket this is an unbelievable deal for eight grams eight and a half actually it's 8.6 mm. um, grams of precious metal wow can you see it in the neckline mm. too oh look at that Oh, that's amazing, isn't it? And look at the sheen you get from that chain. It's just sensational, isn't it? Oh, and it feels incredible as well. Yeah. It feels absolutely amazing. Oh, my goodness. Crisp that's white luster. £34.99 pence only to get hold of this. The intricacy, the, de the detail beading work that you see within the tulip, the snowdrop the free show whichever it is that you see and then that movement internally 
I know. Amazing. People get in quantities. Angela says, I'll tell you what, I'm not going to have four. I'll have six. Thank you. Um, Brenda's multi bought. Sarah's bought three. Amazing. Renfusha's bought three. Frida's bought two. Catherine's bought two. I've got 19 of these left. Cynthia in Middlesex. Gosh. Alison, you're on the phone line. Cynthia, you will get answers, I promise, but it is busy today. Um, if you are unsuccessful, wish list it or alternatively shop ahead on the other tassel because I've got two back to back opportunities to bring you. Um, if you are any of these people that I can see Janice Morag, Carol, Maker in Yorkshire, uh, Nancy, Cumbria, Kent, Lynn, uh, another Carol. Make sure you're checking out because we have 15 live quantity, 15 wow. remaining. Alison in Manchester, you're there as well. The beauty in the gram weight, mm. the luster. Oh, look at that. You kind of did a boomerang there or something. Look at that. Uh, way. <laughs> How amazing is that? 14 <laughs> of these left. David, you've got yours, Carol. And you know, and it, I, again, this is why I kind of said about Roberto Coin, Gucci and Tiffany's and Co. Look, I'm not making comparisons with them directly. They're very different designs. However, they work exclusively with your sterling silver. Yeah. That's my point. You know, you don't, you could put gemstones with this if you wanted to. That's the, oh, yeah, that's absolutely. The In fact, they look lovely with something like pearls. Yeah. Um, but... It doesn't have to be. The final 14, we have a clock to close this auction opportunity. The final 42, um, uh, 42 seconds, well, 38 now. Uh, final 12, well done. Tina, Barbara, you've got yours. If you check out your basket, Nottingham, you, you can still do it. You're cutting it fine, but you can still do it. We had 80. We had 80 available with the flower. Um, about two out of three of you are going to miss out on this opportunity. That's how over allocated we are. 8.6 grams, <coughs> excuse me, um, of beautiful sterling silver, the craftsmanship, the movement of the chain. Movement. In a tassel, beautiful. in a tassel as well, it's so difficult to get that right. Yeah, absolutely. It? Absolutely it is. The, the, to get it so that it sits Ooh. great. Beautiful. And get there. them perfectly. Yeah. You know, look. Perfectly level. Look how perfect they are. Amazing. Now, on to the next. <gasps> it's all down to personal preference. Now, these we have a slightly bigger quantity. Ah, oh, it's so gorgeous. I want some of these. I struggle with tassels. I love tassel jewellery, but I struggle to make them, especially in silver. Mm. I, I like having a cap for them. Actually, it, something like this would be really difficult to make because how do you get your silver and everything into the tassel? We'd kind of make the tassel first and then and there'll then be something the like a loop or a crossbar okay. that you put it in because you can't glue that in. No. So I would think there's a crossbar and you actually attach it to that. But it's not, it's not the easiest thing in the world. No, and if there's a crossbar, you're going to have a potential gap, aren't you? Yeah. Whereas there's no gap here. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Amazing, absolutely stunning. We've got a slightly bigger quantity already. Oh yeah, people getting involved. The graphics are live. Don't you think this is more like a hair bell or a blue bell? It's that elongated bell yeah. shape, isn't it? It's more of a decorative bell, isn't it? <coughs> it is. Um, whereas the one was definitely the one previously was definitely more um, more floral, I suppose. <coughs> yeah. So. Uh, it, it, you know, it is still floral, but it's it's that elongated. I love it. Yeah. Gosh, they're all still multi-buying these as well. I don't blame you. I don't blame you either. I don't think we've ever done anything quite like it before. We've no. done tassel tops separately that you make yourself. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I might be wrong, but I don't remember. Um, big gram weight. We've got a bigger quantity only just though. Sorry, I've left my star by sheet over there. We're going to start just because we need to start somewhere. Yeah. Um, and 99 pounds and 99 pence that's pretty amazing for the gram weight eight and a half grams with your box chain and you think to make this how much chain would you need to buy oh yeah plus then you've got to get the sterling silver tassel top plus every time you cut it you're losing a few links yeah at least one or two links so you're losing bits of your chain all the time when you're making something like this and there's no way on earth i would get this um, now, what do we have in terms of quantity, Neary? Okay, triple figure quantity, that's good. 
Okay, bigger the quantity. I'm not going to finish this sentence, but you know, bigger the quantity. Ooh, we will stagger the price point. So I tell you what we're going to do. 30 seconds, we're going to get under 50 pounds. The more of you that we see, the more you influence Neary. Is that, yeah, is that fair enough? You're easily influenced, aren't you, Neary? <laughs> yeah? He just needs to see numbers on the right-hand side. Yeah, basically, and that's the thing. If you put your, put your shoes, if you step into a producer's shoes, that's what they're looking for. If they yeah. can sell the quantity, then they can work on that lower price point. Um, yeah, give, so it's give him a bit of peer pressure. The more of you that are there, the, the lower he will go, because obviously a bigger quantity is going to go. Um, he has to be, Neary has to, he's in charge of obviously on air time and, you know, how, he, he knows how much it costs per minute for us to be mm. broadcasting. So these are kind of multiple uh, um, balls that you've got to juggle, I, uh, I suppose. Now, we're at 49.99, 60 seconds on your screen, call to action. If you love it and you want it at the best, most competitive price point, we have got a big, bigger quantity of this one. Um, not massively but it is a bit bigger um yeah the more of you there the lower will go pardon you could only juggle two balls nah as a producer you can do more than that you're always spinning plates aren't you oh spinning plates with while well, he's juggling balls. absolutely absolutely 26 <laughs> seconds call to action do you love it I can yep. see Sharon's got six in her basket. Cumbria's got two. Not enough people, says Neary. No, 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 no. You're not influencing them enough. Oh. <laughs> you need to... Ah, uh, OK. He says you need to be wined and dined with people on the web and on the phone lines. Oh. Fair enough. Even if you don't press your option one, even if you don't check out your basket just yet, that's how, wow. that's how you influence your producers, by the way. Um, oh, just, yeah, okay, fair enough. You're just talking about one chicken uh, restaurant. That's all you need. Just take him there. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> the more of you that are there, the lower he will go. We're already at 34.99 now. You're less than 10% of the one on, on Tiffany & Co. And it's less nicer. 10% of it, yeah. yeah. And it's nicer. It's a, it's a, a more Heavier. luscious chain. Yeah. yeah, you've got more chain in it. So is this 925 and maybe ours, I don't know, uh, 924? What? No. <laughs> it's exactly the Silver, same. Silver, no. Exactly the same. We know that, don't we? The craftsmanship again. I, and I, I kid you not, I have been, I've been fortunate enough to go to Jaipur with Jewelry Maker. I have been in some of the manufacturers that produce amazing pieces like this for you all. And on one side of the room, they were producing Jewelry Maker um, items, yeah. Gemporia items. On the other side of the room, they were producing a certain designer that yeah. I always talk about. Literally, there was just a corridor. It's the same pre premises. Yeah. The only difference is the branding and the boxing and the, and the marketing effectively and the celebrity endorsements. That's the difference. And probably the quantities that are bought. Yeah, probably. With ours being far higher. Yeah, absolutely. Than that. Now, not uh -oh. enough? Okay, look, I tell you what, I'm going to say, say it as it is. <gasps> Neary wants to take these to 29.99, but he said. I have to justify that price point by numbers. So he's saying, look, his exact words were, you haven't taken me to Nando's yet. <laughs> <laughs> he needs enough of you to put it in your basket and pick up the phone lines, <laughs> even if you don't press your option one, to justify that price drop. OK, how many, how many more dates to Nando's do you need? I mean, they're all putting down the multi-buying and they're all going off the screen. That's more like it, he says. So would you, oh, I need to oh, ask this question, oh. Neary. Do you go for the wing roulette? No? Ah, oh, I love a bit of wing roulette, I do. I can't may... Eat, oh. Can't eat anything in there. Oh, can't you? Everything has garlic in. Is there enough people taking you to Nando's right now? Do you know the reality is, though, Nando's... Yeah. Far more expensive than what yes. you've just done these at eight and a half. Far more expensive. Um, let's, we will do it if there's enough of you there. There is. He's just confirmed. It's all good. Just needed a little bit of whining and dining. $29.99. Ah, oh, Lauren's just handed this in and it would be perfect. Absolutely perfect. 
Can I say, I, I like this one better. I like the, 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 the ergonomic shape. I like the way it sort of flicks out, out as against the way it... it they're both bell shapes. Yeah. But they're a different bell shape. Yeah, I agree. I, 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 lo I can't decide. I, lo I love them both, I do to be love honest. Them both. But yeah, this is more of a beaded tassel, isn't it? Um, whereas the other one is obviously floral. Yeah. How beautiful is that? If you want the chain, we're going to be bringing this to air as well. That's a paperclip chain. Big gram weight to support the big gram weight of your tassel as well. Wow. 29.99. We had a bigger quantity. Sharon, well done. Lovely getting your three. Stella, Mary, Irene, West Midlands, wow. Angela getting two. Devon's getting five. Valerie, David's getting two. Five, well done. Hello, Lorraine. Hi all. I've been into Tiffany's in Ooh. New York, and all I did was uh, was talk <laughs> about jewelry maker. Uh, amazing. In the end, my husband walked out because he was embarrassed. <laughs> Probably before you were thrown out, Lorraine. I love it. You went into yeah. Tiffany's and, and you told oh, them really. Yeah. Tiffany's, they heard of them? Tiffany's are probably like that. Who's jewelry maker? Yeah. <laughs> Who are they? What in New York you did it? Yeah. <laughs> did you? Uh, they were being polite. Being polite. What did you say? Sorry, you're you're massively <laughs> overpriced. <laughs> did you say that? Did you? I, I, you were thinking, <laughs> you're too polite to do that, Dan. Amazing. Sorry, Tiffany's. You're extortionate. <laughs> For the same nine two five sterling silver name. that we bring. It's a name, isn't it? Yeah. You know that. As soon as you stick a name, a branded name on something. You pay over the odds. You're paying for the celebrity endorsement. Absolutely. The, the, the... And you know what? There's nothing wrong with that. If, that's, yeah, if you yeah. are labels driven, absolutely. Nothing wrong with that at all. Um, but... I guess it's no different like your trainers. Uh -huh, and, yeah. and, and, and your clothing and things like that. Um, it's no different. And whatever floats your boat, who are we to question that? But if you're looking for the level of luxury, but without the high price tag, then certainly today, I think we've nailed it, haven't we? 29.99, well done, everybody. Congratulations. Um, we are definitely going to need a chain. And do you know what? Go on, you can... can I just ask, Tom, how many, how many uh, 29 99s are in 4.30? How many could you buy for one Tiffany's? <laughs> so you could have 14.8 tassels. Do you want to... Uh... Can I borrow your pliers just one second? Yeah. Hang on, because I'm going to make that piece of jewellery. So you could get 14, 14 of ours. Yeah. Or, or you can get one from Tiffany's. Tiffany's. Well, I know, I, I, I know which I would be doing. Yeah, yeah. I know which I would be doing straight away. So here we go. I'm just, you might need to squeeze. That's what I'm just doing. Well, the alternative is you put a, a jump, jump ring. ring on. Well, there's a, there's a big link in this. So you could yeah. easily squeeze it through and then open it up. That's my theory. Here we go. Right. There we are. We're making luxury jewelry. And if I give that, an, open it back up again. Well, that, that, that's why so many people actually start shopping with us here at Jewelry Makers yeah. because all of a sudden we the pieces of jewelry that we can't afford, and I'm not too proud to admit that. All of a sudden, thank you. Um, all of a sudden are achievable, aren't they? Yeah. You know, that Alhambra malachite that we did the other day. So uh, producer Tom um, got that for his lovely wife. She hasn't taken it off yet. I bet she's. Well, she's in her element, isn't she? Did you make it for her, Tom? <laughs> you asked, guess designer Debbie sorted it for you. Amazing. Right, let's put this together. Look at that. How stunning is that? Look at how beautiful that yeah. is. And it's the perfect balance of the chain. That's your £430 necklace there, move right over, there. Move over, Tiffany's and Co. Yeah. Move over, Elsa Peretti. I would absolutely prefer this. Yeah. And I'm, look, it's, it's, not, it's not even... Look, if I put that on a curb chain, that would be lovely. Yeah. And we can bring you a curb chain. We bring you lovely curb chains and belt, uh, you know, all of those. This is a paperclip chain, which, in my opinion, is a perfect balance. It, it, it's got that heavier oh. link, hasn't it? Yeah, I love it. I absolutely love it. 1.7 grams. Very linear. Yeah. Beautiful luster. Um, 18 inch. But I just wanted to show you 
yeah, you probably will need to squeeze the initial uh, um, link in ever so yeah. slightly just to get it in and then open it back up again so the tassel's not going to come off unless you want it interchangeable, of course. But look how beautiful that is. It's stunning. We don't need gemstones on every occasion. No. You know, we can make high-end jewellery. Oh, totally. Exclusively with your precious metal. Totally. What a chain. It is gorgeous. Shall I hold that up to the neckline? Yeah. Oh, Jackie O would love this. Now, first price tag. So we went $29.99 or $34.99. How about first price point for the chain? Let's go 20, let's match that price, $29.99. But I'm gonna tell you, we are not stopping there. Look how beautiful that is. That's stunning. That chain, the flat, the flat surface you're getting from those links. Look at the shine on it. Yeah. That's incredible. I love the paper chase. I think they're nicer than the round paper chase chains. I love that, them too. Yeah. Yeah, I love them too. And paperclip chains are the hottest trend, aren't oh, they? Oh, gosh, yeah. It's one of the hottest designs at the moment. You know, again, all those big designers working with them. So right now, this piece that I've put together is what? Even if we were to stay here, which we're not, £64.99. Yeah. 98 pence. Which is still a lot less than your four, 430 Absolutely. Um, or the last pet at tassel, sixty pounds. Yeah. To make uh, to make that. So I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to chop that price in half for the chain, which means that this is now under fifty pounds. Yeah. Four Isn't that crazy. Is that right? Yeah. Under fifty. Yeah. Forty-five pounds, and we're still not done. How many have we got then, Neri? No. A hundred chances. Yeah, I agree. If we're going to do good quantity yes. on the pendants, we need to have a good quantity on the chain as well. Um, but our chain deals are second to none. I genuinely... Look, we could all go into places like all the other establishments, but I, I, I've shown you before on um, Monica Veneda, oh. for example, a, a paperclip chain, um, that's £100. And it's almost exactly the same. What did you just say? Why did you gasp? Because he just said the price in my ear. You're doing what? Do I think that's insane. Do you know what you're going to do before I do? And that's fine if they do. No? No, they're all happy with it at that price. Oh, you're going to be over the moon. Ecstatic. Because fourteen ninety nine is no way near where we are closing. That's crazy. That's crazy. So we're not even going to shave, like, I don't know, 10%, 20% off. Locked and loaded. Oh my gosh. I don't, I, that's got to be the best price we've done on <coughs> Yeah, yeah. Look, 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 the name's all going. <laughs> I can make this for under £40. Which is less than 10%. £43 would be 10% of the Tiffany & Co one. You can go to Tiffany's if you want. We you get 10. Uh, I, th I think this one's nicer, yes. personally. Yeah. <laughs> it's more silver Three. as well. That's £430 for their tassel mesh. And I'm not comparing. They are different, but again, or you can come with us, create the piece. I literally made it on air, yeah. effectively, literally. Um, and you can buy the chain for £7.99. You can get hold of the tassel pendant for either £29.99. Um, or um, or 34, depending on which tassel you choose. My goodness me, this is why we love Jewelry Maker. Do you know what? It makes me want to. It makes me want to wear this. Walk through the doors of Tiffany's and Co. Yes, wear that. Have that conversation. Oh, I love your necklace. Thanks. And first, you say I made it. Yeah. I made it. Um, and it definitely didn't cost me 430 quid. Yeah. My goodness me. You could almost get a flight to America for that. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, well done, Angela. This is 18 inch, but if you do prefer a 20 inch, we have got a 20 inch on the back of this in Curb and also in the Prince of Wales. Ooh, so I'll tell you what, in. hang on, hold that thought. Which one are you doing first? Prince of Wales first, okay. Actually, I tell you what, I'm going to pass those to Alison. Oh, do you want me to put that on there? Can you? Yeah. Um, amazing. I've got, I had 100. I've got six chances left on this one. 
Amazing, absolutely beautiful, flying out the door. That has to be one of the best prices we've done on a paperclip chain. Totally. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Well done, everybody. And we're not done yet because we've got two 20 inch chains. It's all down to put, look, 16 inch for me is too small. I don't like 16 inches. I just, I, I find it, if you're particularly petite, then I think a 16 inch is great. Um, like my best friend, she's five foot one, tiny, and she would probably go for the 16 inch. I prefer an 18 or a 20 inch. So it's all down to what you prefer. And also what whereabouts on the decolletage you want to wear it. So on me, an 18 inch would sit about here. 20 inch would just be that little bit lower. It kind of drops inch by inch. Yeah. Um, so personal choice. See, my niece has she's she's tall, but she's she's very slender and has a very um, slender neck. So a sixteen inch on her, yeah, looks looks amazing. Would be perfect, absolutely. Uh, I'm going to just borrow this for a second. Here you go. How easy was that, Alison? Oh yeah, no problem. Look at that. Take it around the corner. Sorry, no, that's the curb. I beg your pardon, my bad. But if you want it on the Prince of Wales, here it is. See, this is where you can layer. I, I'd layer those. I, do you know, I love them with all of them. I love yeah. it with the paper clip, I love it with the curb, I love it with the Prince of Wales. Prince of Wales, by the way, is like a DNA helix. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Um, very intricate, very strong. Very, very strong. It does look like a shop window, doesn't it? The last chain's just sold out. I don't think this is going to be any different at all. Um, yeah, it's like a DNA helix. Um, you usually have to pay a premium for a Prince of Wales because it is that much. It's like knitted sterling silver, yeah. if that makes sense. Um, absolutely beautiful. Um, we are doing deals on precious metal today. My goodness me. Have I got quantity? Well... Neary says, I do my best. I've got 47, which is why I've added another 20-inch deal. We've just seen 100 in your paperclip chain fly out the door, all down to personal choice. You might prefer a ball chain. You might prefer a belt chain. You might prefer um, uh, Figaro. You might prefer a curb. Oh, now, the Prince of Wales yeah. already has your elongated... Um, no squeezy, squeezy. No squeezy, squeezy. That it's going to feed go through too. perfectly. Oh, there you go. Just done that on there. Look. Ah, there you go. So this fits directly on. And that is my master. And you could argue. <laughs> it's not. It's not. It, no, it's not. Um, before, really anyone, before anyone tells us off. No. Yeah. Oh, my goodness me. We've got 47, did you say? 30 second clock. And we're going to do something naughty. Uh, naughty. Um, technically, there's two inches extra. You know, it is a little bit longer than the other chain. It could, you could argue it's that much more intricate being a Prince of Wales. I love Prince of Wales. Yeah, they're lovely, aren't they? Having said all that, in one ear, out the other ear, we're going to match the price of the previous. Um, amazing. There we go. Said it out loud. Plus, we rarely ever get 20 inches. So if it is your, pre uh, your preference... Be quick, because the 20 inch chains are, are, are definitely, uh, definitely one of the more popular lengths. Uh, 19.99 would be awesome, would be absolutely awesome. 19. It's not where we're stopping now. Wow. Did you? Yeah, you weren't paying attention, were you? No, I wasn't. I was, no. I was faffing with the two. Oh, as a tazza, make sure you sat down, lovely. Ready? Yeah. Okay, 20 inches. 20 inches of uh, Prince, Prince of Wales. Wales. No, no, it's longer yeah. and it's a more complicated chain. It's a, it's, it's a double helix, isn't it? Mm. No. <laughs> That's crazy. I like the way it says, oh, these are flying. You think? Yeah, <laughs> you, absolutely. You've Remember, producer Neary's extra... not going to be here. He's standing That's in. That's true. So it's not his name on the system right now. <laughs> Sunday fun day. Absolutely. Oh, absolutely. Lovely. Seven ninety nine. May I just ask this question? Where else in the world? Yeah. Let's take that Where one. else in the world will you get? Uh, how, I, I don't know the answer to this, but I wonder if you can go into Tiffany's and Co and get a Prince of Wales chain. Uh, no. There. Twenty inch. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that question, mm. but I wonder if you could. 
I love the double helix. Amazing, amazing, amazing. You know, we're back, we're back to we're back to sort of. Um, oh, hi, Barbara. Sorry, um, we're back. To I thought you were talking to the model on the on the on the oh. uh, Tiffany's and Carol. Oh, look, it's Barbara. It's Barbara from Adventure. Yeah. Oh, hello, Barbara. Hi, Barbara. Um, <laughs> she's going to say, just stop saying it, will you? <laughs> You, know, you can't even get a chain on it on uh, Tiffany's Garden. No, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. But we were talking about, you know, putting them in your crackers or... or um... <laughs> yeah, you know why that is, Tom? Because seven, people are buying threes, fours, fives, twos. Why wouldn't you stock up your yeah. stashes when you get the chance? We really ever seven see... 7.99 is crazy. Curb chain? Yeah. That's what I fed this one on to. And again... No jiggery pokery, just fed it directly on there. I do love a curb chain. It's like a, it's like silk a curb chain. It is. <laughs> yeah, then they do feel like silk. You've got this wonderful ribbon of luster that just follows and undulates with the, uh, the sort of the curves of the decolletage. Um, amazing. I tell you what, let's just because we're going to start somewhere. You know that we do the most unbelievable deals. Um, these are beyond wholesale prices. We're at nine ninety nine. You got to laugh, haven't you? Wow. These these are plate prices. They are, aren't they? Yeah. I need some of these. I definitely need some of these. Do you know what? I looked at, at getting. We went. We went when we went to Carlisle. Mm. And we found a, a, an artisan pie place, which was amazing, absolutely amazing. And we looked at getting an order. Did you say artisan pie? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, nice. Oh, that sounds oh cool. the pies are amazing. Honestly, their pies are amazing. Yeah, yeah. But to do a, to do a, um, I looked at doing a mail order and the postage was £12. For a pie? No, no, that was for 30 pies. Uh, for tw 12 pies. Oh. But the postage was £12. What? Just I mean, the good pies, though. They're, they're the good pies and they get them delivered to you. But, but I, I thought, well, I, can't justify twelve pounds. No, on a pie. On top of the price of the pies. Yeah, nine ninety nine, and we're and going even lower. I need these. I need. I desperately. Do you, does anyone mind if I just add a few? Have we got quantity of these? I've done Have we? We've got quantity. Cool. I need to get hold of some of these as well because I'm desperate on your twenty inch curb chains, and I like it because they don't compete. Yeah. If you want, if you want, if you want. Um, a, a, a chain to be part of the design then obviously go for things like your Prince of Wales and your paperclip but if you want them to actually have that kind of melt into the background yeah function basically be the supporting actor yeah, yeah. you know what I mean um, where um, but still beautiful does yeah. that make sense yeah I do need to get a few of these as well six pounds and 99 pence wow. we're not in clearance anymore no we're not I sound like Dorothy don't I yeah six in five Gosh, blimey. Amazing, amazing, oh, amazing. First person gets six. Yeah, don't blame you. Surrey's multi bought. Keith, Eileen, Angela, Devon, Julie, David. I mean, the call screens have gone crazy. Absolutely crazy. Uh, make sure you are checking out your baskets on these. Yeah, I'm desperate for 20 inch chains. That's why I'm getting a couple of those. Um, amazing. Sorry, just shopping along with you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just checking out. One sec. Um, we're in a tin shed, so it's not so great. Going, oh, Come yeah. on, hurry up, hurry up, yeah. hurry up, just waving your phone around. But we do, we do, we do. I need them, that, you know, like I say, Christmas gifts. They're an essential. Perfect. They definitely are. They go in my, I, I, they go in my drawer, my present drawer. Yeah. And then, you know, if, if you need one in a hurry, you've got one there. Especially 20 inch. I know, I yeah. know. Love that. Crazy. It's my favourite length of, uh, um, of chain. Yeah, mine. Um, amazing. Well done. Six ninety nine. So many of you have multi-bought. We, we have got a lag on the core screens. Do you know how I know that? Because my name's not up there just yeah. yet. I have checked out. Um, so we had 140 of them. Um, but we are now down to that final 40. Amazing. Wow. Absolutely amazing. Twos, threes, fours, fives. Um, we're going to move along because we've got a couple more opportunities still Ooh. to bring you. Okay. Do I take them off? Yes, please. Um, so what? A 20-inch trace and then a 22. Ooh. Ooh. That one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, see, look, uh, now... See, our, we, what we call trace to me is a belcher. It's 
more of like the oval yeah. lace. Yeah. Do you know where I'm coming from? I don't, but we've always called it that, so I'm not saying they're wrong, but to me, our trace chain's a belcher because it's more of an oval link. Either, either, it's just a name, isn't Nothing it, effectively? Well. A trace chain to me is one of the very lightweight sterling silver chains, which is not the case here. You've got two grams of sterling silver. Um, again, 20 inches, so it's going to sit, depending on your build, approximately mid-decolletage. Um, beautiful. It's, for me, trace or, or belch, or whichever we want to call it. This chain and the curb chain, they are that... They're the perfect accompaniment, that supporting actor, aren't they? Um, we've got quantity. We are doing like a mini chain clearance. And whether you're a sea beader, whether you're a silversmith, whether you're a wire worker, um, whether you do your macrames, which is yeah. boring, you'll always need your chains. Yeah. Whether you're going to be riveting this afternoon, you're going to oh, want I'm your riveting. chains. I'm definitely riveting. I'm excited about that. Okay. 30 second clock on your screens. Oop. Um, they should be separate. Yeah. Oh, no, come in. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, 23 seconds, we're going to take it to a clearance price point. So, essential. And it's about finding the right chain, especially if you have got a business and you want to give that variety. And some people would prefer the oval link, some people would prefer the curb, some people would prefer the snake, some people would prefer the belcher. You get where I'm going from. Um, so, good luck, everyone. We've got quantity, clearance deals. Usually, if you're buying them at, at sort of wholesale prices, you normally have to pay it by a minimum quantity, which can be quite expensive. You know, it's like, oh, yeah, to get that price, you have to get, I don't know, 20. To get that price, you need to get 30 or 40. Nine pounds and 99 pence only. I don't know anywhere else that does the sterling silver chain deals that we do here. There's two grams, so it's one of the heavier chains. Um, thank you, Alison, that we have brought right, you today. Oh, I got in a little slight panic there for a second. Um, amazing. Well done stocking up your stashes and all your essential chains there are a lot of names cropping up on each each time that are, that are definitely got to be stocking up probably. i wonder if they're selling well probably like so many of us i don't sell but i gift and yeah, I, yeah. I use yeah. a lot of chains yeah use a lot of, i've got a lot of peg bales recently oh yeah yeah some well pendants. we've had some really good deals on peg bales yeah well. peg bales and pearls sorted you need the chain to go alongside yeah. it don't you amazing five scott four and susan's multi bought brenda maker somerset susan lawn and angela barbara i can't keep up with you there's loads of you there nine pounds and 99 pence for a two gram that's the thing uh, a two gram solid 925 sterling silver chain um looking at the tiffany's and co one that looks to be the same as what's yeah. on your screens right now the kind of over light link do you see where I'm coming from um, so I think that's the same uh, in fact does it say on there no, no it just says a change okay um, unbelievable but yeah incredible and if we're 9.99 you can spend 430 pounds yeah you can get the idea moving on well done amazing um, the last oh, is what sorry the waffage oh yeah wall of fame wall of fame wall of fame and masterclass coming up a 22 inch, is that this one? Oh, it's the one on the... On the tea bar. bar. Is it? <gasps> is it Prince of Wales? Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, Look that's the it. Length. <gasps> now, so, again, the, the longer the chain, the more expensive. That makes sense, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Because there's more silver. There's three grams wow. of sterling silver. In terms of chain, that has to be one of the heaviest that we've done. That's a gorgeous chain. <laughs> Producer nearly fell off his chair. <laughs> he says, right, I've got, I've got less than 50 of these. We're going to go ah. straight down to it. So we shouldn't be, for a three gram, 22 inch, Prince of Wales, layer this with the one that we had earlier. How oh would gosh, that, that would look amazing. Oh, I still have it. Yes, I do. Layer this with your um, other Prince of Wales chain. How beautiful would that be? Uh, on. Here we go. There you go. Just shook it free then. How amazing is that? That's stunning. Nine pounds and 99 pence. And you can really see 
How difference in, yeah. in, in the... Uh, gram weight. Gram weight, yeah. Absolutely. Three grams, 22 wow. inches. Well done, everybody. But we only have 50 of these. This uh, oh. No, we don't. We've got 10. Um, don't go anywhere. We've got your wall of fame coming up after the break. And we've got an amazing masterclass all about riveting. Now, yes. if you're thinking, I know what riveting is. Well, don't worry, Alison's your girl. We'll be back after this. <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewellery Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day we offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Ah, welcome.
Welcome back, everybody. Lovely to be with you. My name's Alan. I'm joined by the fantastic Azza Tazza. Oh, it's going to be a riveting hour. Yeah. Tune in. <laughs> yeah. I can't wait. But first, your fantastic creations in the Wall of Fame. Ooh. Trevor's been busy. Hello, Hasn't Trevor. Been? Amazing. And Trevor says, my entry this week is a selection of sea bead and chain mail jewellery. All components are from Jewellery Maker. Best of luck to all in the draw and best wishes all. And to you. Nice bit of chain mail I and a like lovely bit of sea beading. Exactly. Look at the diversity. And I can yeah. see a bit of paracord in the background. Yeah. Oh, I tell you what. Mama. Doing well, Trevor. Um, many talents. Uh, 499 is from Deb Davis. Hello to you, Deb. Oh, pretty. Very pretty. Deb says, uh, here with this week's offering for uh, the Wall of Fame, a rose quartz bracelet inspired by Mark Smith. All components are from Jewelry Maker. Good luck, all waffers. Hey. Love it. And good luck to you. Yeah. Um, number 500 is from Lorna. Oh, wow. Oh, lovely. Oh, it's oh, like a peacock. It tail. is like a peacock, isn't it? That's amazing. I love that. Lorna says, hello, everybody at Jewelry Maker. Here's my version of Monica's uh, design made from the abalone and sea beads all from Jewelry Maker. That's that beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. Love the colour choices there, Lorna. Uh, number 501 is from Linda. Good morning to Linda. Oh. Sorry, good afternoon now. Wow, very high end. Loving that. Um, hi, all at Jewelry Maker. This is my entry to the Wall of Fame. A Marla necklace fully knotted and made with jadeite satellite beads, oh. small rice bead spaces and medium rice beads for the tassel. Um, wow. Hope you like it and good luck to all. Best wishes, Linda. That's absolutely That's amazing. beautiful. Here we go. I'll pass oh. these over to you now. Thank you. Uh, 502 we have Barbara Hewitt and she says hi all these are pairs gold spacer abalone um brought all brought from JM best to all best to, best to all that's gorgeous isn't very it? nice Barbara so like the abalone, yeah I love the fact that yeah. we've seen abalone in our designs again yeah amazing uh, 503 Marion Andrews and she says hello all oh look at that very pretty um I've been trying a bit of wire work with some cabochons well done um I've had for some time they didn't turn out too badly best of wishes to all the waffers this week take care I think they're cracking very they're good cracking. you don't always need heavy wire work no, around no, them sometimes just simple very nice don't forget to get your chains 504, Sharon Saunders. Oh, I like this as Very well. Very nice, Sharon. Uh, hi, JM. This week's entry is a simple necklace, all made from black jadeite, carnelian, wow. a rose gold vermeil beads and findings, all from JM. I love the colour combination. Hoping for a win because I, I'm giving my credit card a bit of a bashing in the sales. Mm. Good luck to all. Well, fingers crossed. You're all in with a chance. 505, David Stratful. Nice oh, name. look at that. Um, hi, hi, all at JM. I've put my latest creation, co cre co creation forward to the Wall of Fame. It comprised of type A red jadeite with sterling <gasps> silver spaces and a ball magnetic clasp. All components from JM. This adds to my extensive jade library. It's beautiful. I like, I like the way you've... Um, Displayed it as well. Amazing. Beautiful. And last but not least, we have 506. That's Julie George. Oh, look. Oh, that's very pretty. Um, hi, all at JM and viewers. Hope everyone is, is well and the sun is shining on you. This is my waffering for the week. Uh, it's a necklace created with a beautiful freshwater pearls and songa, songia pink sapphires wow. with sterling silver findings, all from JM. A wee win in the draw would be a wonderful boost. So, I, uh, so I wish, so I wish luck to all the fabulous entrants, including me. Yes. Love to all. Yeah, you got to be in it to win it. Absolutely. And listen, Julie, it's me drawing on on Wednesday, so we'll. I'll, I'll be rude. I'll try and be lucky. Yeah, fingers crossed. So you've still got a few days to get your photographs in. Just drop us a little message, a photograph of your pieces. The only stipulation is that they are jewelry maker products. Um, yeah, amazing, amazing. Now, as a Tazza, oh. what is a riveting. riveting what is riveting right so riveting it's all about cold connections what do we mean by cold connections there's no soldering there's no torch involved there's you see that little bit in the middle yeah. that's a rivet ah. so it's how do you connect different things now 
cold connecting, I think, really comes into its own um, when you're using different thicknesses of metals and, and different types of metals because they'll melt at different times. So if, you, if you've got to melt them, if you uh, solder them, it's very hard wow. to solder a very thin sheet onto a very thick sheet because of that difference in temp temperature and, yeah. and time. Cold connections, they're great fun. You don't, that, you know, you don't have to have your water bath. You, you, you don't have to have your, your pickle. You don't have to have your pot, you know. You've got loads of things you don't have to have. You don't have to have your torch and your and solder. And some people would be nervous of those yes. things, aren't they? I totally get it. I probably would be as well. You know, if you, you want to start metalworking. It's perfect. It's, they are, what are they call The flame blower thingies. Torches. Torches. Sorry, I just went back. Well, they, she said. Um, the torches, they, they yeah. can be a little bit scary, can't they? they can. So I do get it. I do get it. So a riveting is a way around that. Yep, absolutely. Um, These see, are if you amazing. Had to, if you had to solder that, I love playing with different textures. Yeah. So you've got a hammered one, a brushed one, and yeah. then a smooth one. Now, if you had to solder that, it would be a nightmare. Mm. And, then, and it also and means... And probably use a lot. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. If you flame colour anything then you don't want to solder it. You've got to flame it afterwards because as mm. soon as you then have to put it in the bath, you get rid of all your flame polishing. Okay. You know, something as simple as that. They're cool. Just two different textures look so good. Yeah. They, they, you could, or you can make big statement pieces. Um, did I fetch? I did have... Riveting is one of those techniques as well that um, I think is very popular with gents as well, isn't oh, it? Oh, absolutely. So you can do cuffs. You can do, you know, simple pieces. You can build up complicated pieces. Again, so simple. Uh, uh, I've left it adjustable so that anyone can wear it. Yeah, I love that. Um, so there's absolutely no soldering involved. Amazing. You know, it just gives you that opportunity. The little cup one, uh, I think it's the little one up there, isn't it? To, you know, you can just you can go into that as well. It doesn't have to and be. And do have movement then? You can make. You can leave movement. them. You can leave them with movement. Okay. So cool. most of these aren't, but it depends how flat or how tight you want it to be. So you can just do simple things. That feathers, amazing, absolutely Thank amazing. You. Now, so you need tools, specific so tools for it, and. Um, we don't often have them on the show. Um, they are available. They're back in stock for you today. And actually, as tools go as well, this is fairly uh, um, unintimidating. Yeah. Is that, was that, is, that, is that the right word? Right. So let me, yeah. let me just say, you can rivet without a riveting okay. block. Right. It's a real hassle. Okay. This takes away the hassle of riveting. Right. So I've known people, they, they, they struggle to do it. I've got, I've got some creations that, that are so different. You, you, saw, you saw there the, um, the, the rivets on before give you a nice little dome. Mm. Or you can go, these, these, these are old rivets. Okay. Right? So they're a bit flat, they're a bit awful, and they're, they're, they're not easy to do. OK, and that's flame. That's that's where you want to have cold connection because you've done you've done your pattern and okay. you just want to, to do it. So so this block is invaluable for now, getting that nice dome. And... I tell you what, let's bring the, 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 the tool to it. Now, yes. you've got to before we go any further, because okay. we are having messages into the studio about a multi class that we were meant to bring to air today. Uh, multi-strand class. Oh, I thought there was. Yeah, it hasn't turned up. I'm, ah. I'm sorry. Um, and unfortunately, we're in the weekend. We will try and include it in next week. So on the weekend, we can't actually do anything about it once we're here in the studio. Yeah. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, it hasn't arrived. So I'm so sorry about that. But we will try and include it in next week's show, whether that's with Carol, myself, whoever it might be. Um, so just to answer your questions about that, apologies. Um, OK, now, you made a recommendation earlier on, didn't yeah. you? Can I borrow yours? Yeah. Right. So I'm going to put these together. Can you spot the difference? I know one's upside. I don't know whether you'll be able to see it so much. Can you? No, but can you look at the look at, look in here. What are we looking for? This one is the one I've been using with copper. Ah, you can see the. Can copper you colour. see the copper? Yes. So if you then go and dome your silver one with ah. this, you're going to cross contaminate. Cr cr cross contaminate it. I given given the price that Tom said, if you can, 
I would buy two. Especially if you work with silver and copper. If you, if you just time. work with copper, then don't worry about it. But if you work with your silver and your copper, yeah. then that would contaminate your silver. Okay. So you'd have to try and clean it out. That's not going to be very easy. And it's certainly not going to be easy in the little donuts. Well, we've done a few price comparisons, as we, we always have. do. And listen, I'm not saying we achieve it every single time, but we will always endeavour, I think that's the word to use, to be the most... OK to be a, 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 the most affordable price tag. We will endeavour. It's not always achievable. It does depend on how we buy, how, we, you know, uh, uh, shipping costs, etc., delivery, etc. But we will always endeavour. Um, and we looked at Cooks and Gold, who's probably our immediate competitors. Um, fantastic company. And they've got the same, exact same block. <laughs> exactly the same. There's steel riveting block. Here we go. Ideal for creating your own rivets and for riveting eyelets. Made from quality steel. This tool allows you to make your own rivets from 2 millimeters, 1.6, 1.3 upwards. Um, so there you go. Um, £24.49. That's amazing. Yeah, which is a great price. Because really, you're not going to need to replace it, are you? No, no, no. The, the, the only time you're going to need another one is if you're doing different metals. OK, so we've Just matched that price. Off. Have we got quantity then, Neary? <gasps> 150. Ooh. We don't often see the riveting block. No, we don't. I've only ever seen it. We've had it once before, as far as I know. Okay. And that was how long ago, was, did you say? About... Oh, I thought, it was, yeah, I thought it was three, three-ish, four years yeah. ago when I... I mean, it, I don't remember ever bringing it, so yeah. I know it, came, it came to air once, oh, sold really? out. Yeah, came, came to air once, sold out, and, and we've not seen it again. No, absolutely. Now. And if you want to do rivets, you, re, you, yeah, know, it's, you need a, it's, a it's ideal. Um, well, this is flying out the door. So much so our call screen's got a little bit do lally. Uh, yeah, nineteen ninety nine. Wow. For a tool that really... You're not going to need to replace. No. But worthwhile also, we're very mindful of the fact a lot of our silver, uh, sorry, of our metal workers work with both copper and your yes. silver. So we're kind of thinking, okay, you might want to get one for your silver, one for your copper, um, label it as such. So you yes. do avoid any of that cross contamination. Yeah, absolutely. Because, and, I mean, I was, I was, I hadn't even thought about it when I've used it before. And then, and then I was doing, I was doing a load of work and I was Top like, tip. oh gosh, yeah, there's a lot of copper left in the bottom of there. Oh, yeah. okay. It so just doesn't come over one, So I do need another cook. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. People are multi buying, taking up that. And that's not, I'm so glad that you said that because I wouldn't actually think to do it. No, I hadn't thought about it before. Yeah. And, and, and I was like, oh, ow. Yeah. <laughs> um, because this, and this is, this is what's so interesting. So we've talked, we've talked about rivets. So all my stuff has been riveted, but you can do eyelets with it. Yeah. So these, these rounds here, how you do your eyelet so so what happens is you put it in there and it, it spreads out your your um tube mm -hmm. in the same way so you can see some are narrower and then it goes to a wider one at the top and the the circle in the middle is the same size so it gives it room for that metal to spread because yep. that's what a rivet is have you got a, has anyone got a pen and paper yeah here you go have you got a have you got a pen handy um oh hang on hang on yeah here's one here you go cool Okay, so a rivet. I tell you what, before you yeah. do, this is Jewelry Maker. We don't just want to beat prices. If we can, we will always give you the best deal as physically possible. We're going to go even lower. We've got what? 150. I tell you what, before you do your demonstration, yeah, 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 yeah. let's go. Let's take it to the price that we always intended. It was never going to be 19.99 again. We were wow. very mindful of the fact, and it's a really good point that Alison's drawn to our attention. Look, you probably need to get... Look, if you do both, work with both methods. Yeah. You want both. Your advice would be to get two. Yeah. Um, we have also got other essentials. So we've got some of the metal sheet. We have got the hole punch that I can yeah. see to bring you as well. Right now, it's all about the riveting block. Today, can't, none of us can remember when we brought this to you. It was a long time ago. Yeah. It was a long time and ago. And I've only ever seen it once. Oh, <gasps> 99 That's fabulous. The course has gone crazy. Loads, yeah. Low, yeah, but yeah, but trying to squeeze the price down to a point so that everybody can yeah. get to. Um, amazing, amazing. So, and if you want to start your riveting journey, then we have the components. Stay with us. Make sure you check out on this though, because 150 won't last long. So, so what's this? You've got two. You've got two um, sheets there. That's mm. your two sheets of metal with your hole in. It's a bit bigger hole. It's not to scale. Okay. Right. So you rivet. You get your. That's your. Like I say, it's not to scale. So this is your your 
either tube or or um, round metal, yeah. piece of metal, okay? Mm. And what happens as you hammer it is this flattens out. So what happens is oh. you end up with it like that. So obviously it can't go back through that hole because when you hammer it, it spreads. I was going to okay? say you spread it. So you spread it. Now with, with the tube ones, it kind of does that. So you, you're left with your tube and, and the eyelets spread outside and that's your hole. But what you can also do is you can, what's called countersinking. Right. Ooh. So, so you, can, you can basically push this down so that when you spread your tube, it spreads into there and you can do it so that it's flush, so you don't see it. Have you got your bangle on? Yes. Let me just borrow your bangle. See how those are flush? I know their screw's not rivets, but that's how you end up with, so they're flush. Yeah, so you haven't got a, a, a dome. Okay. So it gives you different options with what to do. Yeah. So um, those are the different things you can do with it. So I'm going to show you now how you can. Now... Uh, before you. you do, yeah. hello Pam. Sorry, I wasn't ignoring your message oh, sorry. there. No, Pam was saying she remembers. She's going to do. Okay. Oh. Hey Pam, um, saying hi on at Jewelry Maker. I bought one of these in February 2020. Good memory. Um, and the cost was 35 pounds and 95 pence. Keep up the good work, Pam King. Well, wow. There you go. We've done pretty wow. well there, then, that, Pam, haven't we? That's really good sourcing then. Amazing. Oh, I wonder Kent's bought four then. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Um, Fabulous. Fabulous. Now, we do have other components. So are we doing that pre-demo or nope. do demo okay. and then bring all the other items okay. as and when? Okay. So, so let me talk your way around it. You've got your different tube sizes. Mm -hmm. Okay. But not only do they do it so that you can hold it here and you can do it so this would be done flat. They've thought about it. They've put them on the sides <laughs> so that if you want to put it in a vice... You can have it in a vice to use. Oh, and there's okay. bigger ones so, on that Yeah, side. yeah. So they've, they've thought about what they have to do to give you the option you know, to you do the different... Oh, there you go. Yeah. There you go. To do the different sizes. Genius. Yeah, absolutely. And, and I think there's, there's... Oh, no. I thought there was one on... Yeah, yeah. You've also got your, your, your hole. Now, the hole, what does the hole do? When you want the rivet, obviously... I'm going to, sorry, come back to there. You don't want a piece of metal that comes up to here no. that you've then got to try and flatten. Yeah. Okay? So you've got to try and get it. You want, you want a couple of millimetres maximum space, which is quite hard if you've just got two pieces um, of point eight. Let's say, let's take the point eight sheet we've got there. So if you've got two pieces of point eight sheet, I've already got a, a hole punched through it, and you want that... You know, so that's 1.6. That's quite hard to then judge a, a mill either side of. So what they do, okay, so I've got some 1.5 wire, is basically you put this through your hole. You want it as tight as you can, and then you pop it in, 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 the, in the hole there. Come here. Come here. And then you're going to cut it, right? Okay. Yeah. So that gives you the size of rivet you need without that real struggle to try and get it. Ah. So that gives you your... See, if you're trying to cut pieces that are that big, that's a real struggle. Now, I'm going to do that again. Oh, they're pinging everywhere, aren't they? What I ha like yeah. What I haven't done, if you'll notice, this is flat one side and... Um, not flush on the other side burr. so you actually want to trim off the burr from the end before you do it so we're going to do that again pop that in so it means if you've got multiples and i'll show you um if you've got several different leather different um uh, layers that you want to do together so you might have four layers of, of one mil wire that you want to do well that's a different it doesn't matter because you put all your layers on and that will still give you off. how much you need. So when you take it out, if I show that to Adam there, you can see you've got a little bit top and bottom. Yeah. Yeah. You then put that in the relevant domey bit. Okay. And then we're going to hit it. Now... <laughs> they're going mad Sounds excited about this but yeah 
So, so traditionally, when you did, let's just go back to our drawing a little bit, put it that way up. So to, to get this, what would happen is you'd hammer all the way around the edge. So you hit your hammer to spread it out mm. rather than just hitting it top. So you then have to get a dome is really quite hard mm. without this. Because you've got the dome in there, then it's easy to do. Oh, so it's but, like a mould. It's like, it's like a mould. Yeah. So this will form... But what you don't want to do is just go wallop, 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 okay? This is something that you want to take time over. Okay. No walloping. Right. Okay, so I'm just going to make sure it's locked in there. Okay, little taps. Okay, then you're going to take it out and turn it round. Okay, little taps. Okay, now you can see there's a little bit of dome on each side, okay? So decide which side you want top, top on because that's the one you want to really finish with. Because okay. when you tap it, and you can tap it with the flat or you can still tap it. So you can still work your way round if you want. Turn it over. And that's how you create. So what you're doing is spreading that metal. So the closer to the side of the metal you can go you, so you can see now this is still mobile yeah. so if you wanted it to that would loosen off because you've still got if you look if you look at that sideways can you see that dome there you can see that really yeah, quite good shape. can't you but you've still got quite a bit of space there mm. okay so you could still go a lot that's that's quite um and it's protruding smooth, still so it's not going to catch on but anything that's, that, i mean you run your finger over there it's it's lovely. It's like a little mushroom on top, which is why I love these. So if you want it with a with a bigger gauge or a, or a bigger bigger spread, you just go onto the next size up, lock it into place. Where are you? There you go. I'm going to turn that over. Right now that is locked in place. Perfect. It's not going anywhere. I mean, obviously you pay attention. Well, I actually quite like that. I might finish that and have some more doing different oh, ones cool. or you could do a circle. And you could, could play could, with it. Could you like, say you did a, like a, I don't know, say about seven inches of that. Yeah, yeah. Could you then put it round a, ban a, a, totally. a bangle mandrel Absolutely. and form it? How cool would yeah. that be? You can still use a torch on if you want to, to soften the metal up. Mm. Um, you can shape it. You can use this shape. So we're back to, to using the dome there. If you've got a curve on it, you can do it there and it, you'll still be able to use the curve. But it, for, for the ones where I had the rings, the little rings I made, mm. I did those flat and then curved the ring. Okay. But you could do it if you wanted. So you would rivet before the curving? Yes. Yeah. Because it's yeah. only because I could do it flat on there, pop that on, off I go, Bob's your uncle, it's done. Amazing. Okay, so so you can go to something. Now these are just some old pieces I've got. I just want to show you. So this we're going to go up a scale. I'm going to put those two on there so that I've got a two mil hole now. So I've got some two mil. Oh, and by the way, so that was using some plated wire. Okay. So so some it, of our wire. It's just wire. some of our plated wire. Okay. It doesn't have to be, um, you know bare copper or whatever if you've got your plated wire it will still work which i was surprised at so i'm going to pop these on if you do your hole too big what's going to happen is you've got to try and spread that that sheet a lot bigger now you see what i was saying before that's now a lot deeper than that little one you've got two little layers you've got a lot of bigger layers I'm going to trim that off. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So by the time I pop all these back on, that might still, I think that slipped while I was doing it. So that's a little bit big. So I'm going to pop that back in. Trim it back down. There you go. Now I've got, see, see how much excess I've got on there. Trim it off. So you'd do exactly the same process if you were using your tubes. You'd pop it on there and then you hammer it. 
So let's pop those on there. Flip it over. See, once you've hammered it a little bit, maybe not the first time, but certainly the second time, you'll find that, that they can't go anywhere because it's already, if you've got a nice tight fit, then it will already be, where's the middle? Then it's all, it, it'll already be um, too wide. Let me, I um, can't locate it now. Come on. So you were saying about having it so that they're still mobile. Yeah, that's cool. So I like can. that. I mean, I would knock that down a bit because that wasn't located. So that was against a flat surface. So that's the difference. Doing it on a flat surface. You know, we had the nice dome before and then you've just got a flat, which is quite catchy. Um, so I need to push that down in. But that's now actually not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing, what a tool. So you can do, it, it's a fabulous tool. So you've got all your different gauges, you've got your different sizes of wire, uh, a tube, and like I say, you pop your tube in, give it a, a knock each side, which locks it into place, and then move it up. And, and not a flame great. in sight. And not a flame in sight. So these are your gauges. Um, there's a conversion table. Um, if you want to get your gauges, I can never remember them. Um, I think it's 0.8 to one po uh, to two mil. I think okay. one point certainly looks well. Right um, mm -hmm. G is two mil, mm -hmm. um, and then you've got your gauges of those. So that's your that's that's around your your block. It's a fabulous piece of kit. It like I say, if you want to make necklaces, if you want to make rings, if you want to attach anything to things, metal to metal, it cold connections are brilliant. That's what they call cold connections because no heat involved. You don't have to heat it or anything. You just get a little bit of wire. You can use your wire from your stash. You can do um, down to down to your point eight if you've got a finer um, hole. Okay. So you want it to be, you know, you don't want to do point eight wire with with a hole that size because no, no. you're not going to spread it enough okay. it, 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 and it'll bend over. Okay. So we've also got um, this punch now. This punch. We'll bring the graphics live for that. The, the, the rivet tool, by the way, is now quite limited because there's a full call screen of names. Um, so on your screens right now is the riveting hole punch yeah. and it shows you the sizes as well. So it's got, it's got two different sizes. So these are a bit bigger size. But what I found with this, because I've also got, um, we had one, it's coming in. It's not here yet okay. with a smaller gauge. So... What have you got it? Oh yeah, it's it's not here. So keep your eyes out, and we will bring it as soon as we can. Okay. However, this also has a secondary use right. that I found. Two things. Um, you know, I talked about doing the come here piece of paper, doing the flush one. Yeah. To countersink it, you've got to have something going into the metal to countersink it. Okay. So. This, unlike, if I take this one, can I take it out? Don't forget these all come greased, and I never take the grease off the, the um, thing. So if you look at that, it's got a slight dome to it, and it's got a little bit locator in the middle. Can you see the little, little locator? Oh, yeah, yeah, the yeah. The yeah. locator in the front. Now, what happens, I'm going to put that back in. So if I put this in here, and I don't want to, I don't want to go all the way through. So what I've done, can you see how I've countersunk? Yeah. yeah. So if you're doing if you're doing something like a point eight or or heavier with the bigger size, you can counterpunch it. Put a little hole in the middle, or you can count upon it after you've uh, done your hole because you've got a bit of locator. And what it means is you'll be able to then do them flush. So you keep hammering until it's flush, and then okay. you can just file across the top, and that's it. It, it. it it basically disappears. So if you do a copper, if you do a copper rivet in there, 
it will you 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 can make it disappear because okay. you you've got it flush you get the finest of line around it and that's all you're going to see you won't fit yeah absolutely you don't you don't see anything so you can have different ideas so you can have the dome one it, it does do the bigger holes it will punch through it um so yeah, it will and still if you're do working that. with your things like your copper sheet to actually be able to punch a hole even well, if you're not just riveting if you're not riveting with it i find these are great Nice come Bales, on you I will guess. come round yeah and obviously to do this without yeah. uh, something like a dremel oh absolutely um okay we have See, seen that gives you the that gives you the counter punch really clearly oh yeah 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 yeah. i that's mean amazing. that's actually quite a nice decorative thing it is anyway. yeah i like that and this is really thick plate yeah it's a thick thick sheet of uh, copper now yeah. we have seen this elsewhere um it might be a different brand i'm not entirely sure anyway that does exactly the same thing, yeah. effectively. Uh, 19 pounds and 96 pence on Cooks and Gold. You know that producer Tom Neary has got a better deal yes. up his sleeve, don't you? Always. Yeah, oh. that's it. I told wow. You, if you work with, and again, I guess the con uh, same conversation about cross-contamination, if you work with silver and yeah. copper, then I would have one allocated specifically. To clean this would be a nightmare. Mm. Absolute nightmare. I'm just going to do And that really applies one. if you um if you sell your jewelry or you know you don't yeah. you don't really want copper in your silver and vice versa. If you have it assayed, if you've got your silver and have it assayed, it can affect. Yeah. Absolutely. It can affect your 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 um assay. Okay. So here it's we go. Quite a lot bigger hole that you've got. Wow, 12.99 it's been ages since I've seen this tool. Yeah. A long time. And again, you think that could be a nice bale that could be I was somewhere say, to yeah. attach your cords to. Yeah, absolutely. You can put a, a chain straight through there and, yeah. and you know, yeah. or a cord or whatever. Uh, watch this space for the smaller size, yeah. but it's definitely worthwhile getting all of the bigger as well. Oh, so gosh, yeah. Three, especially twelve ninety nine. goodness me. It's amazing. It's not just about punching the hole. No, yeah. Yeah, you know it's like, I because I I was I was blown away because I was like oh I can countersink them now, which Amazing. was fabulous. So I'm gonna take that out just so you can see the difference between the two. There's the two different sizes there straight away. Um, have we got quantity? Okay, sorry I went quiet. How many have we got? 150 chances. Wow. New size in the pipeline. Yeah. Get hold of the six, uh, sorry, this opportunity, 3.2 and 4 millimeter. Again, for not just riveting, you can use this with your metal sheet. Use it with your metal sheet. You can use it for, um, if you want to lace. Oh, yeah, yeah, so if you want to say use leather or, or cord to lace things together, nice. that's that's great. If you want a bigger bale, a bigger hole for your, for your bale to go through. <gasps> Using it with chain mail because you can chain mail onto this and you wouldn't be able to on a smaller one. So you could put several bits into yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you could chain mail onto it, which Nine is pounds fabulous. £9.99. Really? So we're half the price of what it is on Cooks and Gold. Oh my gosh, How that's amazing fabulous. is that? How incredible. Wow. But uh -oh. the quantity that we had was 150. Oh, okay. Over half the stock's yeah. gone. There we go. So they are priced to sell yeah, out. We've yeah. got the new size imminent. Hello, Kathy. Um, I just love these types of hole punches. No yeah. strength needed. Absolutely. Which normally, or drills either. Because similarly to what we were saying about riveting, yeah. some people are a bit scared of a drill. Uh, absolutely. The worst thing about drilling, trying to drill a little hole, if you haven't got your, your um, small punch yeah. in there, it skitters all over your sheet. Yeah. And before you know it, you've got scratches and yeah would take ideal. forever whereas, to polish yeah. out whereas that and you can be great. really precise with something like this can't totally you? totally because if you if you look at them you can see you can see through it so you can see down there if you clear out the previous ones so your your <laughs> your bits stick 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 in there and then they'll work their way out but you can mm. pro pro push those back out yeah and you could actually, what I usually do is mark the back and center it like that. Yeah. And then, and then you know exactly where you're putting that punch hole. Yeah, absolutely. So you can do it randomly or you can do that or you can, you can mark the top and gauge it from there. It's just 
great pieces of kit. Perfect. And you, oh, go on. No, no, no. I was no. just going to say the amount and type of jewellery you can make is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Phenomenal. But doing things like that bracelet where you've got that um, different different layers. So that you can make out of this copper sheet. And this is a, quite a thick piece of yeah, copper yeah. sheet, isn't it? So, it's so point 0.8. Point 0.8, and that's obviously referring to the thickness of it. But again, you've got a 10 centimetre square. Sheet. So obviously you'd work from the um, outside in. Yeah. Obviously capitalise on the precious metal. Let's not forget, copper is a precious metal. Exactly. Yeah. Let's, and it's let's, expensive. Let's not, let's not forget, I kept all my bits and pieces, or well, I still do, and I took them to the scrappy and got £118 for them. This is the thing. I remember here at Jewellery Maker, copper used to be really expensive. Yeah, yeah. The sheets especially. Um, okay, so we bought this back in 2020. And then as it sells out, we, re you know, rebuy, reorder. Yeah. Should we do a lowest ever price? You're kidding. You've got to remember there is, this is like, you know, this stuff it's done is, per, this it's stuff done is per gram weight, like your silver yeah. and your gold, etc. It's structural. Yeah. This you, is... can, you can heat this, you can bash it if you want, you can shape it. So if you wanted to make a bangle, yeah, that's really... and you've got pieces like this, you can, you can link them all together. Yeah. So you can link these all together. And just have a bangle That's going cool. round like that. How amazing would that be? Should we do a lower seven price? Go on then. Okay. Have we got quantity? We have a hundred, but wow. you don't need your copper sheet. You yeah. Know, it's, you need your copper sheet to be working with your riveting tool. You're going to yeah. need your copper sheet to be working with the hole punch. Um, so if you want to multiply, you can. Lowest ever, brand new price for you all today. So the rings, I made the shanks out of the which makes sense because you need shape. the shanks you to actually the, have yeah. real strength um also if you want those lovely shapes we are bring it that's beautiful so beautiful Th and things like the feather yeah the feather's amazing it's cut out of it yeah absolutely amazing uh make sure you check it out everybody we had quantity did you say yes wow not as many as we'd like though uh no be be the sheet is great. So if you want more structural work, I love working with it all, um, doing different things. But if you're going to want, if you're going to want something more structural, if you're going to want to use it for ring shanks, your three point two, your point three two is not going to do a no, ring it's not shank. Your point four is not going to going to hold it. No, it'll buck if it. I fetch that, if I can just pick, so you can see, you get a really good depth. Yeah. To your ring shank shank. And look how and little so you've used out of that sheet there. Well, tiny amount. Sort of uh, that much. How many of those rings do you think you can make out of that copper sheet? So a standard, a standard um, presenter size finger, mm -hmm. which is usually about an end to... I've squashed that a bit tighter right. to hold it on there. Um, so that's two, in, two inches. Let me get a... Let me get a... Hang on. That's yeah, lovely, isn't they're it? Great. And those those little kits are coming up, aren't they? Yeah, we've got yeah, these components, the circle and the um, and the flowers as well. Two inches is five centimeters. Okay. So you're going to get two from the length, and they were half a centimeter, so twenty. So you could get forty ring shanks make out of one 40 sheet. 40 rings out of that one sheet. Out of sheet. one sheet. <gasps> if you're careful cutting, you can make 40. Depending on the size, but they are and adjustable the, as and well. And that's, that's a half centimetre, which I think that was about five five or six mil that I made. Amazing. So it's going to go a long way. You can way, make though. a lot. And it was a tenner for that sheet. Amazing. Brand new low price tag. So 10 divided by 40 rings. We're talking about the shanks. So 25p. Yeah. You can do the shanks for 25p. Which is crazy, Amazing. isn't it? You can make them longer if you want to make them longer. Yeah. Um, but I'd, I'd wear that size ring, so... Yeah, absolutely. Let's These bring you... Great. I love that flower one. Let's yeah. Do the, oh, um, I love them both. No, listen, I love them both. Um, let's do the flower one. A little bit Mary Quant. It's got definite Mary Quant vibes. Um, yeah, beautiful. In fact, you know what? I say Mary Quant. Every jewellery house in the world has got flowers in. Yes. Haven't Ab they? Absolutely. Much. The flowers will always sell. Yeah. Beautifully and textured. Lovely brushed, yeah. Oh, I love lovely. a brushed finish. I really do love a brushed finish. Uh, so you've got what the base metal, silver plated. And sterling you've... silver. Eh? 
So your biggest one is sterling. That's silver? Yeah. So you've got a sterling silver one, a base metal one, um, and a, a bare copper one. Oh. Which is why I split them up a bit. So you'd put that in a silver one? Yeah, that I made the individual little one. Oh, my goodness. So that's your sterling. If you wanted to, you could use sterling wire as your, as your peg. Now, I don't know what near is taking these two, but seriously, for the amount of silver that's in there. <laughs> um, yeah. Did um, you not realise a bit of it was sterling? I should have kept my mouth shut, shouldn't I? I Sorry, guys. He says it's not going to change anything. You're still going to do that amazing price point, folks. Really? Yeah. First, what? You've got sterling silver yeah. in this as well. The big flower is sterling silver. Yeah, yeah, not the little one, the biggest one. I was a bit confused because I looked at the graphics and it says, look, brush finish, base metal flower, um, nine millimetre, base metal brush finish, silver plated flower. Yeah. So you've got one of each, basically. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then you've also got your brush finish, 925, sterling silver flower, 20 millimetres, that one. So you've got one of each. Yeah. We're starting at 14.99. I know, I know. So, and, and there's absolutely no difference to soldering sterling silver to sterling silver, copper to copper, brass to brass, or mixing them. The process exactly the same. The only, like I said, the only thing I would do is if I was doing sterling to sterling, I'd want a separate block. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. So, yeah, Ooh, absolutely. I'm gonna shock you. Oh. I'd, 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 I, don't, I don't get what, how. But wait until you see this. Do you know what I think? We've looked at wow. this. See what's on the graphics there? And it says base metal. Yeah. That's what I think I, we've looked at. That. So, so your pendant there, six ninety nine. Wow. Pop it on one of the sterling silver chains. I've got no problems with mixing my sterling silver with the copper. Because um, that's, again, a little piece of the copper sheet, sheet that I've, I've soldered on. And then all I've done is rolled it down at the top. You don't have to solder. If you don't want no. to, you just don't have to solve that. that on its own, yeah. 925 sterling silver would not be 6.99. No. Because let me turn it around, it's thick. Yeah. You've got a big gram weight there as well. Yeah, absolutely. Do you know what, you could set a little gemstone in there, couldn't you? Oh, you could if you wanted, or a, yeah, yeah. Or put a head pin, like a flat head pin or yeah. a round head pin to yeah. little stud earrings. Well, totally. Not, not so little stud earrings. If you wanted to, which I nearly did, you could just cut slightly down each of them and then twist them up so you get a bit more shape in your yeah, flower. Lovely. You could put that in a doming. Oh, yeah, I should have done that. Doming blocks? I've got I've got the flower one at home. Oh yes. Should have put it in the flower doming block. Get then you get that texture. Yeah. And then hammer it. Now all I'd say with if you if you're using doming or like the one where I've done the little cup is you want a smaller hammer head. Yeah. Cuz cuz this I used I used a little one or you want to use um your doming tool and hammer that in it because otherwise you just end up flattening what's outside of it yeah so you need something suitable to fit inside and yeah. you're not going to be able to use the doming one with the block because you can't do both but amazing i can't believe we're at 6.99 i know and that's for the silver silver plate and then base metal, base metal. amazing which looks brass to me yeah well they're absolutely flying out the door yeah. i think we've made a fairly big error there I, 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 get, yeah. I can see how they've made that mistake, though, as well. But people are buying five. Oh, I'll make the most of it. It's so Sunday. You could, you could solder those and make a cuff if you, if you did it. So you could make a cuff of flowers going yeah, around. Lovely. Lovely. So cute. Neary says he's, he was completely complicit in that mistake, by the way. He probably recognised it, just did nothing to sort it. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. You know what? It's all good. It's all good. Last Got one, one. more um, to bring you as well. Oh, they're on their way to selling out. Congratulations. Fabulous. So if you love that ring that um, I was just wearing, is it? Oh, no. You know what's going to come, don't I, you? I kind of do. I know. I know what's going to. I know. Let me see. Oh, <laughs> fantastic for you. Fantastic for you. So let's read it again. Brushed, finished, base metal round. Yeah. One in the middle, nine millimeter. Silver plated brush base metal. Yeah. Yeah. 50 millimeter. 
Brush finish, 925 sterling silver, 20 millimetre round. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know what's happened. They've looked at the base metal, haven't they? Yeah, and, and, and just priced according to that. Mm, forgetting the fact that you have actually got... <laughs> and no, no, look, on the screens right now, it says yeah. base metal. There is silver in this. The biggest one is silver. Yeah. OK, well, listen... The phone lines are about to go crazy. Have we got quantity? Yes, it was the last one. Um, it's all good. We're going to stagger the phone lines oh just because God. we don't want to crash it just before the end of the show. Um, okay, you know what's happening. Make sure you check out your baskets. Karen's got five. Julie's got two. Claire's got three. Amazing. Sheila Gwyneth. Hello to you. Maureen, Catriona, Kathy. Samantha, amazing, Helen. And any questions that you have for our lovely Azataz? You've still got time to text in. I want to show you another usage I thought Please of it do. for. Please do. So if you can... 99. I dropped it, so I didn't finish it. Okay. So could you imagine you've got a cabochon? <gasps> I'm imagining. Right. So you've popped your cabochon. So I've punched a hole out. Yeah, I've then put it in a doming block to, to get that taper. I've put my cabochon in there. Yeah. And then I've riveted around there. How amazing is that going to look You're doing design. like a rubbed over setting, aren't you? Yeah, kind of. That's, that's a bezel setting. Mm. You know, you've not soldered anything. And then you can just rev it. Just be careful that you don't, you know, obviously Hit smack the main stone. stone. But you can tap around and rivet it you know if you had that as a big circle and put one in the middle your your design is going to look sensational amazing idea i didn't finish it because um i was this is one of the last the one last ones i was doing yesterday oh do you know what good old-fashioned glue what's wrong with glue you could glue it together glue it in glue it together but i'd still rivet it because you, it's part a it's part of the design aesthetic mm. and b um it you know, the glue's never going to go anywhere. No. So you've, you've solidified that. So you've just, you've sandwiched it into there. Amazing. And again, it's another way to set your gemstones. You can, you can if, you're, if you're good with a saw, you can cut out any shape. Amazing. So, um, again, just for those of you that maybe have just tuned in, we, this is not just base metal, no. which is what our graphics kind of <laughs> suggest. Um, you've got brass, You've got silver plated base metal and you've got a sterling silver. So the one that's on the tweezers is actually sterling silver. silver. And I think what our team have done, bless them, Oops. have looked at the base metal and that and priced it in accordance to is it, it yeah, there's it is what's happened. And they did it with the previous components as well. Yeah. So and look, look, it happens. We're, we are human, we do make mistakes. <laughs> um um, like like you said earlier on, Neary, you know, it's like you're you're I'm totally complicit in this as well. Yeah. But he says if there's a deal to be had, there's a deal to be had. Hey ho. Absolutely. Um amazing. Six ninety nine, well done. We had hundred and fifty of these. There's lots of you capitalising on our era. <laughs> Love me. it. I don't blame you either. Um make sure you do check out your baskets. And I'm so excited to see like riveting designs. Oh it, it's such a great we don't get to do it very often. We kind of, we kind of um, sometimes focus on the, on the uh, soldering side of it. Yeah. But it's such a great design. Uh, it, it, and, it's, and it's something that's more accessible, I think, to people than the soldering is. Yeah, because soldering is, could be a bit scary. Can, yeah, it could be it, a bit scary. I'm not saying everybody finds it scary, but obviously. But, you know, if you don't like the idea of working with naked flames, if you don't like the idea of working with... Well, molten silver, basically. Well, my house at home, the only place I have that's safe to do soldering is on our chest freezer in the kitchen. So it means I set it up, I do my soldering, I take it all down, then we can get our tea. Yeah. You know, it, yeah. It's not ideal. I don't physically have the space to yeah. have a soldering station. Yeah, I get that. Whereas this I can do on the dining table where I do most of my work, so long as I've got my steel block underneath to protect the wood, I can just, I'm off I go. Amazing, I've loved do it. it. And remember these Portable. tools, we believe, um, weren't 
on air since uh, 2020. So amazing and an incredibly pro incredible price tag. Have a little look at the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com, because if you can scroll down, we brought you some amazing wow. deals today. Lots of sterling silver components, which have been absolutely fabulous. There's those beautiful tassels. <gasps> Still got some um, the Olmec. Oh, yeah, we'll be jumping all over those, won't we? Yeah. Um, you've got those beautiful brand new colours of jade, uh, sold out, uh, sell out of your bangles, which are unbelievable. Oh, your paparazzi sapphire is still just about available. What was that, Clear Courts? Goodness me. Yeah. Um, sell out there, more sterling silver essentials for you as well. It's been, oh, I mean, Alison, your nine o'clock kits as well. They oh, were they amazing, were weren't they? Yeah, absolutely. absolutely incredible. And of course, down to your early birds. It's been fantastic. Have a little look at the website. Um, yeah, I, I'm back with you now on Wednesday morning. So I hope you have a wonderful couple of days. When are you back? I'm back next Saturday. Next Saturday? Yeah. Oh, not too long to wait then for our lovely Azataza. Have a lovely afternoon. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon and we'll see you soon.